Welcome back guys, I'm doing a full platinum speedrun now on Veg. I almost didn't do this, but I've been thinking about it probably the past week and I'm going to do it. So I'm hoping it's going to take, it's going to take between 6 and 7 hours I think. I'm going to try and push 6. This is my first time running the whole thing in a sort of platinum speedrun. Though I have speedrun every sort of, everything I'm going to do here I have sort of tried it all anyway. So... Get straight into this, um, cash roll. I'll try and explain a bit of it as we sort of go through the first area when we're walking through the ice. But I need to try and be quick. This isn't going to be like a, um, it's not going to be a, a tutorial per se. I will try and point out collectibles to you. Basically, this first playthrough, we're going to be doing knife only, knife only, um, knife only, no healing. I might get a speed run, I might not. The best I've done a knife only on the new game is 3 hours 36 seconds. 3 hours 36 seconds. So, yeah, very close. So, I might manage to speed run, I might not, but not to worry, because if I don't, I'll do that in Village of Shadows anyway, because that'll be a sort of, that will, that will be a speed run. Now, this yellow ball, I'm going to leave that for that trophy, and we're going to do that in the next playthrough, because the trophy time starts from when you pop your first trophy, so I don't want to pop that just yet. So I'm going to get these two files first, laptop file and the draw. There we go, draw file. And the the current record for this, I'm going to go by PSM profiles, trackers, it's pretty good. I'm going to go by that. The current record is 11 hours, 11 hours. Yeah, I've got another file here, file number three. Yeah, it's 11 hours, but there's... that. Well, it's 11 hours, the so one that looks the most legit. There's two other people that have done it before that. Um, quicker than that even. One's done it in 7 hours 20 and the other is about 8 hours. But they don't look legit to me. They don't look legit. So I'm not counting them. And there's another file. Right, it's going to talk to me here. It's what's cooking, baby. It's probably cooking the same as always. Cheese and ham sandwich. My favourite. Yeah, see, um... Yeah, there's three, the three fastest achievers at the moment at PSM Profiles. The first two do not look legitimate because the first one is done at seven and a half hours. He's popped both the crafting trophies before he's popped any other trophy. And that's completely fake. That's hacked. There's no way you can pop that because you have to complete the game on Village of Shadows before you can even get every recipe. And he's popped it literally first before everything. So that's impossible. And the second guy... Um, yes, yeah, so I'm just waiting for the snow now. This literally, literally takes two minutes. The second guy, he's he's popped the Village of Shadows trophy difficulty about 15 minutes after popping Casual trophy. So he sort of played through the game on Casual. He's popped a lot of trophies like him. I think he's done knife only. I'm not sure if he... No. Um, he's gone through in Casual. He's popped a few trophies there. And then an hour later, 15 minutes later, he's popped the Village of Shadows trophy. And that's, that's just not possible. You know, you can't speed run the game in 50 minutes. And he, he popped some other trophies before that anyway. In the meantime, so... Yeah, I don't think the first two are real. So, the current fastest achiever, which looks legit, is 11 hours. So, I'm hoping I can completely destroy that. Um, obviously, this is all recorded, so you can see it's all legit anyway. But we're going to be doing, yeah, knife only. No healing. We'll be doing 100% on this one. Uh, that means like map and petition, the full map, uh, it'll mean all files, or ghosts, or outhouses, or windows, we'll get all the attachments, a few other things. There will be a bit of prep for Village Shadows, like I'm going to try and keep the, um, oh we'll be doing Frugal Father here, it's where we spend less than 10,000, that means 9999 or less lay. So that right, four nines, yeah, 9,999 lay, you cannot spend any more than that, otherwise the Frugal Father trophy will not pop. I tried it on 10,000 once by buying the um, the upgrade, the first pouch upgrade inventory, but it didn't work. It voids your trophy. It's got to be under 10,000. So the title's a little bit misleading for that. Um, what else can I say before I get going? Yeah, I just got to take this time before things start <laughs> before things start getting um, fast. And I have to keep an eye on what I'm doing and stuff. Just take a moment to explain it. Yes, and yeah, free go father. Um, yeah, going into Village Shadows, we want to make sure we've got the Magnum on us and the Grenade Launcher. 
Otherwise, it'll be very difficult to kill Urias at the start on Village of Shadows difficulty. And, ah, that's what I was going to say. Yes, yeah, so um, normally, I mean, people normally do, they normally do their story playthroughs first, then most know it's last. But I'm going to try and break this up a bit. I'm going to try and go against the norm. I'm going to do this playthrough. And then we're going to do mercenaries, and then we're going to do village shadows after that. I think I just split this down nicely, you know, rather than two playthroughs back to back. Yeah, because this will be two story playthroughs and then mercenaries, and that'll be a platinum. In order to do it two playthroughs, so you have to do knife only on your new game. So, yes, you have to do that. You can do it, it's possible, and 100%, and get close to three hours. But it means some fight's going to take a long time because you've got that shitty little um, plastic knife to knife like um, the bosses with and it can be your finger can get sore let's put it that way yeah your fingers get very fucking sore I think there's there's a few battles where I have to keep I literally have to keep switching fingers yes yeah, so really have to get some good finger control going on some of the bosses here right so about to get going about to get moving so if you're gonna follow this along or just watch if you're just watching I hope you enjoy guys um, yeah, I'm just hoping it's nice and fast as well. I don't want to take, I don't want it to take too long. Um, but yeah, but if you're also watching to follow this, I do have other guides, a lot of other guides for this, by the way, and they are more beginner friendly. They do take longer, but they're more beginner friendly. So if you're looking for a sort of beginner guide, you may want to check them out, because when I do mercenaries here, it's going to be very difficult to follow. But if you are want to get through this first, you can follow. You can follow me for the. Village of Shadows, uh, well for, for, for this playthrough and Village of Shadows, you can follow what I'm doing, just some mercenaries, for mercenaries you'll definitely want to follow my beginner guys, that can be quite difficult. Wow. Right guys, I think I've explained everything, now I need to try and focus here, so yeah I will talk as well, I'll try and point out the files to you but I need to try and focus, first of all I'm going to do photo mode, yeah let's make, let's make that our first trophy, that's outhouse number one, let's go. Yes, my last knife on the new game. I have 36 seconds. So I've got to try and make a bit of time up here. Let's make that. We'll sell it. Yeah, we're going to sell all this crap quickly through here. And we'll grab the bolt cutters. Skip cutscenes. Pausing and everything does pause the timer, but cutscenes do not. Well, I'm just going to block him, kick him away, get pushed, comes to shove. Grab the bolt cutters. They'll despawn him. Right, let's cut the padlock off. Quite experienced doing this now, cutting off padlocks. Didn't quite. No, I'm not a thief. Um, I just mean in regards to Resident Evil. I've cut a lot of padlocks. Sometimes the third person, sometimes the first person. Right, hang on, bullets. Right, you come up here, then you run back down, and it normally triggers the next guy to spawn. I'll grab them, sell. So. Right, so knife only, got to quickly kill this punk. If you block in between slashes, by the way, two slashes block, it recovers quicker. Two slashes block. And it will take more damage if you hit them in the head. But it can be tricky. I just spam it like this. Right, we've got him. I'll loot him. And that's it. Go on. <laughs> Go on. Never come back. Is it over? Right, it's over. Far from it, Ethan. Okay. Well, we need to go hospital. Fucking fingers missing. Right, so it's got to trigger these guys now, these punks. So normally you can shoot them to trigger them, but I'm just going to head in here and grab this loot anyway. So this sequence, it normally takes, that's like a hidden timer. It will take about four minutes and you cannot make it go any quicker. So you just got to survive for like about four minutes. Oh no, forgot the items up there. Yeah, all I do, I just run around the map. By the way, you do get sort of three or four full heals in the game automatically. And the recipes that are Duke, you can actually make food with the Duke, and they do not count as a heal. Scrap, you can actually heal four times without voiding a trophy. But the salads do not count as one of them four times, so you can, they're, they're like free heals. And also the automatic story heals are free as well. Just make sure you're always blocking enemies. Always block them. And do not try and kill these guys with a knife if you take too much damage. And if you take too much, it doesn't matter because... Because um, shortly after this bit, probably like five minutes after, we'll be entering the castle. And um, when you enter the castle, you get free full heal as well. Now, obviously, I can't... I can't um, 
shoot the enemy, so avoid the knife only. This is knife only run. But you can shoot explosive barrels and that doesn't void the trophy. And there's a trophy for actually killing three enemies with a barrel. So I'm just going to do that now actually. Just while, while we have to wait four minutes. So I'm just going to keep blocking, wait for three of them to get close to this. And then kabloom. Kablooey. Yeah, it's going to be a little red explosion. Right, you guys ready? There you go. Oh, oh no. Only two of them died, you lucky thing. Okay. It's not a big deal if you don't get that trophy. I mean, there'll be plenty of chances later on. I mean, you got this one in here as well, which I'm going to use. So, let's just pour that over there for a minute. Oh, I just changed my underwear now. Right, there we go. That's all the loot. We've got all the loot now, guys. In this um, ambush area. That's it. Come in. I'm changed now. Come into my humble abode. Right, how many enemies are there? So, as soon as I get through, I'm going to send them a little message. What happens when they mess with Ethan Winters. Oh, there we go. We got it. Strategist. Yeah, the enemies, they, they don't really drop much lay on this difficulty, by the way. Casual. So, I wouldn't worry too much about looting the enemies. I mean, if it's a strong enemy, of course loot that. But the, the truth is we will not be killing many strong enemies with this little plastic knife. Unless we have to. Unless I really decide the need to kill something. Because sometimes that does, that sort of feeling does overtake my desire to get through a game quick. Sometimes I just feel like killing something, you know. Right, this guy, he's going to try. I'm going to use him to kill. We're going to use a bit of teamwork here. When your enemy becomes your friend. Thank you. Well, he killed one of them. Oh, Crystal Skull. You sell them, by the way. Yeah, you sell them to the Duke. Oi, where's he going? I'm here. Come back and fight like a man. Like a wolf. Right. Where's Kate Beckersale when you need her, eh? Selena. Lichens, they're alive. The bloodline lives on. Alright, it's this hammer combo. He's a right beast with that weapon. Alright, oh, loot him. Look at him. I just put my knife in the air so you can see it, and he's scared now. Running scared. Oh shit! Did I drop an arrow and it landed in my leg? Now this is the part, this is the um, end of the four minutes. Right, so there we go. Not liking this. I am not liking this. It's one of Ethan's one-liners. Right, so I'm skipping the cutscenes. Remember, if you watch cutscene, the time lives on. Right, file there. File. And uh, come through it. I'm going to grab not hanging around. Let's get out of here. Right, I'm going to get a bit of treasure here. There we go. Thank you, Crystal Fragment. Look at that. File. Yes. Goat. Bet. Yeah, the goats. It doesn't matter if you shoot them. It is okay to shoot the goats. Right, green herb. Yes, thank you. Goat on the house. There we go. In here. And we'll get the maiden crest. Wow. And we'll get it. Where is it? There it is. Did I grab it? Oh yeah. I hate to end this at. Sometimes you think you haven't grabbed it because no prompt appears. But it's just because you're too fast. And the game couldn't keep up with you. So I think we've got we've got everything we need. We've got the file from in the first house on the left. We've got the... the yeah. There's a goat here by the way. Just up there. But we'll grab it on the way back. So all the enemies will despawn. Yeah I think we've got everything. I think we're good. Right. Let's go see what's up with these guys. You're good? Right. Let me go and get some... Let me go call for help. Gunpowder, I take that. Outhouse here. Yes, and the chem food inside. Right. Can I beat my record on this? Like I say, the, the fastest I've done knife only new game is three hours and thirty six seconds. That's literally thirty six seconds off the record. Right, we'll get that. Right, make a save. I'm gonna make a few saves just throughout. 
if you if you look in this is PS4 version by the way and if you look into back up your game to PS5 later um so if first trophy was not liking this oh no it's push comes to shove shouldn't ah fuck I should have left that shit yeah because the time doesn't count until you get your first trophy and I meant to make not liking this my first trophy but I fucked up I looked at photo mode didn't I okay I've probably lost about five minutes on my um, platinum time there green herb here we'll grab that ammo quickly to sell all this ammo, we're doing knife only, but I will sell that. Right, get the screwdriver. There we go. Damn, the fire's moving and right, let's see if this baby starts. The only thing is, when you do knife only on new game, you can't actually see if you've voided the trophy or not. Like, when you do it, when you complete a game for the first time, you unlock the challenge menu. And when you've unlocked that, you can actually see in your counter then whether you've actually used a knife or not. Because it counts literally every attack it will count. Like, we'll finish the game, it'll say like 10,388. That's how many times you actually damage an enemy without a knife. So, it is good for that. Yeah, that's the bad thing about a new game. You do not know how long you've taken, unless obviously you look at a save. You save a game, then it tells you. And you do not know if you've actually used your knife or not. So... Right, we've got the demon crest. Who's there? Chris Redfield. <laughs> so I live and breathe. You killed Mia. Right, grab her. Oh yeah, shit, fuck. Right, goat guys. Almost forgot this. Goat just up there. There it is. Did you see that? I hope you did. Yes, yeah, so there's that there's that goat. With that file on the chair in the Weezer's house, remember? When we just went in. I think I mentioned that. I think I did. Right, just leave the old ag, she smells of dirty farts anyway. She's always farting. Yeah, that's what she loves like that after she's farted. Told you. Right, no, Maiden Crest goes in there. Come on, Ethan. Get it together. Right, Maiden Crest goes on the Maiden's body, and the Demon Crest goes on the Demon's body. Of course. Should have known that. Right, I'm not shooting the crows, because... It's really easy to get a crow trophy on when you've got a grenade launcher. Basically, you just lob a you just lob a flashbang, and if they're in the sky, they're all dead. So, yeah, much easier to do that when you have a grenade launcher. So we'll be leaving the five crows, shooting down five crows. We'll be leaving that for a new game plus. Right. Well, well. Pull this contraption down, Heisenberg. The man is of no real use to anyone else. Shut up. I'm going to kill your daughters now. This man, who is no use, is going to fucking slaughter your daughters. Woman. Run for your life, he says. Right, yeah, you can't. I wonder if anyone's actually died on this sequence. I mean, even on Village of Shadows, you have just so much time to do this. Okay, the ceiling's coming down. I am, that's right. Chris Redfield does underestimate me, but that will be the end of him if he's not careful. He can punch boulders. I can put myself back together like Humpty Dumpty. Right. I can also do that. Anyone else? I just rip their arms out of sockets. But no, not Ethan Winters. Not Mr. Winters. The mold man. Alright. For lords. Sounds like a Dark Souls trophy. For lords have been banished. Well, I hope they don't fall down. The traps are above my head. You saw them, the spike, little spiky things that are pointy on the end. Right, let's open it. Use your left hand, Ethan. I've told you about that in previous playthroughs. Right, let's go and see the Duke and get a goat. And also get a green herb. Yeah, so there's a goat over here. 
And um, there she is. That was Meredith. Meredith the goat. Yeah, they've all got names. That was Meredith. We've already killed Charlie and Oscar already. Oh, and Sally. Yeah, we've killed them already. Right, so um, we're not going to be buying any upgrades. So if Thomas see the Duke, we're going to sell loads of crap. We're going to sell loads of crap. So sell that. Sell that. I always keep a stack of handgun ammo on me. Sell the shotgun ammo. And I'm going to sell the, sell the shotgun as well. Yes, I'm selling the shotgun, guys. Right, we're good to go. I look forward to seeing the fruits of your exploration. Yep, yeah, I'll show you my fruits, all right. I've got two nuts, you can see. That's not a fruit. Right, going to get a file on the left, straight away. Ooh, what's in this castle? Yeah, it's got a file there. Did you see it? I hope he did. That's pretty fast. Right, yeah, so I'm only collecting things that I pass right by. Because... Yeah, I need to try and make I need to try and make back 36 seconds. That's assuming I'm as quick as what I was before. Right, quickly look at my hands, see how painful it looks, and then we're gonna examine it. I've got a, a breather now, I've got about 60 seconds to wait. Can't skip this cutscene. Capcom want you to see the pain that Ethan endures. Right, I think I left half my hands somewhere. Wow, first aid med. No lid. Oh no, it's got a lid on it. I hope it's check this expiry date first, Ethan. No. Oh yeah, first aid med. It never goes. It never expires. It's magical. Aliens brought that down. Crimson glass. Right through here. Yeah, predators on this planet. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Get in the fireplace, Ethan. You're good at going through these. You learn it in number seven. Yeah, that's a ancient healing item that Predator left down here. First aid med. Used by gods. Right, grab that rusty scrap. I'll do that. Why not? Maroon eye ring. Hmm, let's examine it. What could a maroon eye ring have inside? Oh, a maroon eye. Don't believe it. Wow. Didn't think I would have found a maroon, a maroon eye in a maroon eye ring. Wow. Learn some every day. Right, where's my weapon? Yeah, crystal fragment. Remember, you can shoot glass and stuff, but you cannot shoot. Yeah, you can shoot glass and stuff. Well, I'm going to open that. Fuck. And I'm going to, yeah, I'm going to talk to Duke in a minute. You can shoot glass and goats, you just can't shoot enemies. You cannot shoot enemies. Right over here, uh, it's a crystal fragment up there. Got it. Yes. Right, maroon eye. Right, let's put in maroon five on there. Yes, it's a maroon eye, Ethan. Acting like he's not seen one of them before. Come on, everyone's seen a maroon eye before. Fuck, I'm not being cut open. No way. I love my stomach. I love my headless body. Right, down here into the dungeon. That's a file, wow. And uh, there's a rusty scrap down here. And there's Dimitrescu. Don't shoot her now. <laughs> it doesn't do nothing, but imagine if it actually voided the knife only trophy. It's going through a little mouse door now. Right, hanger bullets. Yes, I'll take them just in case I need them. Round here, and crystal fragment. Got it. Right, let's go down here. Let's shoot the lantern. Just hope this bullet don't ricochet and hit me in the head. Oh, I ain't got a head, so I don't have to worry about that. Wow, one bullet. Right, let's go even deep into the dark dungeons. Is there any light bulbs around here? Ah, a file. In here, and be another file. Right at the end there, there we go. There's not really anything to collect in here, item-wise, that I really bother. I mean, there's a few items, like rusty scrap. Please let me pass. Oh, okay. Don't worry, I blocked it. Oh, right, I've got a knife on the door just in a second. I'm ready. I'm ready. I've got what I need from here. Two files. 
believe Cassandra caused all this. Oh no, mess. Cassandra's such a messy bitch. Well, I got a shotgun bullets, chem fluid. Right, let's go. You need to make sure you keep hold of some of these crafting ingredients because. Oh. Yeah, because she will. Um, Right, you can actually shoot this and it's done her as well again. And that's actually one of the windows we have to shoot, by the way, to kill Lady. Um, trophy for shooting all the windows in Lady. Well, in Castle Demetrius, there's a trophy for smashing all the windows. Fucking, where are you going? Never. Got you. Right, get the handgun bullets. Yeah, so remember, make sure you smash that window just there. It's one of the windows required. Right, I'm just gonna get. I'm always gonna get the treasure from the um, bosses, but I won't get much else. Right in here, there's a file on the shelf. There we go, file on the shelf. Let's get this bottle of wine. My wife is dead. I'll celebrate later. No, I'm kidding. No, it's not for that. I would never say or do such a thing. Right, lock pick, let's get this opening one. Get this attachment, there we go, attachment for Lemmy. And um, equip, yes, there we go. Get a wooden angel statue. Right, let's do this now before I forget. Uh, treasure. Window. Window, yes, forgot about them before. Got a treasure just shut, uh, shut down. <laughs> Shot down, of course. Right, and see the Duke. Now I don't see a need. I don't need to see the Duke just yet. Right, I need to put a wine bottle in place. I right, grab that uh, chem fluid file. Um, place a wine bottle here. And then I grab the gunpowder. And then I might just grab the courtyard key after that. You know why? So I can enter the courtyard. Yeah, if you don't know what that's for, just um, the first word of the name of the item, that's where you use it. Right. Cassandra, look at this fucking messy course below. Your sister's pretty pissed with you. Right, courtyard key. Fly on my face. Right down here, there's a herb just on the right here. There we go. Probably didn't see that, but there was say herb there. I'm not going to collect the maps just because I don't even really use the maps now, so we're just not going to get them. Right, goes Demetresque. Let's follow her to her quarters. Let's go and spy on her. Spy, spy on her through the window. Right, window there, guys. Window there. And a window there, three windows up here. Right, there's a little puzzle. She's got a face, a lady. Um, she's she's got a face, a maid. And the beggars have to face the cowboy, John Wayne. There we go. And um, the next goat is down here, Sebastian. Seb. Seb is down here. Yes, yeah, so there's three windows here. We've smashed six windows so far, I think. Yeah, six windows. Remember, you can shoot a goat, it's completely okay. Right, get my knife out just so I don't accidentally use it. Rusty scrap there. In fact, I'm going to keep it out here because sometimes there's an enemy in the way and you're going to have to block to get by them. I'm going to get that handgun ammo. Yeah, because you might want to just block with this so you can actually kick him away. Rusty scrap there. Yeah, like this guy. Knock him out of the way. Oh, yeah. Yeah, because if you don't knock him out of the way, he, he sort of blocks your path he does. Oh, shit. Like this guy as well. When, ah, fuck. See, that's about 10 seconds I've lost now. Shit. Yeah. I don't know why I had my knife out. I meant to... I just tried going back to my pistol quickly so I can knock him out of the way. Right, it's so a herb behind me and 1,000 that room on the left. I'm going to leave it. Right, so that should be window number s window number seven, window number eight, and window number nine. I forget how many windows there is. I think it's is it nineteen. That's a file there, and uh, Dimitrescu's key. Oh, I actually forgot some windows. 
I did. I've got some windows. Fuck. Always forget some windows. It's in that hallway. Right, don't worry, I'll get them in a minute. Do your worst. Yeah, I've got the windows in um Yeah, fuck in the hallway. It doesn't matter because we actually we actually go near that way anyway when we um go upstairs. Or do we? Can't quite recall. And we get a free heal in a minute as well, guys. Right, so I'm going to lift that up. Ouch. Yeah, we. I think I do. Yeah, I think I can get near them windows in a minute. Right, I'm going to get my hand back. Really, should have come straight. I should have just ran straight past her. I, I think I keep thinking I'm on Village of Shadows and um, I don't want it to get any anyway close to me. Yeah, I should just run straight past her then. Would have saved about ten seconds. Well, I have to wait. For, well, shit. By the way, if she's if she's too far away, she actually comes through this that them cage that um, behind them bars. Yeah, if she's too far away when you come through here. She'll break through them bars there. Right, Dimitrescu's key, and I will grab the first mask. The Mask of Sorrow. <laughs> yeah, then windows I missed, I'll get him. We actually do sort of go in that, we do actually sort of go in that room. Well, I missed the windows. I think we do. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I got I go in the room next to it. I go in the room next to it. So um, Good. yeah, I think that'll be fine. Man, screw this castle. Yeah, screw this fucking castle. Yeah, basically, so I'm just gonna use the key there. Right, I'm just gonna block. Right, it's window here. Bang, bang, bang. Get them windows. Do not forget them windows, guys. Right, it's a file here. Up here, you got. Yes, yeah, crystal fragment. Got a window there, window there. And you've also got a window down there. And you got a file here. Did I get that file? Yeah, this file, make sure you examine it like that, otherwise, it won't count. And I'm just thinking now, I don't think it actually does take near that. So it's a file here on there. Make sure you examine it so it actually reads like so. Right, let's get this um, iron key quickly. Yeah, I always forget, I always forget one or two fucking windows. And looks like I'm going to have to run back over there now just to get them. Right, so um, I'll be back in a minute. So, um, two windows that I missed. Yeah. Back out here. This is going to waste about 10, probably going to waste about 10 seconds now. Yeah, it's that window there, guys, and that window there. Can't believe I forgot them. Right, back to the knife. We're going to grab that iron key on the way through. We'll grab some it an item there from fireplace, an item there on that chair. Let's grab that key, finally. Let's go. Yeah, so once once you get that key, that's when Dimitrescu... Well, she'll, she'll, be, she'll be up here. And... Um, yep, yeah, okay, I'm fucking... I'm, I thought I was stuck then. Right, Iron Insignia Key. Right, it's quickly killer. There are some shotgun rounds in this room, but um, yeah, I'll grab them quickly. There we go. So and then we'll pull this. Right. So you need to always, you need to pull that every time that lever falls back down. You need to pull it. Because I don't think you can actually damage her if there's no light coming in. Fuck off, just running away to read a book again. 
Okay, you can hear, you can hear when that lever goes back up. Now, where is it? Oh, there it is. Give me that necklace. The Duke will like it. Right, I'm missing with all my swipes. Oh my god, my actually well, my actually is so bad. Look, she she gets brave once once that goes back up, she gets brave. Where is she? But the top down swing a bit. She went really squeaky then, high pitched. Really? It's my nightmare. I'm sure some people have dreams about you, but not Ethan Winters. Why where is she? Oh yeah, shit, I need to go and pull the lever. Oh no. It's taking me ages to kill her. Ah, oh, finally. Oh, where's, where's some handgun bullets? Oh, there we go. I'm sick of bugs. I'm going to have to call the exterminator. Right, so here, um, window here. Should be one more window left. One more window left. Right, Mask of Joy. Through here, uh, shoot that bell. Alright, try not to miss. There's another bell here. There we go. Um, one up there. Little tiny one. Grab the handgun bullets. Right, up here. And... Um, Yes, got all the windows. Nice. There's the last bell. Hooligan. Thank God, I got all the windows. What's what's um, more nerve wracking? It's a bookworm trophy when you think when you forget a, a file or even a goat. A goat would be worse, but luckily I, I always get the goats. It's always the files that I miss. It's always one file or some windows. Why not? It's sort of always one file. I always remember about the windows in time. Right, so um, we're going to turn around. There's going to be a goat. Going to be a goat. This is Maurice. There we go. Maurice down. Over here, there's a file on this desk. There we go. And um, we're going to grab a sniper rifle now. We're just going to get a misc trophy now. We're going to shoot an enemy with this, but we're going to restart so it doesn't void the trophy. Okay, he's too close. He wasn't. Right, restart. We've got our trophy. Yeah, so once you killed one with, you can sort of see the distance there. The first one was, he was um, too close, but the one afterwards, the one after was far enough away. So you've got, to, you've just got to kill an enemy with a distance in the distance from a, yeah. The sniper weapon with a long barrel, sniper rifle, formerly known as. All right, so yeah, just keep running away from these guys. Sometimes I trip myself up and I can't remember if I've actually used my pistol by accident. Right, so um, there's a gem there. Well, a fragment of a gem, of a crystal. Yeah, when you try and keep track of everything, what you've done, and um, talk at the same time, it can be easy to um, lose track of what you've done and what you haven't. Alright, oh, let's go down the zip line. Oh, I've got to fucking fight. Fight, what's the face first? On this, after this, um, Lady Dimitrescu, when she turns into a, when she transforms, right, let's go and get that ladder down. No, do not climb up it, Ethan. It's quicker to drop down. Fucking hell, precious seconds wasted. You didn't even kick it down. Normally it's like a little animate. Oh, fuck off. Normally that's like a, that put me into red. There's normally like a little animation. It's because I took a damage from um daughter. Yeah, it's normally a little animation of him kicking the ladder down, but he seemed to just skip it then and just try to climb straight down it. Don't know why. So there's a crystal fragment there. Yeah, I managed to shoot it. So it's going to be Lady Dimitrescu now. We've just got to go upstairs. Straight through here, and there she is. That's why we unlocked this door earlier. So we've just come straight through here like this. Yeah, and um, just going to get the last daughter now. And uh, the last mask. And... A pipe bomb and a lockpick and a crystal and a ring. 
Right, uh, no, wrong key. That doesn't fit the lock, Ethan. The Dimitrescu insignia indicates it's the Dimitrescu key. Right, and shoot that down. There's a ring in there. Go over it in a minute, grab that. Grab that mask, grab that ring. There we go. Through here, and um, grab that rusty scrap off there. Shotgun shells, right, two pipe bombs. Quickly, lock pick and the animal school. Right, I'm gonna move that across. <laughs> and this pipe bomb, by the way, it doesn't void the tro. It doesn't void the trophy. Oh my god, a bloody! Yeah, don't don't stand too close to your pipe bomb. <laughs> my body. Oh, yeah. Yeah, if you can sort of hit, if you slash her in the head when she's about to attack, it does interrupt her attack. Like this. Okay, fuck. She's probably only got like three slashes left. Okay, a bit more than three. I meant three times three. Right, that's the last daughter done. Right, while we're waiting, let's just. Um, where is it? Examine. Examine that. Yeah, that first pipe bomb, you have to lob it to um, destroy the wall. And if you don't if you don't throw that, you can't actually damage her. So, it it doesn't actually void the trophy for doing it for knife. Because um, when I've had the challenge unlocked, the tracker, I have damaged her purposefully. And it just doesn't void it. I think you can't damage them until there's actually light coming in. I think that's why. So I'm going to put the animal score there. I should be able to get out with these. Uh, through there, they're going to make a save down here in a second. Oh shit! The entire bloodline of House Sumitrat is done. I'm just got stuck in between her cheeks there. We have got past. Right, so I'm just going to place all these masks, and we're going to go to the Duke, sell a few things, and save it. So we've got a save in the mansion if we need it. So it's Mask of Sorrow first. Then it's pleasure working from left to right, then joy, and then rage. Joy and then rage. I I would like to do this one in three hours. Yeah, there's a file here as well. You want to make sure you don't forget. File there. Come take a look. It's probably an easy one to get forget actually, because you, because you come in this room for something else, you you sort of forget there's a file in here. Right, it's going to sell all of this. I keep lock pick on me for now. I want to keep one stack of ammo. Get rid of the shotgun, get rid of the sniper rifle, um, we'll get rid of the pipe bomb. Yeah, that's about all we're going to keep. That's it. Right, let's just make a save now. What time we at? 39 minutes. Don't even know if that's good, if I'm normally ahead of that time at this point or not. Yeah, I'm not too, I'm not too bothered about time because... If I don't do it in three hours, then I'll definitely be doing it on Village Shadows anyway. It's just, I would just like, you know, for myself to try and do knife only new game in under three hours. Right, so this fight's going to take fucking ages. It's going to take ages, and it's, Looks like yeah, really annoying. So, we're just going to wait. If you go, if you go now, you're going to get damaged. You see I'm quite low in health, actually. Yeah, you will take damage. Right, so I'm just going to quickly grab this loot. There we go, and let's go. So, she's going to keep knife in the mandibles. Her weak point is on the top, but obviously you can't reach it. Whenever she goes really red, just run away quickly and then you won't take any damage. It's quite easy to avoid damage on this, as long as it, these two towers stay intact, or at least one of them. Because the flies can sort of damage you. You can't avoid them unless there's a tower still standing. Right, and we do want her to come through here in a minute to smash them. I can look like a stunder then. Alright. Yeah, when she gets here, she will tr she will not least down. So just make sure you get out of her way. Obviously, you don't get hit by a bit of rubble. Yeah, she has to knock these down. And um, I think these two towers on the end... Well, them two towers on the end... 
if you're standing too close to them, sometimes when she's flying about, sometimes she'll sweep down and destroy one of them. So really, when she's flying about, you want to try and stay away from them, so they stay standing for longer. So when she summons a fly, she can actually hide in them. So yeah, it's just going to be a case of this now, guys. Just um, knifing, and then when she goes red, get out of the way. When she gets all excited, just run away. Yeah, let's keep knifing. Okay, I thought I didn't think I thought it was going to do something else. If I'm honest. Uh oh, am I too close? No. Oh, there she goes, flying away now. Yeah, not really much you can do, obviously. I mean, what are you going to do? Lobby knife at her? Throw a knife? But then you're not going to have a knife. You're going to have to, like, judo slap her. So, yeah, all you can do is hide in these towers when she summons the bugs. Oh, shit, I was going to say, where are they? Right, one million bugs, let's start knifing. Right, as soon as they get away, get away from these two towers. As soon as they, that's it, they've gone. Get away from these two towers, so when she flies down, she doesn't destroy the two towers. Right. No, she didn't destroy that yet. Once the flies go, just get away. It looks like I've stunned her. Yeah, unfortunately, you just can't quite hit her, I don't think. I mean, yeah, you just can't quite hit her. You've got, all you can do is just keep attacking the mandibles. Right, hopefully she doesn't do that to one of the corner towers. Alright, she's flying away again. She's going to recover her stamina. Right. She'll either, sometimes since she's flying, she will just sort of dive down onto you. Sometimes she'll summon her flies. So until the flies get summoned, I'm trying to stay away from the two towers because I don't want them getting destroyed. Uh oh, yeah, when she goes to red, she's going to attack. And you can sort... Yeah, you can see where she's going to attack from like that. I should have blocked then. I'm just trying to keep away from them two towers. Right, where is she? There she is. Right, get out. Always make sure you're blocking when you're in the red. Always. You don't even get much chance of damage. I mean, look how much she's flying away. Alright, here comes the flies. The bugs. Right, get in my tower. It'll be much, it'll be much better to play. I mean, I... This does annoy me doing this, if I'm honest. Keep doing this all the time. This knife only new game. So it takes so long to kill him. I'm looking forward to actually getting this playthrough done. Village Shadows and um, Mercenaries will be much more fun. I'm actually looking forward to doing Mercenaries next. Yeah, because I have always done um, Village Shadows straight after. But I'm looking to do Mercenaries in the middle. Right, I'm going to block. Oh, I think she might have destroyed the tower. Oh, no, she hasn't. Uh-oh, quick. Just, just. Shit. Yeah, so remember, just keep blocking in between. Every two slashes, block. Because you'll um, slash quicker then. I think she's going to let him run away now. Why I haven't like knocked it down yet? I've normally sort of oh I haven't I knocked it down early on, didn't I? No, no, you're not going anywhere. Well,
Okay, I wasn't sure what she's going to do. Though. I thought she's going to do that charge. No, fucking just come back. You know, you know when she enters the last uh, sort of last phase because she'll say she wants more blood. She'll fly and then she'll say she wants more blood. So you know when she's going to enter the last phase. No, okay. Some of the, some of the fights don't take too long with a knife. Um, I'm just trying to think. Urias in the stronghold, he's not too bad because you can sort of knife him in two places at once and it makes him take like increased damage. Right, where is she? Oh shit. What's she doing? She's just fucking wasting my time. Oh, here she comes. Make sure I block this time. Well, I did block. <laughs> I didn't do a very good job of it. Still took quite a lot of damage. I'm just trying to keep away from the two towers. Alright, where is she? Fucking hell. This is why this fight, at least with every other boss, you can actually keep damaging them. Not fucking Dimitrescu. That's it, let me cut your vagina. Already? Fuck. This has taken ages. Whoa. Whoa. Close. Saw you coming. No way. She's obviously scared of my knife. I think I've hurt her. Well, I bet it's going to pounce, pounce up again. Yeah, here she comes. Oh, he didn't put me into red that time, though. Have I stunned her? Oh, I've knocked her down. All right, come on. Hopefully, it's going to be enough damage. Yeah, try it. Try it, sister. Check yourself before you wreck yourself. Have I got her? Is that it? She's going to talk about more blood? Come on, tell me. Tell me you want more blood. <laughs> yeah, tell me. No, okay. Fuck. Alright, this fight is taking ages. Now she's going to dive at me. Yeah, she got me. Couldn't quite get away in time. But the towers are still standing. Both towers are still there. Yeah, so I think I've gone way over. I don't think I'm going to do three hours. This fight's just taken way too long. I hate it when that happened. Why did I start? Why did she? I start behind her? It's, uh, that's why she's flying away too quick because I'm behind her. Alright, where is she? Where is she? Oh, there she is. No, why? Yes. Fucking hell. I want to see the terror in your eyes. Wow. This is taking so long, guys. It's never. I don't think it's ever taken me this long before. Wow, wow. Really? Whoa. Fucking hell. Wow. Alright, where is she? Where is she comes? Alright, die! Bloody hell, she got... I knocked her down quick, didn't I? You're joking! She needed about 10 more slashes! That's it. Wow. All that, just for 10 more slashes. Yes. Fuck sake. I knew because if you knock her down, she always gets up after about 10 seconds unless you sort of do the damage cap, which triggers her last phase. 
Yeah, if you trigger her, if you deal enough damage, well, if you dealt enough damage overall when she's knocked down, um, and, and she's knocked down, when you do that, the last bit of damage, she'll stand up earlier, and then she'll sort of fly away, and then uh, she'll enter her last phase. Right. Yeah, this knife, it... Yeah, so, um, fuck. What I'm doing, I'm staying to the left. Just stay to the left, and when she's about to attack, get to the right. Yeah, stay to the left, then when she's going to attack, go to the right. And this bit don't take too long, actually. And she'll go red again when she's about to attack. Amanda Ball will go red. Yeah, stay all the way to the left. And then just go to the right, which is going to attack. Okay, I didn't actually see a mandibles go red then. Don't know why. Oh, they're going red now, definitely. Ain't they? Well. Ah, see him go red then. I think I'm too close to him and that's why I can't quite see. Come on, she's taking so long to kill. Oh, okay, she's definitely gone red now. I uh, got her. Yeah, I think that took way longer, guys, than what I expected it to. Yeah, she normally dies much quicker than that. Yeah, that did pretty much suck. You're the one who's cursed. Right, flask. First flask. One off four. And I guess we're about... Just under a third of the way through. Just under a third of the way through this um, first playthrough. Like I say, I would have liked to have been further than this already, but she took way too long. So some fish down here. We're going to be collecting all the foods. Well, just about all the foods. There are, a f I mean, you do have a little bit left over. Right, it's going to get these quickly. Remember, it doesn't matter if you shoot the animals. Right, so make sure you get all the fish. Make sure you loot it. There should be three fish there. And they're right back. My knives, I don't actually dent fire the pistol. Right, skip that. I don't know why it puts you facing the other way. Right, let's get the winged key. Right, open sesame. Locked it, wow. Right, so we'll just go and grab a few things first. And, um. No, do not restart. Yeah, I'll just go and grab a few things first, and then we'll uh, make a move for the story. Slightly, yeah, just like a little diversion here, just to get some, get some poultry, uh, poultry, some fish, quality meat. Um, what's your other one? The one you get from the bluebird. Can't remember now. And there's a goat just on our left, just passing it now, but I'll get that a bit later. Getting now, you're gonna have like it's going for you. I'm just gonna come straight here because it despawns them. And um, normally when I normally when I make my way to Angie, I'm on about 54 minutes, I think. If I'm yeah, if I make a save before we go to Angie's, I'm normally on about 54 minutes. So there we'll see. I bet I'm on about 54 minutes now because she took way too long to kill. To way too long. Right, it's just so no, do not sell the fish. So that, so keep one stack of ammo. So that, yep, get rid of the sniper rifle. And yeah, we're good. Actually, I'll get rid of the fish as well. Yeah, okay, mate. I'll just give him the fish so we've got it ready. Oh, no, we can't. So you can't. You have to wait till you can actually craft stuff. Right, see what time we're at. 55 minutes. Yeah, I think I, I spent way too long killing her. Fucking hell. She just, she, 
I don't know why. Some she sometimes you just get really good with her. I think part of the fact she she kept landing on me and I was sort of in the middle of her, so it kept it kept triggering her to fly away much quicker. Like I say, if you near if you near the back of her, she don't she flies way quicker. Right, it's so a bluebird there, guys. And um you get a juicy game from there. Yes, yeah, so we'll grab that juicy game. Up here there's gonna be three fish here that I wanna get. Well, fucking hell. If I can hit it. Yeah, three fish. And then we'll make our way back. Right, so there's another file in here now that Chris left for us on his laptop. Right, and um, let's go and get the quality game. Oh, yeah, and the poetry. We'll go and get that. We'll grab this gunpowder. And there's gunpowder, as you see it, on this little roof. There we go, grab that on the way. Pat oh fucking hell, I got stuck. I got flipping stuck. Right, get these. Don't try and knife them, you'll fucking be running around for ages. Right, two poultry, yes, thank you. Right, we've got a goat here, haven't we? We've got a goat from here. And um so I'll get quality game. Yes, yeah, a lot of them flying enemies now. Right, got him. Quality meat, nice. Right, so I'm um, out here. I'm going to grab magnum ammo, handgun ammo, and the two explosives. Oh, and the treasure down here. And grab the weasel's necklace. That's it, and we're good. Oh, really? Fucking hell. I've only been bloody attacked. Right, and Louise's necklace, and actually, you can actually examine it, guys. You'll find the necklace stone inside, and then examine it again, and you'll find the key. We use that key much later. Bloody hell, I'm walking really slow now. You watch, I'm going to get bloody killed from behind here. Oh, no, I'm good. On casual, you recover so fast from uh, from red from danger. But on Village Shadows, it takes like two or three times as long. It takes ages on Village Shadows. I think it depends as well on exactly how much damage you went into danger. Two likes, sir. Don't mind me, guys. Yeah, I think it also depends on how much damage you actually take. So, um, you know, that puts you into danger. The further in, the t longer it takes to recover. Right, so in here, there's file there. Straight back out and uh, get our treasure. Wooden animal body. And um, it's an outhouse here. Uh, grab the wishes scrap from his side if I can. Now it's going to be lichen here. We want to kill this lichen. Yeah, just out here because if you don't kill this lichen, it will just run after you and it'll be a pain in the ass. So just block and then start knife. Knife away. Well, he died pretty quick. Okay, outhouse here, guys. Another outhouse. Right, and quickly head up here. There's another outhouse just down here, guys. Don't forget this one. You can get, you can actually get that one at the start of the game, but I always just get it. I always just get it then. Get it now, even. Right through here and um, in here. All right, guys. So the code for this is 05. No, sorry, 07. Yep, sorry, 07. Looking at the wrong number. 07, 04, 08. Shit, what am I doing? 07, 04, 08. I'll get it in the end. There we go. 07, 04, 08. You'll get a jack handle and another pistol. Wow, good one. We'll sell that other pistol that we have now. And we'll keep this one. Right, jack handle. Right, she's got that. We're going to run straight for the tractor. And, um... Run straight for the tractor and use jack handle to lift it and then we're quickly going to get underneath and then should despawn all them enemies they do get you can see they do get quite close to you but once you get under here you're safe very very safe right it's going to be a pig in a minute and um, we're going to kill this pig if you're not quick he will charge at you by the way and it will sort of run out into this garden so try and get, get rid of him quick there you go 
get the quality meat from him. Well, sorry, just meat. Quality meat from the white pig. Right, we need to be quick now. There's going to be quite a few lichens that ambush you. And um, it's going to be an armoured lichen as well. Holy fuck. But as long as you're quick, you shouldn't get in too much trouble. Obviously, I'm not going to be quick now. Should I? I can't believe I didn't block. Right, yeah, so just around this corner is going to be an armoured lichen. And you can open this key. Um, open this gate with the iron insignia key. There we go. Then quickly come in here. Get the well wheel. Quickly. There we go. And then back on the ladder, guys. Just be quick. You can take a bit of damage when you're on the ladder, but you should be okay. Right. Grab this scrap. Drop down. Right. There's a few chickens we need to get now. I think, did one go, go behind me? Yeah, sometimes one runs away near the gate. I hate shooting these three. These three always take me ages to shoot. Right, um oh, I got that poultry, did I? Gunpowder. Get that one. You can always check the map if there's a cross on the animal icon that you know you got all the animals there. Right, it's so another outhouse here and a large crystal. Right, it's liking it. I'm not gonna reload so I'm gonna be selling this weapon in a minute. You get you do sell for you can sell for a little bit more, by the way, if it's got a full clip. Right, uh file. And let's get this key the part of the key here. Right, bloody lets me. Just just rotate it until you can examine it and place the king inside uh, the key inside, there we go. Damn it. Better see the duke again. Right, so out here, I'm going to use that. The well wheel, that's it. While that's turning, I'll grab a scrap. Come in here and grab a bit of treasure. Got a scrap there. you got Vivianite here. you got a teddy bear here. Gunpowder. And a chem fluid. And on your way out, grab the wooden animal head from the well. Right, that's it. Let's go to Angie's place. Yeah, I'm normally on, um, let's see, I'm normally on about, like I said, I'm normally on about 53, 55 ish. Right, and now we should also be able to um, craft craft something. Right, Shall so I we're going to craft the one for garden first. So that's going to be this one here. Yeah, we're going to guard that one first, guys. Bird and Beast Pilaf. Damage taken when guarding decreases permanently. Yeah, we'll get about a million, by the way, here as well. Right, and once you've got that, anything else you can... So I'm going to put some into herb fish. Get rid of them there. And then I'll put this in here. Lob that in there. Juicy game on there. That's it. Just get rid of it all so it's ready when you come back later. Right, let's sell a few things. Yes. Yes, oh yeah, don't forget to do that. Combine the wooden animal head with a the body. There we go, we get a trophy there, repairer. Good, I was just thinking of ways to pass the time. And, um, where is it? Wooden goat necklace saying yes. Um, keep it, like I said, keep a stack of handgun ammo. Sell a magnum, sell a lemmy. Don't need that no more, it's going to use the M19. And that's it, that's all we want, guys. Right, make a save. A good deal. If I one hour I two. Yeah, I think I'm. Five Dimitrescs really fucked me up. Really messed me up, that ass. It just makes you realise how much better that Chris's knife actually is. You know, the Karambit. So much better. I think it does like four times as much damage, something silly like that. It's quite, you know, it's quite a big improvement. With that, with this knife, you just feel like you're not really doing any damage, making any progress. So there's a goat that's just there. Yeah, goat there. That was Gary. Yes, yeah, so that's Gary done. Here she is, Mia. Really? 
Okay. What's going on? Yeah, let's go then. You can come back to this place later when um you get like a broken slab. You can you can bring it back and get a treasure, and there'll be a giant here as well that you can uh, kill. He drops he drops a treasure that sells for fifty thousand, and there'll be a, a big pig here as well, a black pig. Is it pig? I don't know. No, it might be a goat. I can't remember actually. It's been quite a while since I've came back here. After we leave, um, we do Angie's, then we go back to the Duke, and then you can come back here. I think it's been a while since I've actually come back though. Normally, yeah. So you put put the family photo in this letterbox. Yeah, normally I don't come back here because it just takes too long, and um, the rewards is not that great. I mean. Killing the giant, it's a big no-no if you're a knife only. Because the giant, even with the Karambit, he's got so much bloody HP. It might be possible for the lightsaber to kill him quickly. I've never tried it. But yeah, the giant, he just takes so long to kill. Even the, even the um, werewolves die quicker than the giant. The giant just got so much HP. Yeah, the werewolves die much, much quicker. Right, so um, it's going to be another goat up here. There's nothing to collect in Angie's, nothing to collect. Good thing about this, I guess, knife only. You don't have a boss to kill. There's no boss. Just Angie. Just a bit of a game of hide and seek. You want to play hide and seek? So there's the other goat there. Yeah, you want to play hide and seek? Come on, let's play. Let's play a game. Uh, uh, and doors were very stiff. I had to put all my might into opening them. Both my biceps. Alright, best put a gun away. I'm not going to be needing it just yet. Oh, look, a wardrobe. Are we not going to open it, Ethan? It's what we normally do when we enter a abandoned house. Go straight to the wardrobe. I guess it has to be in the basement. Hello, Ethan Winters. Hello. I have a delivery for you. Some cutlery. A one piece cutlery. Right, so um, here it is. The Donna and Angie incident begins. <laughs> what? What? Yeah, a psycho eyes thing, Wait, Ethan. Where's my gun? You dropped it. Right. Let's take her leg off. She won't be able to chase me then. Right, we'll leave her there. We'll call, we'll call her Hoppy. Back in a minute, Hoppy. Right, so and this is 0529. 0529. And double one. Double one on the end. Wow. We unlock. We can e we can exit. But I need to find my weapons first. Where could they be? Oh. I think they want me to enter. Why is this wow. Here? Let's play. Let's play a song. So here I go. One. Change one with two. Change two with four. Change three with four. And then change four with five. And then play. Right, time to reminisce. Well, think think back good old times. Oh tweezers. I got what I needed. Put that thought out of my head for now. Oh, chem fluid. No, it's not. Just a plant pot. 
Oh, okay. Picture fell down. Right, let's go and put stick his tweezers in her mouth. Always wanted to do that. Stick tweezers in somebody's mouth. There we go. Saved your life there. You were choking. But I saved your life. Pulled it out of your mouth. What's around this corner? What's around this? Oh, nothing. Thought I heard something. Okay. Let's um, use the film and then we'll change two with five and then one with three. And then I'm going to play a movie and I'm going to watch it again. I've watched this movie so many times. I love it that much. I've watched this movie about 10 times so far. I just love it so much. Wow, that cradle is just moving, but nobody's actually touching it. Wow, that movie's got such an awesome ending. I like it how the ending just like wraps everything up in the story as well. So you know, you don't like leave the theatre with like any questions. The story's completely wrapped up with that ending. Right, scissors. Um, we've got blindfold here for the vents. Yeah, vents can be blindfolded as well. You can see vents, you can see. There'll be better ventilation now in this place. So hopefully it'll stop stinking like shit. Right. Let me just um, let your chest expand a little. Wow. That's behind your breast plate. Ah, oh, breast medallion. No, stop holding a hand. No, I don't want the ring. Put it back. Leave the ring there, Ethan. I know you want a divorce, but this is not the right way to go about it. He's got that come to it herself. Right, so flying birdie. We've got three blind eyes. And then, obviously, no. We've got a brass medallion. No, not the demon crest or the maiden crest. Because we do not have them no more. So that's impossible. I hope you didn't go all the way back to the graveyard to get them two crests. It's a brass medallion you need there. What happens if you put a brass medallion in place, the demon crest? Yeah, I'm just going to go through this. No questions asked. I didn't even hesitate. I'm so brave. Oh, breaker box key. I'm sure that's not. I'm sure that's not rusty at all. I'm sure it'll go straight into the lock like a glove. Oh, somebody crying. Is that Chris? Oh, he's crying again. Poor Chris. I'll go and give him a cuddle. I'll give you a cuddle, Chris. Don't worry. I I quite enjoy it actually. Chris, where are you? I can hear you. No, I've heard you. There's no point pretending <laughs> pretending I've not heard you, Chris. Oh shit, the baby. Run back for your lives. Chris Redfield's morphed into something. Something sinister. Something not of this world. It's a baby, but it's not a baby. It's something in the middle. Yeah. That's exactly what it is. Right, I need to use that breaker box key. If there's any if there's any place in this house where I find the relief, it's gonna be in the breaker box. I just know it! And there it is. Yes. Oh, that's correct. Right, let's go back. Just follow the vine. I mean not the vine, the umbilical cord. That's the one. Oh, is that Chris? Chris! Chris, where are you? I'm coming. Relief of a child. Chris's favourite relief. Chris, where are you, man? Are you under the bed again? I'm coming.
Don't lock me out, Chris. She under there? No. He's not there. Where is he? Well, I've got a fuse. Oh, where am I? Where am I? Oh, I'm here. I'm in a dark room, of course. Chris took that chance to escape. Sneaky devil. Ethan Winters is coming for you, Chris. Oh, fucking hell. What happened to him? Got to get under that bed. Wow. Too much steroids. That's what too much steroids will do to you, Chris. Told you. Whoa. <laughs> I want to skip this. I want to skip the scene after this. Well, I can't see his penis. So that's that's one thing that hasn't changed at least on him. All right, let's go. Got to take a long way round. Let's do this. No, no files. No, I don't think I don't think there is any files. Do you not think there is any files at all? I think I got them all. I think I did. I found a file and I collected it, yeah. Come on, power lift. Elevator. Oh shit, I need to put breaker in. Oh my god. What an absolute plonker. Fucking hell. I know that. If an elevator will not work unless it has a fuse. I learned this at school. Fucking hell. Okay, fuck. I learned this in my stars training. Sorry, Chris. Gonna leave you here. I'll go and get the antidote. Don't worry, I'll be back. I will be back. Just survive. Survive. Think about Sheva and Jill. <laughs> Wanna play a game? <laughs> oh, oh, I don't, don't think I have a choice, do I? Okay. Baby's having a stroke. That doll, I mean. Okay, so she's always in this room at the top to... I believe she's always in this room. Where am I? I've got stuck on something. Where am I? Oh, fucking hell. Found you. Look at me. You fucking little nasher. Nips my finger. Right. For that, you're going to get a pair of scissors to her. Right, come back. Flying away. That's not fair. Why should I fly? I want to fly. Right, so she's all either on the left here, through there, or she's round the corner. Right, you want scissors? You can have them. She's got she scissors. <laughs> she's got scissors on the brain. Quite literally. Right, so I'm around the corner here. Oh, yeah. Or you can turn around and go in the door straight behind you, straight opposite, which leads back to the elevator. And she'll be camped beside the elevator. I told you to stop thinking about scissors. Right. Clearly can't see properly, can she? Right, I think she's dead. Right, we've got a key. Wow. The unborn four wings key. Right, now I've got to go to Dr. Moreau's place. Right, got no strings. Let's grab Angie first, the Angie doll. Grab the flask. That makes two. And let's go. We've got two flasks. Wow. 
So exciting. All right, let's go and do this. Don't worry, Chris, I'll be back. I'll get the antidote. Then he can turn into a grown man again. A fully grown man. You no longer be a little crybaby. Oh yeah, shoddy brickwork. Look, so shoddy, it's not even solid. Right, where, um... Yeah, so going to the Duke now, and uh, we're going to go to Luther's house. Oh, well, not to, we're not going to the Duke right away. We're going to make a visit to good old Luther's house first, in the garden. And we're going to get his key and grab a file there. A file that I have missed once before in doing one of these 100% runs. Yeah, but there's also... Oh, yeah, there's a few enemies here. Yeah, I'm going to do... I, I always do this labyrinth as well. It's a nice, quick one to do. Yeah, so you have to go right now because the tree is falling down. There's a tornado while we were in there. Nasty little tornado. Right, we're going to shoot this bird case down because it drops 3,000 lay, I believe. Yep, yeah, and uh, we'll grab the ball. There we go, sun and moon ball. Right, come in here and grab, there's a weapon. The tack, W870 tack. Right, block, let me pass. Motherfucker. Right, it's so the outhouse here as well. And we're also gonna grab Madalena. We're gonna use a well wheel here and get Madalena's head. We'll grab it on the way back. For now, we'll just come to the outhouse around the back here. And we will grab... Well, you don't even need that photo of a strange bird. But you do need the outhouse. That's why I'm grabbing it then. Grab Madalena head from there. We'll come in the front door. I'm going to use this um, sun and moon ball. There we go. Do this little labyrinth. Only do one of these. You can do them all if you want. If you're not bothered about going through fast. But they do. Obviously, you need to find all the balls. There you go. And as you can imagine, if the ball falls off the edge, you have to start again. And bingo. Get the ball rolling. Yeah, so Luther's key. File. There you go. File. Save the game. What time are we at? 1 hour 20. Wow. Wow, yeah, grab the oinks school from there. School, yeah, grab it. Right, let's make our way back now. Yeah, I normally get to factory in about two hours, I think. So I think I'm way behind. There's no way I'm going to do morose bit and the stronghold before we hit two hours. I think I'm way behind my normal run time. I think I am. We will see. We will see. I don't think Moreau's, Moreau's don't take too much. It's mainly the boss. It takes a while. So we'll grab that. Large crystal. But there are three. There are three explosive barrels you can use for him, by the way. And we'll grab this um, Vivianite off there. Shoot the bird, uh, bird cage because some lay drops down. Right, we're going to sneak my way past him. There we go. Come over here. Right, so... We're just going to come up to the Duke. Does this look familiar? Yeah, very familiar. Right, sell some crap. Yep, yeah, uh, yeah. Don't sell the head yet. We need to combine it with something else. Uh, keep the handgun ammo. And we're going to sell the tack. Ah, yeah, I'm going to sell it all. We've got quarter of a million at the moment. Right, so... The, can we get the goats yet? There's going to be two goats. I think we can get them now, can we? No, you still can't get them yet. Okay, so we're going straight to Luther's house now. Straight to Luther's. And there'll be an outhouse here as well. So in here, outhouse with lockpick inside if you want it. And 
little building here. You've got gunpowder, you've got some ammo, and you've got Madalena body. We'll combine that now. Sell us quite a bit. Yeah, combine it to make the complete Miss Madalena. Right, it's a goat up here. There we go. Grab the goat, guys. And now we've got Luther's key. We're going to head inside this mansion. It's mansion. No, it's not mansion. But make sure you get the file first. I miss this, actually, on a, my last play playthrough I recorded. I actually miss that somehow. Right, so in here, we need to remember that code. Um, 27917. 27917. Got yellow quartz here. 27917. There we go, and you'll get an attachment. Oh, sorry, yeah, attachment for sniper rifle. But we've already sold the sniper rifle, so we're just going to sell this. Um, when you get attachments, by the way, you can you can buy them back from the Duke. Yeah, so um, it's not like you have to collect them again. But there is a trophy for getting all the attachments anyway. That's why we want to do it quite early. Yeah, so we've, we've done that bit, Luther's bit in this house. And um, now what we're going to do is... Yeah, it's a pipe on there, but I'm going to leave it. Yeah, what we're going to do now is... Um, where am I going? Yeah, I need to go this way. And so, yeah, back up to the Duke. I don't know where I'm going right now. Right, can I... S um, yeah, let's just sell a few... Let's get rid of a few things to the Duke. Oh yeah, and um, maybe I can craft some health actually. Hopefully, um, yeah. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Get rid of that now. Get this bit of ammo that I don't need. High capacity mag. Three hundred thousand. Right. Can I craft a healing item? No, I still can't quite. Okay. Let's go, guys. So we're going to go down here now. Uh, yeah. Use the four winged unborn key. Alright, so Wolf here, she's going to back up and grab this file. There we go, file there. We're going to run back out. And sprint down here. Now listen out for him, if you hear him charging towards you, turn around and block. You can normally hear him. Now it looks like I got away in time. I outran him. Normally catches up with me, but not this time. Not today. Right, up here, there's some pig piggies up here. And there's some uh, poultry. Um, I think I'm, I'm actually going to heal. Yeah, I'm going to heal in a minute, I think. Well, I'm going to be able to. So, just kill these. Yeah, get the meat from them. Cheers, guys. Through here and down the long elevator shaft. And there we go. Yes, yeah, so and you get poultry here. And um, after that, I should be able to craft something to heal me. And um, I actually missed some poultry earlier. Near um, Behind the church, there's a little graveyard and there's some poultry in there, which I forgot to get. But it's, it's not a big problem because we do actually pass through there after doing the stronghold. So I'll just grab it then. I'll just grab it then. Yeah, so um, Moreau now, and um, Moreau's not too bad if I'm honest, because like, like I mentioned briefly earlier, there's some explosive barrels you can use, and um, they there's three actually, and um, they take a big portion of his health down. There's a crystal fragment there. Yeah, and um, obviously after that, you just got to keep knifing him. Obviously, you just got to make sure you do not shoot him yourself. Make sure, when you shoot a red barrel, by the way, make sure there's never an enemy behind it, just in case your bullet penetrates it. Because it's not just the magnum that can penetrate enemies and stuff. Sometimes other weapons can as well. So, to be safe, if you're ever shooting anything which is not an enemy, make sure there's no enemy behind it, just in case it penetrates it. And you're fine with Miranda. With Miranda, I never, the end boss, I never use my weapon until we're right in the, until we're on the last stage with her. 
last stage of a boss fight. Yeah, I never use the weapon at all because I've had it before where I've shot the orbs that she spawns and um, yeah, I've shot the orbs that she spawns and it's actually counted as hitting her. So just grab the herb and the boat key from here. Yeah, it actually counted as hitting her once and um, I think because you can, I think you can shoot the vines behind her because if you go in mercenaries and lob a uh, explosive round with a grenade launcher you can actually see the vines take damage as well around her sometimes so i think what can happen is when you shoot the orb sometimes your bullet might penetrate and maybe shoot a vine behind and you won't even know so with them around it's best just use a knife for the whole of it and then change the weapon at the end at the bit where you have to anyway right so over here on the boat and I just come straight to the boat. There's a file here and a few other things, but I get them all later because you're going to have to come back through here later anyway when the water is strained. No two ways about it if you want to 100%. So I just grab the file then because as well, there's no lichens around. Only good old Ethan. And um, what's the name? What oh yeah, David the goat. Yeah, David the goat, he's there as well. Right, we've docked at the, um, wherever the fuck this is, the windmill dock, yeah, the dock near the windmill. Right, so up here we've got some fish, some little fishies, gonna go fishing, right, large crystal up there, not a large, not medium, not me, uh, small, not medium, but a large. Right, some fish, there's one, and the other is in there somewhere. Oh, and I got it. I was just firing at will. Yeah, these ones are a pain in the ass. You can't see them. Sometimes they pop out like that one did, where it came to the surface for some air. And then other times they hide below the water. You can see the bubbles, but you can't see them until you get right close. So you may want to just do that what I did, just fire at will. Right, and um, skip that cutscene. Now, I, can't, I think I did try this, but I can't remember. If shooting Moreau during this section actually counts as a um, shooting with a uh, shooting an enemy, not using a knife, and I can't remember if it counts or not. So, don't shoot Moreau during this bit, just to be on the pretty safe side. Right, so Jeeks through here, but I'm going to talk to him on my way back through, just because because then I will have poultry in my possession, and I can heal. Right, chem fluid and an outhouse, guys. Did you see this? A outhouse. Hope you did not miss that. Right, it's a file in this car. There we go, just left on the seat there. Some poultry here. And there's another one. You got a large crystal in this box. Well, crystal fragment, sorry. So, poultry, make sure you grab it all. You got a rusty scrap. Make sure you got poultry. If you want to be sure, just check the. Um, picture on the map make sure it's um crossed out around here shoot the goat which is just around this corner there we go in between the logs and then down the ladder you can drop down on the left completely avoid the ladder who needs ladders we'll leave them jill jill and uh, leon they need ladders don't they oh and claire right handgun bullets there right smash that Run over here. And just wait a minute for him to cross over. Otherwise you will become a fish fruit and you don't want to do that. Trust me, when you get eaten by some it's not very nice. Yeah, I, I learned first hand experience. I was once eaten alive and spat out alive. And the worst part was getting spat out. Just because of where I got spat out from. But I won't talk about that anymore. I do not want to relive that moment. Right, maggots. Yeah, maggots can be... They've got quite a lot of protein in. You might want to try one. They're very rich in protein. Chris's favourite fruit. Right, I bet he left them there actually. Hid him there for later. In case he needs a snack when he's running around. 
Right, looking for um, boulders to punch. Whatever he does with boulders nowadays. Right, magnum ammo there. Pull that switch. Pull this switch. Pull this switch. Oh, and I fucking forgot. I'll oh, we'll get in a minute. Never mind. Pull that switch on your way past. Right over here. And then over here. He'll pop up in a minute. There he is. We'll wait for him to go back. He has to go over here. And, um. Yeah, it's not even visible right now. Yeah, right. Over here quickly. Smash that. Grab a handgun ammo. Back on here. He'll appear again. When he appears again, back on the platform. He has to go there. Um, but you can actually see it from later. I'll actually show you that, actually. Because there's another spot where you can see it from in case you miss it down here. Just have to make sure I remember. Right, so over here, push down the little carriage. Make the bridge layer. There we go. Don't need to loot that, but I'm just looting it as I'm passing by. Right, get rid of these maggots. Disgusting. Right, up this ladder, and then let's catch a boat. There you go, the boat leaving for New Orleans is about to depart. That was a big one. Right, this ladder. And then we're going to interrupt the other ladder, the broke one, then grab the crank, use the crank, and then climb the ladder. We'll leave the crank for a minute. Right, interrupt this ladder. There we go. Just to find you can't climb up it like this. And we're going to take the crank and we're going to put it in here and use it as a ratchet sort of thing. So use a ratchet and a crank. Wow, we've done that one. That windmill, windmill number one. Let's move back to windmill number two. I hope this windmill doesn't fall down. Moreau's hitting it quite a lot. Alright, let's go down the zip line. Wee. Fuck, I don't want to be fish food. Luckily, I wasn't. I was too fast. He couldn't quite catch me in time. Right, let's use the crank as a ratchet. There we go, remember. Righty tighty, lefty loosey. Or anti-clockwise. Okay. It depends what where you are. If you're in Germany, is it Germany where they? It's you turn it right, you turn it clockwise to um, unlock it. I don't know. I can't remember where that is. Right, let's go see the Duke. We got some poultry, mate. Or what are you having? Make a purchase. No, but I'll sell something and craft something, and that's about it for now, mate. And do not pressure me into buying something. You will not like me when I'm pressured. And buy it, I will. I know you will. Right, we healed. Right, any healing items now do not fully do not fully place the ingredients that they need inside their menu, their little um tracker thing until you're ready. Because once you once you've got every ingredient, yeah, you can store them, but once you get every one, it will automatically craft it for you. Right, so that's a garden one. Yep. Oh, I can actually complete that now. Wow. Yeah, so um, we've got both the garden ones and we've got one healing one. So we've got one free heal. Yes, yeah, a free heal, remember. So, right, anything else I can get rid of, but I do not want to finish a healing item. Okay, we'll lob it there. Still need some meat for that. Okay, we're good. Let's make a safe, mate. There we go. Right, let's do it, Duke. Duke, your boy. I just puzzle. Yeah, I know the answer. It's blue, of course. White. And then orange, blue, blue. 
There we go. I think I've done this before. Right, push that lever up. Yeah. Power drain. Got it. It's very like jewel. I feel like I'm right, Resident Evil 1 where I drew the tank, the reservoir, and I killed the big shark. Push the generator inside the water and electrocuted it. Well, wow. felt so good after that. Right, a file in this drawer. A journal. There's an attachment here for the M19. Let's attach it. It's an attachment. That's what you do with attachments. You attach them. So attach away. Yeah, you do get a full you do get a full clip after crafting it. I mean if your weapon is already empty, it will refill your clip. So you can wait, but um we got plenty of ammo, so no need. Right, knife only. Let's do it. So obviously if you can knife his weak point, it'll take increased damage. Right, so move out Wayne's back to spit acid. Right, and uh, once he gets close to the middle of these two huts, run around the here. Gonna loot this quickly. Run around here and you see him there? You need him to come through the middle here because that's an explosive barrel. If you let him get too far past, he'll follow you around the outer side like, I, like where I came. And he will take a minute. He fucks about a lot. Yeah, sometimes he'll just stand there for like a minute before he actually comes after you. And then get back to knifing him. That's it, he'll go red. Once he gets pissed off, he'll go red and he'll fucking breathe on you like that. And his breath fucking stinks. Right, so once you're waiting, that's it, just come over here and um, just wait now. Wait it out. Yeah, he ate some at bad, bless him. I think he tried eating one of the fucking wooden goats or something. No, obviously he didn't sit too well in his stomach. Pure, poor little stomach, poor thing. Right, I've got to get him down from there now and uh, lure him to another red barrel. Right, I'm over here, Moreau. Come and face me. Follow me, come on. Come on, kill me. Come on, kill me. Yeah, when he gets really fat like that, when he starts puffing up, just make sure you're close to somewhere to hide. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, because he will follow you and then he'll spit acid at you. Right, so I'm gonna quick keep knifing him. And I'm gonna wait till he's about to attack. There we go, and um, I'm just gonna run behind here. He will take a minute, like I say, he'll he may take a moment to fucking come through. He fucks about for ages. I don't know why. He'll just stand there messing about for ages. He will come through eventually. Just give him time. Give him time. He's got to get the bottle. There we go. Right, and then come over here. La this is the last barrel, by the way. So, last one we're going to shoot. Whoa, shit. Oh, no, 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 no. Got to be really careful I don't shoot him now. I did not expect him to come charging forward like that. Right. I've got to get behind him, but it's not going to let me. Okay. I'll get that in a minute. Don't even know that hit him. Oh, so oh that went that went quite good. He died pretty quick actually. That's probably the quickest I've killed him with this little shitty knife. Ah, oh, that went pretty well. So maybe I've recovered a bit of my time, guys. Maybe. Maybe. Well, I gotta remember that goat that we missed in the middle of the lake. You gotta remember that. Right, uh, file here. Yes, thank you. And a key. Four winged unborn key now becomes a six winged unborn key. Just like that. 
Yeah. If you had if you had a if you add a two winged key to a four winged key, that makes a six winged. Right, so we're going over to where the boat was now and the water will be drained. And we can now grab a bit of loot. Yeah, we should be able to shoot that goat from here. We'll get a bit closer. Yeah, so in here there's a file now, guys. There it is. Grab that file. About. Yeah, I'll get this goat down here. We'll get it in a minute. Okay, that barrel there. There we go, flashbang. There's a goat here. There we go, then flashbangs sell for that, that's why I get them. Right, there's two fish in here which you want to get. There's one of them. And can we see the other one? These two are always quite tricky to see. Right, I know it's here somewhere. Yeah, this the last one here is always pain in the ass to find. Don't know why. Oh well, look. I mean, look. He just where? Just pops out from nowhere. That's why I was crouching there just so he didn't scarp us fast. Right, silver angel statue. Got the fish. Let's go. Right, so there's this goat, guys. If I don't get this goat, I'm just going to get it on Village of Shadows if I can't reach it. But I'm pretty sure you can get it from here. Pretty sure you can. So it should be just over there. On one of these. Okay, I can't see it. Basically, it should be a go on one of these um, little pylon things. These wooden beams. But, yeah, I can't see it. I guess because I need the sniper rifle and I'm not close enough. But what we'll do in a minute, I did save my game there. Yeah, this is going to waste my platinum time a little bit. Right, I'll just save my game at the top and um, I'll quickly get that goat. I did make a save there. I did make a save at Duke, if you remember. I made a save just before we did a little puzzle. So what I do, I quickly buy a sniper rifle and then I was going to shoot that goat quickly. Just so we do get heretic at the end of this playthrough. Otherwise, because if I don't do it now, I'm just going to forget about it. I would have shot it then when we went to get a magnum, but I thought I would have been able to... Um, Shoot it from there. Perhaps you can if you've got the um, you've got a sniper rifle. Perhaps you can. Right, so I'm just going to make a quick save up here, guys, and then we'll grab the magnum, and uh, then we'll head back. Well, then we'll head to the stronghold. Don't know what time we're at. Probably about coming up to. Well, I don't think we're quite on two hours. I did it. I did that a bit pretty quick actually because of um. Moreau died pretty quick. I've not killed him that quick before, that shitty knife. Right, so up here is a safe point. Right, so um, let's just quickly do that a bit now, guys. I mean, this is going to add to platinum time, but it's only going to take a minute. And I just want to make sure. 144, so we're not, I don't know, we might not be doing too bad, actually. May not be. Maybe We may be able to recover this. I don't know. We'll see if I could do this in three hours. Right, so if I just quickly buy a sniper rifle from him. Um, it doesn't matter because I'm just going to be reloading the safe, guys. So this doesn't really matter. Yeah, we've got a trophy there. That's just for uh, buying your first thing with the, the Duke. Right, 
Yeah, I think I might have to leave this until then. Um, until the shadows, because... Fucking hell, I, sh I should have got this. I should have got this then. Right, yeah, it should be just on there. On that... One of these. Yeah, it's normally on that highest one there. But, um, okay, we're just going to leave that, guys, until fucking, until Village of Shadows. We're going to leave that go until Village of Shadows. Yeah, I should have got it when we first went through there. But I'm an idiot. So Village of Shadows, we've got to get that last goat. Well, it's not the last goat yet, but it will be the last one once we get to the end. Wasted two minutes there. Right, okay. So, crank. Yeah, I thought you could see that goat from... Where you get back on... The, where, you, where you go to where the boat was and the water strain. That's why I left it, because I thought you could see it from there, but... Don't think you can. Maybe, perhaps if you have a sniper rifle, perhaps if you have a sniper rifle, but um, obviously I didn't. Right, so up here, he's going to grab his magnum ammo just there. And um, going to go and get the magnum now and um, a file. That's a file over here. Get that loot from there, loot there, and uh, come in here. Uh, it's going to be an enemy here. Grab that file. He will attack you, by the way. And uh, Magnum's in there. Make sure you get that file f as well, guys. That one. Right, unlock this door. Right, it's going to be a big werewolf now, but he's just on the left. Oh, there he is. Yeah, block him first and then run for it. He might not be there. It depends. I mean, I've, I've run away before and he's, he must have gone by the house at the same time because I never saw him. I sort of heard him. So he may be in a different place to you. Right, so um, we've done all that bit. Obviously, I did miss that goat. Yeah, I missed that goat there. So, but we will be getting every other goat. We'll just get that one on our village shadows. It's a it's a goat in the middle of the Moreau section, if you want to know. There's a goat where near where I've got the magnum bullets, where we're basically where we're pulling them, them levers. There's a goat there on top of the big wooden post sort of pile or sort of thing. So... Yeah, if you want to make a note of that, just bear in mind. Bear that in mind. Um, right, crank. And some more poultry here. And we're going to get a treasure. I like to get this treasure because when you combine it with another one, it sells for like 50,000. That's why I like to get it. Alright, so um, pistol. Poultry, it's only two here. Two poultry. There we go. Right, up the ladder. Go and get his treasure, and then we'll get a grenade launcher. I'm going to have to move my inventory around to get a space for it. There we go, pigeon blood ribbit. This way, Papa. Right, we use um, the Iron Insignia key. Right, and uh, let's GM, but let's just make a bit of space for it first. I can't, I can't quite remember how many slots it takes, if I'm honest. I think that will be enough. Oh, look at that, perfection. Right up here, there's a mine here. If you have space for it. Oh, I have. Right, so um, let's go and get rid of some inventory, guys. 
Yeah, we want to keep the magnum, the magnum, the grenade launcher. We need it for um, new game plus. We will sell the M19 eventually, but we want to keep it for now, just for like shooting goats and barrels and stuff. Right. So um, sell that. No, keep the pigeon blood ruby. We'll sell that though. I sell that. Sell the ammo. Sell all the ammo you can. There you go, but you want to keep two explosive rounds for the GM79. We will, we'll probably get them a bit later, if I'm honest. Yeah, two explosive rounds for the GM79. This is Lord Moreau's? I suppose it's what they call There we go. So, inventory's well pretty full, actually. But we'll just get rid of some stuff. I don't want to craft anything just yet. Ah, thank you. Yeah, I don't want to craft any food just yet. Right, so there we are. Good to go. Sure to be a good meal. Yeah, save the explosive round that's in the grenade launcher, guys. Save it because you're going to need it for later. Yes, yeah, save that explosive round. Right, let's go to the stronghold. Right, so there's two goats here. There's one of them. And uh, there's the other. Got the meat. As a bird KJ, you can shoot down. You get some scrap inside. Right, let's use the uh, six winged unborn key. Right, so first we're going to go left because we're doing map matician as well, remember? You know, doing map matician as well. That's another goat through here. I can't believe I didn't get, uh, get that goat in the Moreau section. Right, yeah, so you got a goat here. That one is um, Richard, that goat. So it's a pig here, and we'll get a crystal fragment. Crystal fragment on there, and we'll get the pig. There's a big giant in here, but we're not going to kill him just because he's too tough. So through here, through here, and here. Grab the shotgun shells on there. Grab this knife rifle ammo on there, and then we've got to shoot these quickly. There we go, come in here, grab the green herb, grab all the meat, poultry, you can get a bit of fish as well, someone here. Get a metal scrap, get the file. Yeah, don't miss that file around here, and we get some treasure. Father Nicholas's angel, grab a um, gunpowder there. And that's all we need, guys, from here. Right, it's going to make our way past these punks. Just make sure you block when you go past them. Right, we're good. Right, get your knife ready because we're going to be knifing a arrow in a minute. Getting our mad skills out. Show everyone how to knife an arrow. It's all about time and speed and agility. You gotta visualize your target, visualize where it's going to be, and a knife. Don't think too much about it. Just release, free your mind. Just free your mind. It's like a finger pointing to the moon. Do not concentrate on the finger, or you lose all that heavenly glory. Yes, the same with this. Do not concentrate on your knife. Yes, I like to do it here. Wait for the noise. A bit too early. Wait for it. Oh, where did he go? Okay, they normally don't chase me this high. Yeah, normally you can hear them knocking the arrow, and when they release the arrow, you'll hear it. That's when you want a knife. That's what normally works for me. Wait for it. No. Quick. Too early. There we go. Yeah, so you need to make sure you see this guy here, you want to be about that distance away. Yeah, that's about a distance you want to be away from them. 
Right. Fuck this. Kill them. Yeah, remember, you can shoot the red barrels. Yeah, if you're too close, it it's hard to um, react in time. But I, I wanted to do it to that first one, but because that lichen appeared on the side of me, I had to move, move, move away, sort of. Yeah, but if the one I actually got it on, you want to be about that distance away. And then when you when you hear him release the arrow, you just knife at that point, And normally, most of the time, that'll get it. As long as the arrow is sort of close to you. Right, so now just got to wait for the gate to open. Let's grab a bit of loot while I'm waiting. Ouch. Yep, I am in a lot of pain right now. Right, gate should be open now. Yes, let's go. Yes, I, I do like to be full health coming into this bit because with um, Urias, if you're not at full health, even if you're blocking, he can instant kill you. Yeah, if you're in danger, whether you're blocking or not, he can instant kill you. So we'll, we'll get to him and then if I'm worried, I'm probably going to heal. Yeah, I'm probably going to heal if I'm worried. Right, well, I'm going to make a save here. What time are we on? 1 hour 52. This must be the dead. Yeah, and in a minute, a fucking a lichen will drop down. And I always forget about his lichen, but I remembered him now. He's going to drop down just over here. There he is. And he always goes straight for you, just like that. Right, I'm going to shoot that barrel. Bloody hell. Could have killed myself then. Some explosive rounds there. Remember, we need two explosive rounds for later. So do not use some explosive rounds, which we just got. Yeah, you should have two now. We probably will get a bit more later. So I've got no space for anything now. No, let's not worry. No space for anything. The inventory gets very, very tight. Okay, right, so you've got to get away from the big guy now. Right, so through here, some magnum ammo and a gunpowder. Yeah, I do... No, okay. No space magnum ammo. Okay, let's leave it. Right, some sprinter down here now. Metal scrap. Box, mouse, or loot. Oh, fucking hell, miss lay. So let's go here. That's Harry. Don't think I've said Harry. No, that one's Harry. I'm sure it is. Feasting ground. Right, it's so a file here. Yeah, very. I think that's a file which is very easy to miss. Some explosive rounds, which I'm going to grab. Right, so um, I guess another save point. I just overwrite that last save I did. Yeah, so we've got four explosive rounds now. That's all we need for later. Well, we need two actually, but we'll just keep hold of them. Right, so once you get down here, Uriah is going to appear. There he is. Right, let's grab a bit of loot while we're waiting. Probably not going to be able to grab a lot, but we'll grab what we can. No, can't grab a handgun bullets. Probably can't grab this shotgun. Or a sniper rifle as well. What about the shotgun? Oh, I can grab them. Yeah, right, with your eyes here. If you can get in between his legs, in the, in between them, you can sort of knife both at the same time. So, yeah, get in here. Right in the middle of his legs. If he lifts up his mace. There we go. Yeah, some... Now, yeah. Oh, I don't have a healing item. Okay. I'm just going to grab one. Yeah, if you get hit, guys, when you're like this, you will die really fast. Yeah, what I'm going to do, I'm just going to discard the handgun bullets. They don't sell for a lot. Let's craft flat. And then let's use it. That's going to be one of my healing items. But you do not want to... You do not want to get in danger of this guy. Yeah, so you get in between his legs like this. 
You can sort of hit both legs at the same time. You can hear it sometimes, you're hearing like a double slash. You can actually see it then. Come back, come back. Going back to this nesting ground. Yeah, he'll, he'll uh, summon a lichen now. And just be careful of this lichen. He can keep grabbing you from behind. But if you get him in the right place, you can get um, your ace to kill him. Just make sure you're ready to unblock. You can get Lycus to kill him. Like, um, your ace to kill him. Lycus. You can get your ace to kill him like that. Yeah, so I've used one of my four heals. I like to keep a few for Miranda. Because she's the same. She can instant kill you if you're in danger. Yeah, you know when he's about to attack. She sort of raises. It looked like he's raising his um, mace. Well, I guess his hammer. Yeah, try and get in between his legs and crouch. Yeah, I am crouching. And you know when you've done when he's almost dead because you'll start doing like combos. Stop sidestepping, mate. And it will summon more lichens if you're not quick enough, by the way. My finger's starting to fucking hurt now. Here we go, here's the combo. Combo time. He's getting angry. Oh, it looks like he's killed a um, another lichen. So it's a rusty scrap there. Oh, there's another lichen there. Luckily, I saw him. Right, hopefully he's going to die. No, he didn't kill a lichen. And the lichen just fucking attacked me from behind. Oh, he killed him. Nice. Nice. That's it. You always kill your friends. Good thing to teach him. I haven't switched my fucking finger now. It's, it's going to drop. Oh, another lichen's about to drop down. Hopefully he's dead now. It sounded like I think I heard like a little lichen scream while he's dead. Oh shit. Yeah, if I get hit now, I'm going to be dead. Oof. Joking. Wow. Can't believe I didn't die then. Yeah, so I've got to be really careful.
Has he killed that lichen? Yes. Fucking hell. Well, this is not how I wanted this to go. I rarely, I rarely die to him. I rarely die to him. Right, so there is, there is a healing item here, actually. So I'm just going to go and grab this now. Right, let's go. Yeah, let's try that again, guys. Um, yeah, it's it's just shit with this knife because That's not good. yeah, this is what what happens. Any mistakes, and you're sort of dead, even on casual. Just because it can kill you when you're in red. Right, so. Let's try and be a bit better now. I know I wasn't going as fast with a knife as I could. I don't know why he does that. When he jumps down, he sort of attacks you like straight after as well. So just be careful of that. When he jumps down, he sort of um, will attack you almost straight after as well. Right, like will come down in a second. There he is. Right, try and deal a bit of damage quickly. I went for Yuri to drop down. I killed him already, really. Bloody hell. There he is. Quick scroll him off. Yeah, it always attacks straight away after jumping down. He always attacks almost straight after recovery. Right, I'm trying to knife a bit quicker. And be a bit more accurate. I've killed him before, before any of the lichens have spawned in. That first one spawns in. But yeah, I've normally killed him before the others have spawned in. If you look on my um, separate knife in the new game, I actually kill him pretty quick on that. And no other lichens spawn in, I think. I think I was just better positioned like this, and I, I was knifing both legs more often. I mean, look at that. You see how, how often it's knifing them both? I guess you need to knife knife lower. Maybe that's my problem. I was uh, knifing too high. Yes, you seem to get both legs. You sort of have to knife a little bit lower. Oh, it's completely missing. It. Oh, it's a lichen. Oh, and he's dead. <laughs> oh, no, I think the lichen just got me from behind then. So I'm in orange now, did you see? Yeah, so this is better. This is how you want to be standing. And knifing downwards as well. Oh, he's walking. He's going to walk back up. All right, let's get rid of these lichens quickly before he comes back down. Oh, he's picking up a pillar. Did he trip over and drop it? Yes, I guess you need to go for his shins. That seems to be the best part. Go, uh, well, sort of his ankles. 
He's, he's, your angle's just better you. Stop sidestepping, man. Okay. Fucking hell. Wow. <laughs> wow. Bloody hell. Oh, there's six. Oh, yeah, six. Um, there's six here on the wall. Um, that you shoot down. One. Two. Uh, two. Three, four, five, six. There's six to shoot down, but it's actually seven. Because that one there, we didn't shoot down. There we go. Yeah, that's all it. So you shoot six down, guys, but it's actually one there on the left, which you don't shoot down. It's already there for you. Yeah, wow. That fight. Flask. Flask number three. Right, and... Um, into the factory after this guys well we'll do the little optional area first on the boat where you get the um attachment for the shotgun there's treasure here oh yeah and you get some more treasure and you also get the fish i suppose at least i've got a free heal here because what i normally do i normally use a heal at the start of uh, miranda's fight miranda's fight ain't that bad actually i mean really you want to it's you're right Urias, if you need to use another health, if you follow me here on your own, your own gameplay, and you want to use a healing item here, you can. Um, normally with Miranda, I normally use one or two, and you've got four free heals, so. Um, but I'm going to use one of the Duke's heals now as well, and then I'm going to save the last one for when we finish the factory and just before Miranda. So, fire all there, guys. Some more shotgun shells, pipe bomb. Can't, no space for it, but I've got a pipe bomb. Remember to make sure you save the explosive rounds. Right, so, um, out here. Oh, yes, and up here, some poultry, remember. And I guess I'm going to have to make some space for the poultry. Yeah, oh, oh, am I? Yeah, so you got poultry here. Oh, no, I've got space, that's good. Yeah, two poultry, you got a goat. There we go, that's Billy. And uh, you got a large crystal. There we go. And then we we'll use the iron iron insignia. There we go. Come down here and we use a well wheel to get another pigeon ruby here. Which you want to keep. Yeah, use the well wheel. There we go. To get the necklace with two holes. Um, we'll go see the Duke now and um, slowly make our way to the factory. Like I say, we've got to um, we've got to do the boat section first. The place where you explore two optional areas. So, but I'm going to craft one healing item now. We've probably got enough now to craft everything, if I'm honest. Um, I think. Oh no, no, we still need the um, finest fish, I believe. So, get rid of that, get rid of that. Yep, yep, yep. Keep the pigeon blood and the necklace two holes. Keep them. Sell that, sell that. Um, yep, yep. Want to keep... Actually, we'll keep all the explosive rounds. We will. I think we will use them all. Let's get rid of the pipe bombs. Yeah, keep all the explosive rounds. Right, let's craft... Yeah, let's heal. We've got half a million. We'll end. We'll end the game with about with one point one point oh five million approx. Yeah, that's what we'll end the game with. Uh, this first playthrough, anyway. I'd love 
for you to enjoy right and what else can I put not a bad dish um let's lob that in there no let's put one poetry on there I do not want to put the other one in until I'm ready to use it by the way right and okay so yeah so I can actually craft that and all I need now is the finest fish and we're good right and I've got so much space on me wow is that meat meat takes up so much fucking space don't it right let's just slot some of these while we're waiting in fact I've got to slot them all so we can get the giant chalice Yes, what was that? Yeah, let's slot all these flasks so we get a giant chalice. Torso flask. And the head flask. Well, there we go. I just love that in my fanny pouch. I left a bit of space for it. Right, so let's just go and get his treasure with um, Louise's key. And we'll get a goat. There's a goat down here. Um, Where is it? Yeah. You know what I was thinking? I was thinking... I can't, you know, we couldn't see that goat right in the middle of the dock on top of piling. I was thinking, what if I actually accidentally shot it and didn't realise, you know, from like crazy distance away? And that's obviously why we didn't see. Let's go here. Yeah, I was thinking, what if I actually did shoot it somehow magically from like the other, the opposite side of the bloody lake? And um, somehow, yeah, somehow that happened. That's why we couldn't see it. I think I couldn't see it because it's just too far away. Because sometimes that happens if you're too far away from something, it doesn't quite spawn in. Until you get a bit closer. Right, so let's go and do the boats. Got no space in my inventory at all. So I'm not going to be able to collect much. Oh yeah, we're going to get a last outhouse now as well. Oh yeah, we are. Yeah, so um, hopefully I haven't missed any of them. Don't think I did. I'm normally okay with the outhouses. And um, if I try to think back, yeah, I think we've got them all. We've got the difficult ones. Like we've got the one in Morose area, didn't we? And um, yeah, that's highly missable, the one in Morose area. Let's go and do that first just to make sure. Yeah, let's go and do that first. Just to be on the safe side. There's a file in here as well. I always leave this file till we come in now because um, otherwise you have to go in the building. Yeah, so there's a file in here. Uh, just there. But if you come out here, let's just get this crank working first. Yeah, uh, no, sorry, wrong one. It's a well wheel. Okay, there it is. Last outhouse it should be. Yes, when you gotta go, you gotta go. Gunpowder. So that's all the outhouses, guys. Suddenly, trophy we're probably collectible. We're probably not going to get here. See, heretic one. And I can't believe your your eyes killed me. Fucking hell. Right. So I can't collect much. So I've just not got the space. So I'm not really going to. I'm going to. I'm going to collect the mines here and the um explosive and the um grenade rounds. That's about it. Right. I've got to make all these green. Well, press the white ones, turn the white ones off basically. Come around here and push this out of the way. Right, push that down there to uh, make a little, nice little stepping platform. Oh wow, I can step on that now. Cool. Explosive around in there if you want it. Magnum ammo, flashbang, and there's my lovely pigeon blood ruby. Let's craft, let's combine it. Oh, wow, look what we made. Dimitrescu's necklace. She gonna be looking for that? Oh, she weren't, she's dead. Forgot. Lockpick here. Might as well grab it, I've got space for one more. There is, we wanna use two lockpicks in the factory and then we're not gonna use any more. 
yeah we're going to use two lock picks in the factory so yeah and um i don't remember where where we collect i don't remember if i collect any in the factory no cannot go out that way you yeah, gotta go back through the house yeah i looked at i double had a double a double take there because um i thought i saw a padlock on that little gate at the end thinking you could shoot it but yeah the gate's all um sort of blocked on the sides so you cannot pass right back into Demetresks. go and get a lipstick i'm uh, just gonna do this right we'll shoot that one first so that's where the enemy spawns from that side right and wait for the enemy to spawn oh lots and lots of money there he is right so we've got to let that ignite him so hopefully it's going to come back and hit him and i got I ain't got a fuck about in there yes yes thank you thank you um swinging lantern right you come and set light to this yes did he do it yes he did right let's go and grab the golden lady statue let's grab the magnum rounds it looks like a claymore right we're good we got the medium rare trophy got a golden lady statue and the claymore magnum rounds the box looks like a claymore doesn't it it's a, right it's the same shape right into the boat and now we're going to head downstream guys yeah it's going to follow the river down the stream down the stream we go in my boat and it goes so well down the stream I go down the street. <laughs> okay. Hey. So we get the finest fish here and um, go in the dark cave and we get an attachment and we get a file and we get an antique coin. And some other goodies in there if we have a space. So we'll just see how we get on. Right, let's depart. I've arrived at my destination. Oh, I'm not going to have space as fucking fish, am I? Oh, my good. Yeah, I'm not going to have space for this, I don't think. I think it takes up four slots. Wow, I did. I don't believe it. The meat takes up loads of space, doesn't it? The meat, four slots. It's going to be hard keeping hold of that. But I will craft the other one as soon as we get there because um, it's makes you run faster and um i'm actually going to sell everything except for the meat that i need well I, I guess i'll sell all the um food except for the meat it's going to be the only one we left need left right so um grab the antique coin grab the weapon attachment oh i've got no got no space for it right let's get rid of the anger ammo that's crap right let's weapon attachment get the file yes get the anger rounds right and um that's it Make sure you've got the attachment and the laptop. That's the important thing, guys. These attachments which you find in the world, if you do not find them, it means you're going to find them again at some point on another... Well, not again, but it just means you will have to find them at some point, even on another playthrough. Once you find it, um, after that, even if you sell it, you will not have to find it again. The Duke will just have it for sale. So, yeah, that's one good thing. When you find something, you don't have to find it again. It all sort of saves. Right, so we're done. Let's head into the factory. Yeah, I think normally when I head into the factory, I'm on about 2 hours 10 minutes. I think. Yeah, about 2 hours 10 minutes. I have wasted a bit of time. When I reloaded that safe, wasted a bit of time there. Um, yeah, wasted a bit of time reloading that safe to get a um, try look for the goat. Wasted a bit of time um, when I died on Urias. Can't believe I died on him, but shit happens. What's going on? Shit happens, don't it? He doesn't know me. He never brings my health down that fast. Never. I hope that's only boss that's going to be trouble for me. Right, let's place a giant's chalice. 
Yeah, I hope that's the only boss that's going to be trouble for me. Right, so, um, temporary measures. I healed, didn't I? But, um, I'm sure you get a free heal when you head into the factory. So, I probably wasted that last heal with the Duke. But I did need to get rid of some of my, um, food anyway. Got far too much. Yeah, so factory, and then it's Heinzenberg, and then Chris's section, and then Miranda, guys. And we've done this playthrough, and I'll jump into Mercenaries, and then after Mercenaries, we'll jump onto Village of Shadows, and Platinum Trophy should pop then right at the end of the game, on the, um, you know, game results screen, rather than in Mercenaries, where it normally pops. I've not played Mercenaries for quite a little bit, actually, so... um. Just hoping it doesn't take me too long to get used to it again. But mer mercenaries ain't too bad. Mercenaries ain't too bad. What time are we at? Two thirteen. Yeah. So I am, I am behind. I am behind. Wow. Where am I going? Yeah. Mercenaries ain't too bad. Um. I mean, I've played it a lot, so it can be it can be difficult. But once you get once you do get the hang of it, it's not it's it's not a bad. It's just getting the hang of it, I guess, which is the difficult part. But because I've only got to get S rank, it's not going to be too difficult. And what I'm going to do, as soon as I get S, I'm just going to, like, die. So it saves the score. I'm not going to bother about double S or anything. Yeah, so I'm just grabbing some crafting materials here. Got some scrap outside. Just got some... Uh, Gunpowder there, we'll see it. Chem fluid here. Right, let's open that. Skip. Shit. Round here. Under here and through that. Is there a trophy for not crafting anything, or is that just a challenge? I can't remember now. Um, because I crafted that first aid med, didn't I? Or did I do that before restarting? Because I know I did. I know I collected that first aid. That's actually first aid med in the boss area for you guys. So I forgot about. Fuck's sake! I forgot about that. Yeah, it's actually first aid med in the boss area, in one of the little um, shelves on the side. Yeah, I'm just thinking because if I. If there is a trophy of not crafting, I can't remember. It means. It means I'm with the shadows. I've got to do it without crafting anything. And that's going to be a little bit annoying. Just just if I need to craft a healing spray, basically. That's when it's going to be annoying. Fucking hell. Stop trying to pick that up. What I do when I when I get a moment, I'll um, quickly check this trophy for him. So I can't remember if it's a trophy for completing the game without crafting anything. I think it's just a challenge. I'm sure it's just a challenge. Right, so um, there's a misc trophy up here for shooting a soldat down, but I'm going to do that when I'm a little bit closer. And um, once you've done the factory, I'm, I'm going to sell the M19, so I won't need it no more. I'll keep it for here, so still a few things I need to shoot. Right, here he is. Man of the hour. Right, so uh, let's sell this. We can sell that now. Sell this, sell this. Um, keep the explosive rounds, like I say. We're going to need them later. Sell the attachment. We don't need it. Right, and uh, we can craft this now. Thank you. Now to cook. So movement speed increases permanently. I'd love for you to enjoy as well. Right, and watch we got here. Not a bad dish. I wish, yeah, I wish. Oh, it's poultry that I need there. Oh, it's like sell all the meat. Oh, it's only poultry that we need. Ah, cool. So I'm going to sell all the meat. Oh, awesome. That free up some inventory space. Right, so um, poultry, uh, sorry, uh, fish, don't need that no more, don't need that. I only need two lockpicks, so I sell one of them. Hey, 
Right, we're good guys. Let's go and do this. A good deal, if I say so myself. Gunpowder on there, what's it? Shoot that. Probably should have knifed it actually in case the bullet goes through and it's a bloody enemy from behind. I think it'd be fine. So that's like a metal door anyway. Right, so, um, yeah, best to use my knives on the doors from now on, just make sure, be safe. So, straight past these punks. Up here, we need to get the, the um, relief first, horse relief. And you can put the, the lock pick in there. That's it. I'm just going to get past these while I'm waiting. Excuse me, guys. Just want to get through, please. Thank you. Right, get a scrap. Get this quickly. A large suitcase. Well, got it. Right, let's go back to the molds, the foundry area. Hopefully these guys will let me pass. Excuse me, please. I'm asking nicely. Don't make me ask again. Right, get the um, yellow quartz in there. We have to come back up this bit a bit later. So if you do miss something, don't worry too much. We'll be back up there later. Right, let's use the relief mold. Right, while we're waiting for that to craft, we'll grab this. And this one, I think, always has 3,000 in. Yes. And then we'll grab this chem fluid. That's it, that's the thing in here. Right, let's grab the relief now. And let's lob it on the wall. If you ever undoubt where to put relief, reliefs always go on the walls. Right around this corner, we're going to use the lockpick here. Use it just here. There we go. We don't need lockpicks no more. We'll grab out loot on the way past later. Right, let's going to quickly make our way past these now. Obviously, try not to get hit. Yeah, be careful. They do. They can do quite a bit of damage to you, them bloody contraptions. So be very careful you don't get hit there by them. Alright, subscribe. Let's get an event. We'll be using that explosive round in a second. To reveal a secret area. Uh, freed up my inventory space quite a bit now as well. Right through there. Got the shotgun shells and the um, mechanical part for the cylinder. You know, I said we needed two um, two explosive rounds, but it's actually it's more like three that we need. It's more like about three that we need explosives. Right in here, that's a file on the left here. There we go. And grab the mold from there. Unlock this. Right, back around this way now. Because we need to head into the foundry, guys. So back through here. And uh, we're going to craft the cog now. Right, and that dude, he's going to come through and follow us. So we just lure him into our trap. It's like putting our hands. Come on, follow me here. Let's see, you can't really do much. Just play with him. Toy with your enemy. Right, we've got a cog mold down here and lob it in the slot for not the one for a circle, the one for a cog, of course. It looks like it's for a circle there. Right, back up a generator. It's backed up the power. Right, back to my knife. Got that scrap of air, I think it was. Oh shit, am I stuck? Right round here. Get your handgun ready. Through here, and large crystal there. Right, up here next. Right, I need to quickly shoot my way through here. 
There we go before he sees you and through here next. Quickly if you can. Quickly come through here. There's a um, treasure on here. I forget what it is now. I think it's a yellow quartz. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, up here next. Now the power's on, we can activate the little elevator thingy. Be quick as an enemy spawns down that container. Wow. No ammo, really. Well, I need some hunger now, by the looks of it. Oh, yeah, fuck. You should have never refused me, Ethan. Yeah, yeah, the quarter. Yeah, I had to use my magnum ammo. Oh, we've got some now, finally. Right, through here quickly, but you need to be quick, there's an enemy there. Just quickly come in here, quickly try and shoot this. Before the enemy reaches you. And then turn a left because Stum will come through the wall. Oh, we've got a fucking we've got to kill Stum yet with a knife. We've got Stum, Heinzenberg, um Urias, Chris, and um Miranda still. Still four enemies. Right through here, and there's a goat just up there. There he is. There he is, little fella. Freddo. That's Freddo that one. He's out. He's gone back to goat heaven. Right, we're going to shoot a soldat down now as well. But we'll just get a little bit, a tiny weeny bit closer. So I have more accuracy, more likeness to hit. Why make things hard when you can make them easy, right? Yeah, that's what I thought. Right, there we go. Shoot one of them babies down. And, uh, yeah, he'll quit hanging around. Now he's falling around. And um, get a trophy. Right, uh, bird cage. Crystal here. Or fragment. But it's a crystal oh, around here. Yes, and then stuff. into the vent. When he's getting a vent, turn to your grenade launcher, lob at the wall behind you. When you have to drop down the ladder, grab the four treasures in here. Happy days. Then back to grenade launch, you need one more explosive round. And just gonna shoot these now. So we've got that one there. We've got um, this one here. Then we've got this one. And then we've got this one up here, which you can you can't quite get it normally, but you can get if you use a grenade launcher. Like that, that's it. We don't need any more grenade launchers, that's all we needed them for. So all we need now really is the knife, I guess, and a pistol for shooting a few things. One. There's item there. There's one more go as um ETH well, I guess two more because I missed that one in Moreau section. Um that, but there should be one more go as Ethan, excluding that one in Moreau section, and there's one more goat. I was blocking. Yeah, it's annoying. Sometimes when you run into these, you just run straight into it. Um, their drill. Could let me put my safety goggles on at least. Always have safety goggles on when using a drill. Right, up the ladder. Now, if there's an enemy, if they both jump up, wait for them to attack before you try and climb the ladder. Yeah, let them attack first. Because otherwise, they'll attack you as you're climbing up. And it won't stun you. But you can still be attacked when you're climbing. It'll still damage you. So Sometimes they won't jump up until you've, after you've started climbing a ladder. If that happens, I just obviously keep climbing up. But if they, if they sort of jump just as you're making your way to the ladder, that's when you can get into trouble. Right, it's so a file here, guys. There we go. Grab that. And uh, then upstairs... Round the corner. Now be ready now. We need to shoot this thing in the middle quickly with your weapon. So just be ready ready with what you're using. There we go. Just shoot that once. 
You can use explosive round, it's a little bit easier with explosive actually. So obviously you've got an area of effect and you don't have to hit it dead on. Shit. That was close. Right, let's shoot that fucking crystal down. Another one for the collection. Right, let's pick my knife. Oh my god, really. Okay, we've got a goat, got a scrap. Yeah, so that's the last. No, I said there's one more goat, Ethan. I lied. There's actually another one as well. I forgot this one we, ju we got just now. I actually forgot about this at the time when I said it. Right, so I'll open this. What I will do for that for, uh, for that goat that we missed, um, I'll just um, when we actually get to that part in the in the game, I'll edit it into the video. I just put like a little note on screen to tell you if you want to get that goat then, rather than <laughs> rather than leaving it like I did. Yeah, maybe I'll do that. Put a screenshot on there as well so you know exactly where to look. <gasps> no way. Don't do that. Right, and we've got the key mold. we got the key mold. You know, I'm going to get Sheila Quartz in a minute, but I'm thinking if I didn't collect this on my last play, maybe I would have managed to do it in um in time. I just ha always have to go for this, I don't know why. So, that lift, while it's on its way up, I just go along here now and get yellow quartz while we're waiting. I mean, I did grab them shotgun shells there quickly. But that's only because I was passing them. Yeah, so here's the yellow quartz. There we go. Go out, grab that. And we're going to the lift now with the Duke. If it's still working. I'm sure the brakes having a lot of strain on them. Ah, yes. Right, mate. So, crystal fragment. Yes, large crystal. Yeah, Vivianite. Yellow quartz. Fuck a lot of them. Do not sell a mechanical part. Remember, need to keep. We need to keep the um, poultry as well. I'm keep the explosive rounds for now. And that's it, guys. We're good to go. Right, so back down to B4 now because we need to go and craft the key mold. We need to go and craft Heinzenberg's key. I guess if I didn't if I didn't go for that yellow quartz and if I didn't go for that mechanical part, the shaft, probably would have got a trophy, um the speedrun trophy on my um last knife only. Right, let's let these punks come out. These robo monks. Screen's a little bit bloody. Right, yeah, just block pa block your way past him. You got some more enemies down there. We'll do the same with all these as well. If you if there's no space to run past, just always block when you go past them. Right, let's quickly lob that there. Heinzenberg's key. Key mode, there we go. Right, let's just go and loot this area and get the last attachment. Attachment for the Magnum. And, oh, I didn't even realise I could go in. I uh, locked pig, don't know why I grabbed that. Hang on bullets. Fuck. What's reloading, you cheeky bastard? Right, attachment there. For the Magnum. Right, so let's attach that straight away. Wow. Oh, I clicked. Did I click an examine? I wonder what that was. Right, let me pass, mate. I get it. 
You need to drill somebody. Oh, and here comes the other one. Following me, are you? Right, let's get a key mode now. Whoa, let's get Heinzenberg's key. There we go. I don't want the key mode. That's not really going to help us at this point. Right, we've got that Magnum ammo from before. And um, why well, it's not letting me use Heinzenberg's key? Ah, oh, here we go. So I just want the shaft in here. I just want the shaft quickly. There he is. Because this sells for loads. Right, let's combine them. Wow. That sells for loads. It's awesome. I think it's about... It's got to be, what, 70,000 or something? Wow, he's following me everywhere. Leave me alone, you stalker. Iron Man. He's got the react arc reactor chest energy chest um, fuel source. Right, when you run past him, make sure you're always blocking because sometimes they just like instantly attack you, and you won't block it unless you're already blocking. Right. Um, it's sold out. It's going to let him come down here. You can sort of push past him. He does sort of push out of the way, but I'm just going to let him come down to me. It's a bit quicker. Well, I don't know, actually. It's probably about the same time. Right, let's go. Let's go back on that lift. Let's go and kill Storm. Storm. Let's go and kill him. Right, let's see what you got to sell first, mate. Let me just sell a few things. Yeah, get rid of that. Don't need that no more. Uh, I'll sell them. I guess we'll keep everything else for now. Why not? Right, let's get over to B1 and then we'll make a save, Duke. What do you say, what do you say, Duke? Shall we make a save? Don't worry, it missed you. Be careful not to waste your ammunition. Don't worry, mate. It's just a pistol. I'm doing knife only. Do you understand what that means? Knife doesn't have ammo. Ha. Huh. Learn some every day, Duke, eh? Hey? He wondered. All this time he's been wondering why he did not find any stock for ammo for the knife. Now he knows his answer. Right, so Heinzenberg's key. No, six-winged unborn key will not fit here. Right, it's file. File through here, and we'll grab the first aid med. Guess we can use it from Randa later. We don't, we we don't want to use any more first aid meds, by the way. Um, but it's, we're just saving it for Miranda. I've used one, so I can spare three more. Right, it's done. Here he is. Let's kill him. Right, yeah, just be quick, guys. Just keep baiting him to run into the wall opposite you. Next year, just bait him to run into the wall. There we go. And um, he'll get stuck just because he's blind. Probably. I mean, if you've got a fan for a head, I'm sure you're going to be blind or something. Yeah, be careful. Sometimes he does this. What was he doing? What's he doing? I don't even know what he's doing then. You know when I went past him, it looked like he stopped and he was like moving his. I was gonna say moving his third, but he ain't got one. Yeah, because sometimes you just do that. He'll just stop and like turn around. He doesn't always go for you straight away. Come on, propeller head. Right, so just got to keep hitting this weak point. Right, 
Wow. He's not even on fire yet, so it's taking a while. Yes. When he's on fire, get out of the way. Oh, he's not on fire. Wow. Shit, I thought he was going to catch me then. Oh, he's on fire now. Alright, let's get, get out of the way. Probably going to breathe fire on me. Yes, there we go. Yeah, we'll let him run for me. Wow. That was close. <laughs> I thought that I thought there's a little path there I could move down the side, but there's not. Breathing fire again. I hate it when he has fire. It just makes him t take makes him take longer between attacks. Wow. Well, okay. I'm putting this a bit too close. That was very close then. Oh cool, fire's gone out. Oh shit. I'm gone, I'm not there no more. If you didn't notice. Yep. That's too strong. That's metal. He's flaming pissed off again. F flaming hell. Wow. Come on, Stum. Let's do this. Come on, come at me, come at me. There you. Where's he gone? Oh. A mine. Guess what, mate? You missed. Wow, it caught me then, propeller. Mate, that was lame. You basically heated up the wall in front of you. Where the fuck are you going? Yeah, it's just going the furthest corner away from me. Yeah, what he does is he... Uh, Sometimes you like curving an arc if you move away from him at an angle, sort of. Let's see if we'll do it now. Oh, he's breathing fire right now. Come on, mate. I'm over here. Okay, he's stuck in the air now. I think he ran into a fly. Got stuck in a fly. Is he dead? I could tell if he's dead then. Wow. He's behind that wall. Here he comes. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wow. That was very lucky, guys. Bloody hell. You're joking. He had literally like two knives left. Stay down. Stay down, dog. That's it. Turn to ash. We'll get a complex mechanical heart. We'll come in here. We'll grab the file. We'll grab Chris's cigar. Ethan's going to lick it now. Look, it's been in Chris's mouth. I know what it's like, Ethan. Dirty man. Right, go there. Yeah, that's the last go. Ask Ethan Winters. Right, one more go, and let's ask Chris. Well, we've got to go in Moreau section, of course. Right out here. 
Not many files left. There's one on a the laptop. Then the last few are as Chris Redfield's. The legend. Right, let's go across the cherry picker. Easy. Easy does it, Ethan. Right, let's extend that a bit more. Okay, I mean raise. There we go. Cutscene, skip it. Again? Through here. Heisenberg's Heisenberg's not too bad. Um Heisenberg is just They're all they're all annoying. And um I'm I'm gonna grab his first aid med as well. Because then we can use that for um Morendo. Yeah. File there, make sure you get the file. Yeah, Heisenberg it's more you have to hit his head and um he keeps moving out of the way. So it can be a little bit annoying, but he, he doesn't take too many slashes. That's one good thing. He's not like um, Urias and, um, Mur um, I guess, Moreau weren't too bad, the explosive barrels. But like um, Urias and um, Dimitrisk took, like, probably like 100 knives, probably more. Definitely Urias, wow. He takes so much bloody damage. I don't even know, you know you see a soldier that's down below where if you can shoot them with the tank and it counts. I don't know. But it'd be really funny if um, the heretic trophy pops. That means I accidentally shot. That means I shot it without in, unintentionally one time. Yeah, rocket on that gate to destroy it. Yeah, now this boss is really obviously on casual. To begin in the tanks, really easy. Um, but on, Vill on village shadows, it's actually quite hard in the tank. Yeah, it's quite difficult in the tank. So what you want to do, you just want to use your rocket when he charges at you. To knock him back. Yeah, you can use your rocket to knock him back. Once you've shot his weak point about five times, five of his weak points on casual, he sort of enters his next phase. So once you've got all three, they'll all spawn again. There we go, and that's it. It's last phase. So it, it's about it's about four shot. Um, you destroy four weak points, and then a little bit more damage, and he's dead. I guess we did destroy that weak point when he was um, trying to summon the um, side of container. I guess. Right, so in this beat you need to shoot a rocket at him, guys. Shoot a rocket right into his eye socket. That's it, we've got a knife him now. Fun and games begins. Yeah, so this is really difficult. Uh, sorry, not difficult, just awkward. Just make sure you're always blocking when he's going to attack. And he attacks a lot quicker than all the other enemies. Yeah, and it's quite, it can be quite difficult to tell when he's going to attack as well like that. Just make sure you're blocking when he's going to attack. Yes, yeah, so he's going to attack now. Going to attack now. Yeah, he sort of raises his head when he's going to attack. Yeah, so this is basically how you attack him. It's really, really awkward. Just obviously keep an eye on where his head is so you can get to him quicker to keep knifing. If you make sure you're not too close to him, you can sort of see where his head lands. And after so many slashes, yeah, you'll sort of stun him a little bit like that. Yeah, move back a bit as you're blocking. You can sort of see where his head lands a bit easier. Yeah, so when you're blocking, move back. I'm right against the wall now, I think. Well, well, well. Yeah, 
Yeah, so sometimes you go mad like this. When he's doing this combo, just keep blocking. Yeah, he does quite a big combo. Right, like, where's his head gone? Where's your head out, mate? Oh, there it is. Like, right up against the bloody wall. Oh, I think he missed me then. Right, so let's move away. Yeah, just make sure you see that coming. Wait for an attack. When he raises his head, wait for an attack. Do not drop your guards. Right, it should be almost dead in it. Right, I'm going to move this way now. Alright, he missed. No, Chris Redfield's my fan. That's not true. Me and Chris go way back. Best buddies. Alright, where are you? Definitely. Yeah, I love it. I love using the butter knife. Right, obviously, when he does this, he's gonna. This is when he does his big combo. Where he does his sort of um, telekinesis attack sort of thing. You finished? Well, he's gonna attack. Yeah, wait, wait for that. Yeah. Why? Where's his head gone? I fucking hate it when he knocks you too far. You can't get. Okay. He knocks you too far away. Okay, couldn't even reach him then. What was he said? Come on, Heinzenberg. Just lay down and die. Moldatron. You're not a transformer, it's wanna be transformer in it. You'll never be a transformer in it. You are missing that one important ingredient called energy. And you do not know the universal greeting, do you? Do you know the universal greeting, Heisenberg? How's it go? No, exactly, you don't know, do you mate? It's called Bar Week One or Week Mini Bar. Yep, that's the universe. Whoa, shit, yeah, block. Wow. Yeah, Bar Week One or Week Mini Bar. That's the universal greeting, mate. Oh my god, still haven't got him. Not scary. Nope, no. Come on, you can do better than that, can't you? Is that all you got, Heinzenberg? You man or a... I was going to say man or a machine. You are a machine. What are you? Through the pile of flesh. Got ya. Right, while I'm waiting for him to die, let's go and grab a bit of loot around the area. That'd be a bit of ammo we can sell later. Yeah, all this ammo we're collecting, you're probably thinking, why am I collecting all this? Because, yeah, why is, he, why is he collecting all this fucking ammo? He's not using it. It's just so we can sell it later. This, all this ammo we sell, it does add up. It does add up. It does. Yeah. Can I say that again? It adds up. Alright. So, what a waste of time. Cannot loot him. Alright, so that's it, guys. That's Heinzenberg done. On to Chris now. Enter the Redfield. Wow. Can't wait. Can't wait to play Chris Redfield. It's my hero. I want to be like him when I grow up. Whee! So I, I, I'm alive. Killed him with the Matrix of Leadership. 
You're dead. Completely dead. Completely dead. Oh, Crystal Heinzenberg, Iron Giant down. No, do not give him that title. Do not make his ego any bigger. Alpha. Alpha team, come in. Alpha team, this is stars. We found a residence. It's infested with killer dogs. Shall we enter? Yes, we need to look for Kenneth. Captain, I've confirmed the death of Ethan Winters. Well, he needs sacking. He's obviously not very good at confirming things, is he? You need actual evidence to confirm something. Did he check for a pulse? I guess not. Been a while since we fought together, Captain. That's it. When was the last? The desert? Fuck no, I don't even remember where you were. Oh yeah, we should get a trophy now. Map mathematician, guys. Oh yeah, we can only use the um, knife. Um, shortcut, yes. Yeah, we can only use a knife. Yeah, this knife is a lot better than Ethan's piece of shit. Gonna slice me a steak. Mathematician! Yay! Happy days. Well, no, I'm gonna block. Okay, I'll keep my weapon out, so now I can think I can punch you away if I get grabbed. Right, haymaker. Right hook. Gonna piece of me? Roger that. You want a piece of me as well? Go and, go and join your friend on the floor. Space there for two of you. BSA craft spotted. Don't get cocky. <laughs> Don't get cocky. That's rich coming from Chris Redfield. Very, very rich. Wow. That's probably what we're in. Who watered the plants? Let's go. They've just been sprinkled with some very strong water. Roger, thanks for that. Excuse me. Yeah, you, can, you guys can stay in there. Whoa! Wait for me, drop my guard. Fuck off. Take my fist to your nose. Go on. Right. Who wants to lay down? You wanna lay down? You wanna lay down as well? Right, you can kiss the floor. Right, go on. You go down. Right, you wanna join your buddies on the floor? Who's gonna be a last one standing, eh? Or you have long hair? Yeah. That's it. Just fell in a piece of lichen shit. Service him right. Right, you've got to use a laser pointer thingy now. Use the flare. Use the sparkler. There we go. Lightsaber. LZ answerer. Right, it's got to wait now. Just a minute. Just a minute. Hello, lichens. How are we today? Can you wait for my laser to charge up, please? Go and try and get. See how long you guys can get confused behind the statue in the center. Missed. Okay, Captain. I'm reloaded. Ready when you are. Right, make sure it's at the top so you don't damage any lichens. Hold your horses. I'm reloading. Hold your relief off of horses. That's it, you fight that vine, she's ready to take battle to the vine. Sword and shield in hand. What are you looking at, punk? Wow, what happened? Oh, my visor changed, right. And we have done it, guys. Oh, what happened then? It like reset. Right, you're dead, guys. 
Oh my god, for some reason, one of them didn't count. I don't know why. I think one of them didn't count, for some reason. Yeah, she normally only got to do it like three times. So, I'm not quite sure what happened there. Okay. Look, you're not allowed in. Alright, if you must. Toilets through there. If you want to make a phone call, go for it. Wow. Oh, it like resets if you're not actually aimed on anything. Right, that's it. I don't know why it took an extra shot. Sometimes it does. Yeah, sometimes it does take an extra shot. I'm going in. The rest of you stay back. You just gotta make sure you don't aim too low that it actually hits the lichens at the same time. Because if, if you aim it too low and they get caught in the blast radius, you'll void your no trophy run. Uh, no knife run. Uh, sorry, knife only run. No weapons. I get there in the end. Right, so with this knife, you just gotta hold block and then keep slashing. Hold block and keep slashing, and you can slash a lot quicker. Yeah, and this one takes ages. Obviously, don't heal, we just want to keep blocking. And you've got to keep hitting this leg. Yeah, this one here, just keep attacking this one. Just keep, never stop attacking. Because you're holding block and doing this, you'll block most of his attacks anyway. And you'll find if you can stun him like this, you can sort of get him in a stun lock. Yeah, you know, just once you've knocked him down for the first time, like stagger him like this. You can sort of stun lock him. Okay, it didn't quite work there. Yeah, if you're quick enough, you can knock him, sort of stagger him straight away. After once he recovers. Bloody hell, my fingers already killing. Oh, I don't know what's going on right now. Yeah, so this combo is... This combo does like three or four swings. Yeah, so there we go, knocked him down again. So like that, guys. If you quit, you can sort of knock him down again. And I'm crouched at the moment. Right under his kneecap. Okay, my finger's going to drop off. Where's well, it gone? Oh, I've got a break for a second. I need an auto button. Uh, sorry, yeah, turbo button. Wow, that make it so easy. Oh, 
Okay, I stunned him again, but I can't even get get can't even get to the side of him. I don't know this is quite a good spot actually. Is he dead? Wow, got him. See that didn't take too long actually. That wasn't too bad. I bet we're not far off three hours actually. We'll see, we'll see in a minute. Right, go and shoot this. Goat this goat should be the last one by the way. It should be the last one. Um, yeah, providing, obviously, providing you haven't missed any. Yeah, it should be a last one, this. But it's not going to be a last one for me, because I've missed a few. Moldy little bird told her, maybe? Moldy little bird told her. Focus on the plan. Moldy little bird. Fucking, what a stupid excuse. Right, Chris Redfield, my skin tight shirt. There we go, it's a goat there. That should be goat 20 guys, but that's going to be goat 19 because I missed the one in Moreau section. Like I said, we're going to get that on Village of Shadows. Village of Shadows. But it's the one in Moreau section. You can't, I mean, if you just, you could quickly just Google it and find out exactly where it is. Or you can just wait and we'll get that on when we do Village of Shadows. Alright, so. Rest, this is going to be the rest of the files, so you got one here. Obviously, make sure you open them up and examine them, guys. File there. File here. File number four in this room. And then there's file, another two files in this room. So we've got this middle one here, and this one here, which should pop the bookworm trophy. There we go, yes. Well, thank God that bloody worked. I always miss a file somewhere, I'm glad I didn't. Right, so we just got Miranda to kill. Good old Miranda. Did I collect the um Did I collect the the um crystal from that giant we just killed? I hope I did. For some reason I feel like I didn't collect it. I'm alive. Just got frostbite. Oh, my penis. I've been laying on it. Ouch. Never mind, the mold will just grow me a new one. Right, so just wait for Ethan to look at his hands again and then you can skip it. There we go. I'll save you, no matter what. Right, so just before we carry on, there's a few things we need to do first, guys. A few things we need to do first. Um, we need to fully upgrade the... Well, we're going to make a save first. Grab a few, we're going to grab the items in the area and make a save. And we're going to fully upgrade the Magnum, fully upgrade it, and fully um, attach all the attachments as well so that we can buy infinite ammo for it. Go. Just ready. That's ready for um, a new game plus. Right, oh yeah, I can't grab anything, can I? Right, so, Duke, where am I going? You know, let's see what time I'm at. Three, wow, three hours I one. I'm about five minutes behind what I normally am. Damn. Oh yeah, we got it. And I'm actually quite a bit of money behind, actually. Wow. Right, so I can, I can actually sell the um, handgun as well now, by the way. Yeah, I can sell that as well, and get rid of these, get rid of them, don't need them no more. Yeah, get rid of this, get rid of that, and I'm going to craft this now. That will heal me as well. Yeah, what, what you can do, um, you just, you can get a bit more money if you sell the grenade launcher, but we do want the grenade launcher going into New Game Plus. Right, so I've upgraded that health. Yes, you too, mate. And remember, I've still got three... I can still heal three more times. So, if you ever get too low health with Miranda, you don't want to be in the red because she can kill you if you block similar to, like, Urias. So, yeah, if that happens, you do want to heal. So I'm just going to take a few healing items into the battle. I'm going to take two in there. Right, and uh, let's just sell all this. What's that put me at? So, okay. So, if I need to, I can sell a grenade launcher. 
but we should be be okay right so there's my save i'm actually going to save back over that one right so we're just going to fully upgrade the magnum guys so we can buy infinite ammo for it before we go into new game plus right so um got his attachment i'm going to reload this afterwards obviously so we get the trophy the frugal father trophy right so just going to fully upgrade that now guys and that will make infinite ammo available ready for new game plus If I need to, I can sell a grenade launcher. Delighted to. I might have to. Oh, just got enough. Look at that. Look how much I got left. Right, so that's a Magnum, guys. Fully upgraded. Fully upgraded. So that's infinite ammo unlocked for it. Let's restart. Right, so that will cancel that. I gotta go. oh. Right, let's go and do this, guys. Let's go and kill Miranda with only my knife. And my ninja skills. Look at me, I'm walking so slowly, trying to psych myself out for this battle. Ew. Out of my way. Just gave birth to a fully grown monk. Nice. Abominations, these people are. Gotta keep going. Yeah. That's right, Chris. Words of a tough man. Right. Let's do it. Let's go and get sore fingers. Let's go and improve that finger action. Now, please do not worry, the little Rose. I assure you, I'll provide her with truth. She'll still take damage even when she's covered in this layer of wax, whatever it is. Um, she takes reduced damage, yes, but she will still take damage. I said, just keep knifing, guys. Just knife away. Come to me, that's it. How do you feel, Miranda? Get slashed by a butter knife. That's a feel. Pitiful Ethan, Ethan Winters. The weakling beating you up with a little butter knife. Right, yeah, when she summons these orbs, just keep trying to attack her in the bottom of her feet. Um, but obviously be ready to block when they're about to explode. Like now. That's it. Yeah, just keep just keep attacking her. Sometimes it's hard to tell if you attack you're actually making contact, but Okay, you missed. You missed Miranda. Okay, you hit me that time. I'll give that to you. I mean, I wasn't a high target. I was just standing still. If I don't finish you, Miranda, you do know that Chris Redfield will. You know that, right? Where are you going? Oh, yellow, it's going yellow. Blocking time. Block and block. Oh, shit. Oh, I can't reach you. You're lucky you're too far. You're lucky too high up and I can't jump. You're lucky. I am handicapped, you know that, right? Okay, so you can sort, you can try and, when she appears here, you can move around and knife at the same time. I think sometimes you get a few hits in, like this. Yeah, sometimes you get a few hits in. I will. I will, take back my will you? Oh, she got hit in them. Well done, Miranda. I'll let you have that one. Die, die, oh, where are die, you now? Die, die, die. Die, die, die. <laughs> yeah, I heard you the first time. I, I take it you want me to die, Miranda. Is that what you said? Miranda, what did you say? You want me to die? Could you repeat your last? Okay, obviously we cannot avoid this. This is the invincible orb of yellow stuff, yellow goo. A century? Is that all? Oh. 
after all. Everyone dies. Yeah, you'll find out in a minute. You'll find out all about that in a minute. Don't worry, Miranda. Like you said, everyone dies. Let me show you exactly what that means. Why do you interfere? Go on then. Try it for your spider legs. She's my goddamn daughter, you psycho! No, 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 you're not. Your life is over, Mr. Why did you Oh, meant to, oh, I didn't block in time. Wow, nice dance moves, Miranda. I saw a little spin. I liked it. Oh, if I get in red, I'm, I'm healing. If I get into red, I am healing. I'm not taking any risks. Everybody dies, I know, but... Yeah, hold still. Yeah, oh, come on, attack me. Let me hold still for you. Oh, I'm going to hold still for you, Miranda, because I'm like that. I like to give my enemies a fighting chance. Right, where is she? It's pretty what you've done here, Miranda. You know, all the candles around the outside. Nice and romantic. I like it. I think she's in denial. She really, lo she really likes you, though. She's got a crush on him. Look at her dancing in front of me. A little spin move. She's just a bit clumsy though. She keeps hitting me. When she tries to spin around. Okay, what happened? Where's she gone? Come down here. You walking corpse. Why won't you die? Here we go. We're good. We're golden. Right, Magnum time. It doesn't matter if you use any weapon on this bit, by the way. It doesn't matter if you use a weapon on both parts, even. I'm going to shoot that first. There we go. Oh, it looks like I completely missed. Right, Miranda next. You can keep the weapon. A lot of play. A lot of guys say this last bit. You have to use a knife. You don't. You can use a weapon. Right, and um, wait till she gets closer. There we go. Oh no, she's dead. Right, we did it, guys. We completed it. Knife only. I hope. <laughs> Lady, I imagine that trophy don't pop. Wow. What's that? About three minutes, five five minutes behind. It's difficult doing doing it three hours on a knife only new game. Very difficult. You can do it with a Karen bit. I've done it, but it's just quite difficult doing it new game. Don't trust that snake oil. And what's a knife only one called? Yeah, knives out. There we go. Three minutes. Well, three hours. Oh, eight. Right, unlocked all that. Didn't get much um, CP. Obviously, make sure you make a safe game afterwards. Very important. We got Frugal Father. Got all them important ones done. Right, so let's do mercenaries now, guys. Um, yeah, let's go straight into mercenaries. Well, um, what we'll be doing, by the way, we're going to buy... Yeah, so we'll buy infinite ammo for this. Infinite ammo for that. And we'll also buy infinite ammo for the Dragoon. I best buy that, just so it's ready for Chris's section. And we also need the current, um, the WCX unlocked, so we can get it from the shop. We also need that unlocked. And where's infinite ammo for the Dragoon? There it is. But once we've done mercenaries, we'll be able to unlock that anyway. And even if you don't do mercenaries straight away, you'll, uh, even if you went through a game, you would complete some challenges along the way. But it's going to do this, so I'm just going to quickly get S ranks, guys. And then I'm just going to get killed. Yeah, I'm not going to mess around. Right, S rank is 630,000. 630,000. Oh, yeah, I want to keep that. Yeah, 630,000. There he is. Ah, 
Okay. Got no more. I'm skilled at all yep, we're good. And we'll do right, let's again. do it. 630,000. I wonder if I can get Merzno's done in an hour. I know it takes two hours about if you're going for triple S. This V61 is a beast once you get start getting it upgraded. Well, he went with a he went out of a bang. You you stay there for a minute, will you? I'm getting all this gear just so I can sell it later. Well, all this sort of um, loot, sorry. Shit, forgot to reload. Right, oh, where's that lichen? There he is. Oh, what have we got in here? Agile, yes, please. What? You didn't die, you lucky sucker. Right, let's just sprint down here to spawn the um, armoured lichen. Right, where is he going? Trying to come up in between the gravestones, are you? Alright, you can go to sleep right there. 630,000. I've got to remember that. Nice change of pace. I like this. I like doing this in the middle. Alright, what we've got here? Um, I'm not getting many. I'm not getting many damage ones, am I? Wow. I'm not getting anything in relation related to damage, am I? Oh, I just kill him quickly. Keep a combo going. Oh wow. That was very lucky. Not for an armored guy. Lucky for me, not for him. Get them on the way back. This is so slow to reload though. I'll get upgraded on the um, next one. Right, there's 28. Always spawn to the left here. 29 to 30 on the way back to the goal. We'll get a max combo trophy here. There we go. Combo King. Area complete. Right, how many points are we on? Uh, I wonder if I can get enough at the end of this next area. A window shop away. Right, beast. They're in trouble now when I get this bad boy upgraded. Yeah, I always go for power first with this. Always go for power first. I think I need to anyway, the fact that I've not got any damage upgrades yet in the blue orbs. Should not. I don't normally go for that so early. And I do not go for the blue orb that's down at the far end, so it always gets me into trouble. Not on not on this difficulty, but it does on um, on the second maps. Still, why is why is it close? In fighters, see, in fight is not really good for this. Right, I think that's all of them, yeah. There's normally eight before it's time to move on.
Oh, I just want to get a blue orb first. Third or shooter. Oh, that will do for now, I guess. Last four enemies. Oh shit. That's it. All good. Let's go. Oh, what are we on? Um, what score are we on? Uh, I don't need much more, do I? Shall I choose something for you? Probably don't need to sell all this. Um, ah. I'm not going to have to do much in this next bit just to get enough, am I? I thought I remember that you, you get enough to fully upgrade the V6 one quite early on. Um, but I guess I'm sort of misremembering. I'm not getting anything related to damage <laughs> for my pistol. Wow. Oh, whoa, got them all. Oh, it's because one blew up. I didn't realise he blew up and killed the others. Wow. But yeah, it looks like I'm going to have to do four levels on um, the one versions. Okay, we'll go for Pistol Master. I don't know what one does long more damage out of them actually. You know, the Out of Reach and the Pistol Master. Yeah, I don't know which one does the most damage, so... Um Bloody hell, looks like I've got to do the full level anyway. Well, I've got my damaged parts for the end, I guess. <laughs> there they are. That was lame accuracy, that was. Oh, well, I've got enough now, but I'm at the end. I might as well finish it. Okay, so, um,. Oh, of course, that's why. It's because you have to get B rank in all the first four levels in order to get an extra 5,000. Oh, of course. Welcome. I forgot about, I forgot that he forgot about that. As always, a trustworthy fair exchange. Oh, so let me. Yeah, don't forget to sell that piece of shit. Looking forward to testing it out. I am actually. I am. Thank you, Duke. Securing goods is more important. All right, let's go. Let's go test this baby out. Are you with me, Duke? Start. Oh, we got the armored guy, ain't we? Shall I just leave him? I mean, I do normally, I do normally kill him, but do I really need to on him? Um, casual. I mean, I won't get a full combo if I do, will I? Okay, fuck it. I'll go and kill him. Why not?
shoot you in your leg. Can't really guard against that, can you? I've got how I normally kill him on him. Um, on the on the casual versions, I know I, I remember how to do it on um, the harder ones. Right, I hope, hopefully I want lightning speed. I'll go for pistol master. Right, it's nine. Yeah, we're good to go. Just habit, I always have to get all the items. Habit. Um I no, don't matter. Doesn't matter on this difficulty, does it? Yeah, I normally love a pipe bomb there, but it doesn't matter on this difficulty. Uh what we got? Uh out of reach, yeah, let's do it. Oh, I'm getting some better damage ones this time. I bet I don't get any movement ones now. Lightning speed is the best one. Yeah, it decreases your damage taken a little bit, but it's outweighs the speed outweighs the extra damage you do. So you shouldn't really be getting hit anyway. Yeah, you shouldn't really be getting hit anyway. So um, yeah, and I didn't check what S rank was on this, did I? Yeah, what's S rank? Um, one one point five mil. Wow. Something yeah, I want to just sell all this crap, mate, and um, upgrade my V6 one a bit more. 1.5 mil. Mm. It's funny how um, Village of Shadows, you can get like triple S within like only an area or two. But on um, the ver first versions, you have to almost get to the last area in order to get that S rank. Yeah, it's funny that. Very, very funny. Right, yeah, I'll get that orb in a second. I like to I like to stick to my sort of strategy that I follow. Won't make any mistakes then, especially when it comes to the two versions. Excuse me. Right, what we got? Um, yeah, I do not want all born. I do not like to increase my movement speed no matter what my speed is. Right, get us all, and we're good to begin. Out of reach. Um, out of reach. Right, in trouble now, guys. Ho 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 ho. Yeah, this one I have to be quite a bit different when it's on um, Village Shadows difficulty. And this V6-1, the, the first shot does actually penetrate. Can you see? It does actually penetrate the first shot. Alright, yeah, eventually these guys should spawn up here. Whoa, 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 whoa. That's it. I think we're ready to go. Right. Should be in 29 kills when I'm about ready to leave here. Yes, there they are. They're all here. Wow. Excalibur floating in the air. Only Excalibur can do that. Right, good to go. Yeah, they're the magical spawning lichens. Yeah, if you wanna if you wanna follow me better on these, you best off checking out my beginners guides for all these. Where I pause, I pause it as we go along, and I explain everything as well. 
fucking hell, went the wrong way, idiot. It's the middle lane. Right, what we got? Magic magazine? No, I want out of reach. No, don't you dare buy me. So it must be combo when they grab you for about, it takes about a minute. Right, we're good. Yeah, on this area, there's no item down there, like there is on, um, is it area five? There's a timer down there. Right, so we're way off, still way off. We still need another million, almost. Welcome. Right, let's, um, yeah, also I could get the loot because it sells for quite a bit. This should be enough. Aha. Wow. Yes. Gonna test tear up some enemies now. Wow. What I have to do at the end of um at the end of Mercenaries, I'll just have to see what trophy, trophies we've got left. Um, just in case there's any that I haven't missed. Any that I've missed that I need to um, get again. Um, what have we got? Why are we not getting... Um, I'm not getting uh, any speed ones now, am I? Alright, let's quickly get rid of these. Where's he gone? Probably already got him. I know in a minute. I know when I find out what number kills we're on. Once we've done this, once all the um, flying enemies spawn, we should be on 20, 21 kills. Yes, we are. Right, alright, let me go and get the um, timer. Alright, I need to kill one more of these. Oh shit, I got them both by mistake. Right, blue orb. Um, still no, still no movement. I hate it when you get one, when it, when one or the other. I like to get an, like a good little mix, like you get movement speed and you get damage. Right, need to be quick before he drops down. Agile, finally. That's better. I still need one more area left anyway, isn't there? Is that it? Yeah, last two coming down the steps. Wow, straight on your head, mate. Completely fucking missed. Well, that's what the ammo is for in case I miss. Right, what's that going to put us at? Well, it's got to be almost 1.5 mil. Ah, uh, 1.3. Bloody hell. Seeking something in particular. I might. Not, I'm not going to sell anything. I might not have to. These hands are more dexterous than one. Ah, uh, yeah, I'm good. Don't have to sell anything. So I got to mess about and sell the selling menu. Right, let's do this.
Wow. Right, where's the armoured guy? There he is. Oh, he's almost dead. Yeah. Don't know what happened to him. Right, now it's your turn, little doll. Oh, you lucky thing. Wow. I hate these flaming guys. Yeah, you think, oh, it's only them guys, but on fire, they're harmless. But the extra movement speed does make him much more difficult, especially on Village of Shadows. What are you looking for? Ah, there he is, last one. Right, give me some money. Yeah, I always like to grab the money. It's habit, guys. It's habit to grab everything. Easy. There's not many blue orbs on this level either, is it? Yeah, not many blue orbs at all. Yeah, my my um, guides, my beginner guides have done this as well. I don't use any blue orbs and we get triple S. So yeah, they're very helpful guys. If, um, if you're having trouble, it shows you like a minimum build. So um, they should fit any play style. Any sort of all build that you get, they will do the trick. What we got? Um, no, I don't even need that one, so I don't know I've got it. So there's only one blue orb on this level then, on area 5. Only one blue orb, literally. There's quite a few time. Um, well, I guess there's two time timers on there. You're lucky. Well, I was lucky then. Alright, where is he? Where's the big guy? Here he comes. Did I miss him? Idiot. You know what's going to happen here? I'm going to ruin my combo. I oh, know, I've got another pipe bomb. It's alright. Quick. Wow. I thought I was going to lose my combo then. So that pipe, that first pipe bomb missed. Okay, cool. That's um, Castle 2. Uh, sorry, not Castle 2. Castle, now Factory. Right, this one's only got two areas. On um, When I do the number two versions, I'm only getting what's needed for S rank, and then that's it. I'm getting killed. No way I'm doing more, that's need, more than the, what's needed. So that should make the second maps go by There's much quicker. I'm hoping. That extra 5,000 yet actually really helps. So what have we got? 1.1 um, mil near enough. Yeah, that extra 1 million you get actually really helps. So 1.1 uh, mil. Let's do this. Take down the enemies. Of course. Of course.
I just keep I keep getting mixed up my um, my number two strategy. That's what I keep doing here. I'm stopping here like I do my two strategy. It don't, it don't matter. It doesn't matter. Better I remember that more than I guess my first strategy. Um, what we got? Oh, Born No, Magic Magazine. Yeah, we'll take that. Right, they'll be here in a minute. And they're dead. Hopefully the end of this one I'll probably be able to um, hopefully fully upgrade this. So many enemies on area 1 off the uh, factory. He's dead. Another one bites the dust. Did I get agile? I think I did, didn't I? Come on, mate. Don't take it down. Just crawl out of the floor. Where's your mate? There he is. No. I was scared that I was going to bloody miss him then. Right, quick gets blue orb, and that lie can best get to me in time. He does some village on the second version. There he is. Yeah, he's coming. Right, what shall we go for? Execution is really good, by the way. Yeah, um, you, you do quite a lot more extra damage when the health's below 30. There's nothing in these secret areas, by the way. I tried it once. I thought it's got to be some goodies in there. Nothing. Five blue orbs in there, surely. Thanks for knocking that down for me, mate. Your services are no longer required. Right, there's you. And you may just pop around the corner. There he is. That's literally where he spawns, where he was standing. Right, what we've got. Um, out of reach. Let's go for that. What's he up to? Eating his dinner. Skinning a rat, are we? Times are desperate. We have to drink a blood for rat. Uh, <laughs> drink a rat for blood. We up to you, mate. Hiding. All right, come, uh, Cassandra. Bloody, I'm not very accurate with that, am I? Oh, yeah. Out of reach. I'm getting some good damage ones on this, aren't I? Right, where are they? Oh. You lucky thing. Oh, I'm going to run out. My combo's going to go. No. Wow. That's lucky. Forget about my combo then. Because I normally got a magnum there, so I'm thinking about number two maps. I've normally got a magnum. Obviously, don't have it on this. Wow. Look here, I've got plenty of bullets. Oh, got the armor dude here. Oh, yeah, that's what the mine is for. Be quick, though. Oh, never mind, he died anyway. 
Right. I'm going to shoot you in the leg, mate. Hey, you didn't like that. Look how much damage it does. It's, it's awesome, that is. That, um, more damage when they're at 30% health. Pretty cool. Right. Pipe bomb for this guy. He's going to run into that. Oh, and he's already dead. Poor fella. Oh, yeah, shit. The, um, spawns around the back here. Forgot about you, almost. Right, blue orb. What we've got here? Um, what show it? Let's go for out of reach. What is break shot again? Forgot. I think that's when the help is for you do more damage. Yeah. Well, good thing that what well, pistol master sort of affects everything though. You know, pistol master and um, long range shots. So it's definitely something you want to get. It's going to say where's that barrel, but that pipe bomb I think detonated it. Right, so it's 1.1 1. 1. 1 mil, wasn't it, for um, S rank? Uh, so I don't need, uh, I don't need much more, but I've got to go through quite a bit of level by the looks of it. Because most of your score comes at the end from the time bonus. This simple modification can be done in just a moment. Right, um, yeah. Wow, look at all this ammo I've got to sell. It's gonna get me loads. Yeah, all this sniper rifle and shotgun ammo really adds up. I mean, look at that. Wow, a lot. I need to keep in mind actually for um, what's his face, that armored soldier. If I get that far, I might probably end up dying beforehand if I get enough score. Leave this to me. Wow, fucking hell, just a, let's just um. That's it. We're good to go. Fully upgraded. Thank you for your patience. Yeah, what is it again? Um, 1.08. 1.08. Right. Let's go. PC. Wow. Them archers at the back there, they're a bit weird. On Village Shadows, they're sort of, um, they, 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 de they, they spawn there initially and then they despawn and end up like on the left near the blue orb. It's weird. Uh, Pistol Master. Yeah, we're getting some good damage, um, good damage abilities for this one. I'm killing everything now. Nothing stands a chance. Wow. Did that just do... No, that wasn't... No, I was going to say, it wasn't 5,000 damage, no way. I've not got Agile, have I? And I'm going to lose my combo if I'm not careful. Right, it's two more here somewhere. Where are they? Oh, that's one of you. Where's your, where's your friend, the other one? Where's your partner in crime? Oh, there he is. Try and come up behind me, were you? Yeah, I've heard you like that. Wow, my mag is massive. Jetpack. <laughs> That's what you call it. Oh, we've got agile. Nice, a little bit faster now. Have I got? Have I got? Is that my second agile? I don't know. I think it is, isn't it? Lightning speed is the best one. Wow. Lightning speed, he goes so fast. Right, 
Whoa, whoa, whoa. Gotta be quick. Where's my mine? Quick. Oh, just. Uh, what have we got? Um, yeah, we'll go for break shot. Alright, come on, last one. Where are you? Alright, let me just go be late. I've got time. I've still not got enough money, have I? You've got to bloody finish every level on him. Um... Oh, where's the other one? Oh, yeah. Well, yeah, no, I have. But I might as well bloody complete it. So I'm at the end. Oh, we didn't have lightning speed unlocked. I didn't even realise it. Ah, uh, <laughs> I didn't even realise it. On it's an ability you have to unlock. I know on this one you unlock Master Moon, don't you? I know that's for sure. Wow, I didn't even realise. Ah, pay me no mind. Right, can't have any attachments. I got I've got a bit more now, haven't I? So um, yeah, I can get rate of fire. Yeah, that them extra five thousand you get it really helps. So I can extra all together. So I can extra twenty thousand. So yeah, really, really, really does help. I right, um oh yeah, Mad Village two yeah love Mad Village. Oh, it's not Mad Village two yet yeah, but I I hate Mad Village. Right, I can't remember if you get right to the end on the first version or not. This this is so slow to reload. Until you upgrade the um, reload speed for it. Well, what we've got? Um, handguns do more damage. I should have played and took notice of which one does the most damage, that or long distance. But I guess I don't need to now. I'm doing the platinum speed one right now. Yeah, I should have checked that before and just see which one does the most damage. Oh, it's little bloody pipsqueaks. Hey, little dweebs. Dweebs. That's it. You hear that height? They can lick my feet. Lick in between my toes. Go on. Ethan, he's got mouldy. He's got mould in between his toes. Once you, well, I want you to lick it for him. No, you're not going to attack me. Right. There's two more of these. Where? Wait, one's missing. There you are. I knew I didn't think you thought I forgot about you. You thought you're gonna come up behind me? No, nope, never. I don't miss a trick. What have we got? Um execution. Wow. Got stuck. Fucking hell, I got stuck in the wall. I say you gotta be careful when you're walking back because um, you think you're walking down a path but then you got stuck on a piece of um, um, obstacle or something. You 
dead. Time to finish that level. I have not checked how much I need for S rank on this. That is something I need to do. Right, S rank. Uh, 1.5. Well. Shall I choose something? Um, yeah, we could do that, mate. Wow, 1.5 mil, really. Okay, um, do I need that pipe bomb? I'm going to keep that pipe bomb, so I can't remember if I need it. Ah. I can't remember if I need it for some minute. I just can't remember, so. Got plenty of cash, though. Delight. Oh, nice. I am. Um, I need to upgrade my reload, actually, yeah. I think I'm going to go for that, yeah. Let's do it. Thank you for your patronage. Thank you for your patronage. Oh, giant. Come on, let's see what you got. Oh, not much. Not anymore. You have something, but I am more. Oh, where's the birdies? I hate these things. Especially on Village 2. Um, Mad Village 2. Right, but I'm not looting them. They take far too long to die unless I naturally pass by them. Of course I'll loot them then. Well, I don't get I don't get the timers on this. Lightning speed! Wow. You know I'm gonna get a timer now though. I've got lightning speed. I'm getting it. Wow. I love this. I love lightning speed. Yeah, I know you do more damage. Um, take more. You take more damage. Right. I've got time on casual. We've got time to do this. Feel it in my veins. Easy. I was, I was just about to say they will. They will not hit me with their cross. They will not hit me with their arrows on um on casual. And then they double tap me. Obviously, you missed my head, so I don't have a head. Right, I was going to run straight in here, no fear. No, no, you're not doing that. Serves you right, giant. The bigger they are, the harder they fall, mate. Remember that. What we got? Um, let's go for fickle shooter. Oh, look at you guys! Target practice. Thank you for dropping by. I could do the target practice, actually. Appreciate it. Thanks, Capcom. Nice target practice set. Right, so I need 1.5 mil. Wow. Oh, we're on one mil. So I wonder if I can get to 1.5 mil before. We have to do areas four or five. I'd like to think we can. This simple modification can be done in just a moment. Right, so once I've once I fully upgraded everything, I'm just going to stop collecting cash. And that's I think. I'm buying this because of our relationship. Yeah, fucking all right, mate. I'm buying it because of our relationship. I'm skilled at all sorts of Fuck off, Duke. Wanna be trying to be like the merchant? No chance. You can never replace him. What are you selling? Yeah, I'll never forget that guy. My hero. Just when you're in need on Resident Evil 4. Just when you think you cannot go any longer. When you're about ready to give up, the merchant will appear. What are you selling? And your hope will be restored. You dead. You can lay down. Were you about to come up behind me, little lichen? Where's your friend? Where is he? Oh, there he is. Ah, about to jump on me from behind, were you? No, no, too slow. You got to be quicker than that in this game, mate, if you want to survive. Right, where's the light that's going to drop down? There he is. Right, you can die. Right, where's your jetpack, mate? Oh, shit. I'm gonna have to leave. Alright, I'm leaving that lay. Otherwise, we lose my combo. Thank you for helping me keep my combo going, mate. 
And thank you as well. What we got here? Um, let's go for break shot. Right, let's send punks. It's very hard keeping a combo on this and um, the two version. Very, very hard. I don't think I've actually done it yet. Kept a full combo going on this, on the second versions. Uh, what have we got? Ah, just all shit. Look at these. Just all health ones. Right, I'm going to drop down and I'm going to say hello to you. Down here all by yourself. Oh, sorry for you. Oh, what a shame. Hopefully, at the end of this area, that'll be it. Max combo. Um, S rank, guys. I'm hoping. So I've got to do the last two areas. I uh, shot him in his ass. I wonder, let's see, let's see if I've got enough for S rank. 1.5 mil I need. Have we got enough? No, not quite. 1.485. Have I, have I maximum upgraded this? I think I've got one more upgrading capacity. Yeah, I have. There we go. Right, this is it. We ain't got to do um, the Miranda boss. This is it. This will be the last area, I guess. Just got to get through this. And um, that's it. S rank, baby. Right, what are we up to here? You guys can piss off. Where's the jetpack guy? Come on. Why is he taking so long? Don't take so long next time, mate. Waiting for you. Bye. Bye. See you later. Sayonara. Adios. Behind you. Oh, it's too late. You should react quicker next time, mate. Thinks he avoided the red barrel. We thought he was safe, but I knew he was not dead. I could smell you. Oh, well, we've got um, magic magazine. Double? Is it? I've got that already, haven't I? Is it going to double again? Or is that on the last? Um, is that on the uh, factory area? I don't remember now. Oh, I thought one of them didn't die. Just have to double check. I have to take a double take there. Lay back down. Go to sleep. Wow! No ammo! Wow! Oh yeah, because I normally buy a shotgun for this bit. Of course I do. Wow. <laughs> Can't believe that, guys. Yes, yeah, so I, I normally buy a shotgun for this bit. Oh, and I forgot. Wow. Go on. Put your guard down, quick. Okay, lost my combo now. So I won't keep an eye on my ammo. Oh, shit. Yeah, I've, I've got enough anyway. Look at me, I've got 1.5 mil. That's it, I'm done, I'm done, guys. Excuse me, excuse me. That's it, we're done. We're done here. Right, 1.48. Oh, I could have just died then. Right, let's just start and die. What did I have? 1.49, I think. So I could have just got them to kill me. All right, kill me, please. Right, um, let me lob a pipe bomb down. What's this feel like? Oh, that stings quite a little bit. Now, please do not worry, the little rose. I assure you, I'll provide her with two. Yeah, okay, okay, Miranda, if you say so. So now you can die peacefully. Alright, come on guys. Takes longer to get killed than what it does actually quickly finishing in the first place. Alright, where's Miranda? You attack me next, come on. Go, go, just go for it, attack. 
Yes, there we go. S rank, baby. Yeah, I forgot. Yeah, I, I normally buy the um, the Sig shotgun on area four because you always run out of ammo if you stick to the same weapon, the same ammo type. Did I just get normal S rank then? Right, are we on the number two maps now, are we? No, we're not. I need to quit. Right, so, um, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, I didn't get triple S. No, never mind. I wanted to end it, that's why. I wanted to get that bit ended. Right, um... Right, so this is quite a bit different to, yeah, this is quite a bit different to um, the other one. And so what do I normally go for? I'm just trying to remember now. Oh yeah, most of them you have to get Magnum to begin with, but not on the village. Village 2, oh yeah, and I always get Rate of Fire, Rate of Fire always comes first. Wow, almost forgot about that. Rate of Fire always comes first. I'm skilled at all sorts of Thank All right, let's do this. Hatred. Yeah, um, yeah. Most of them you have to get Magnum first. It really helps. Right. Right, it's gonna be quite a change of pace, and I don't want to keep dying and messing up my run. So I think it's gonna take me one or two um, areas to just get used to this speed again. Right, it's going to be another light can come down in a minute. Right, what have we got? Um, I'm going for Pistol Magic. I probably should have gone for Agile, just in case I don't get any of the movement speeds. Upgrades. Yeah, perhaps I should have. Right, you stay there. Back down for you. Don't you worry, I'm not going to forget about you. I won't forget about you, Sally. Don't you worry. You gotta be careful of like and so on this. They just sprint to you. They just sprint to you from nowhere. Right, you stay there, mate. I've got to get used to rate of fire again. Because if you just spam it, it's not as quick. Uh, finish you up in a minute. Oh, there we go. You've got Agile now. Nice. Right, we'll just get the um, armoured guy to come after me. There we go, so I can get my combo going. Oh, you got on me quick, didn't you? You're not messing? Right. Where are you going? You can pay respects to a lost family member or something, are we? Is that why you're visiting the graveyard? You have no family, guys. You're just enemy monks. I think she's tough. She's got armor on. I didn't even check what S rank was, did I? Damn. You're dead. Well, I'll get money from you on the way back through. Get a blue orb. What are we at? Um. Let's go for out of reach. You wait there a minute, mate. I'll be back for you. One more left. Last man, last monk standing. 
And there's a bit of money around here, I forgot. There we go, all good. Right, how much do I need for S-Rank? I'm hoping the number two version could be so much quicker. Um, all right, so I've almost got enough. Five, five sixteen. Got to remember that five, five hundred and sixteen thousand. Um, don't need these. I'm buying this because of our relationship. You know. All right, all right, Duke. Leave this to me. I might leave, leave the last enemy alive and then I may be able to let him kill me, the last enemy. Perhaps. Wow. Bloody hell. Almost messed that up. Are you joking? He got me with a bloody crossbow from there. You mother. Not a crossbow, it's bow and arrow. Where's my... You joking? Oh, you got on me quick. Wow. Whoa, did not mean to fall down there. It's quite lucky because because I've been attacked a few times and monks have caught up to me. By the looks of it. And um, what we got? Uh right, where are they? Where's the monks? Wow, wow, wow. Wow. You miss because you're useless. Right. Where's number eight? He's at the top of the hill, is he? I'm take it. I'm guessing number eight is at the top of the hill. There he is. Right, that's the armor guy. Oh my god, how much ammo do I have in my magazine? Wow. 70 bullets. I was going to say, don't I have to reload? Of course, I don't. Shame there's no full damage, then I could just fall off his tower in a minute. Perhaps I should have left that explosive barrel, could he use that to kill me? It's alright, I'm sure I'm going to die pretty quick. Wow, so much ammo in my magazine. Idiot. Uh, what we got? Out of reach. Let's do it. Oh yeah, you chose to come up to me this time, did you? I know you like to do that sometimes, I was waiting for you. That's why I had the stairs in my view. Right, this is probably going to be it, that's going to be... um. Yeah, well once we've done this, shit, where am I going? Once I've handed this in, guys, got a time bonus. That's it, we've got enough. So um, I just have to spawn in and get killed. Oh no, uh, yeah we have, Five, six, 516,000, we're good. Right, feasting time, boys. Come and get your dinner. Come on, he wants first. He wants first munches on me. Come on, he wants a good munch first. Come on, come and eat me, guys. Go on, I'll let you all have a taste. Go on. You can stick your arrows in me. You can stick your... Well, whatever teeth you got left remaining. That's it. Bite my nipple, that's it. That's it, you get my left nipple and rip it off. I mean, whatever you like, go for it. Right, that's Castle 2. Let's do Castle 2. Okay. What's going on in this pause menu? Oh, there we go. I was going to say, that's taking a long time to load. Alright, Castle 2, let's do it. So, 
probably get enough on the first two levels here areas as long as i can sort of get a good bonus going and i need the magnum for this yes i do i need the magnum for this one that's it and we just put what we can into firepower uh, rate of fire sorry and then the rest into power oh yeah i always go four three two one that's it i almost forgot that's my magic number four four three two one yes that's my magic upgrade number the path of the ninja four three two one ethan winters he is the ninja right i think i remember what i'm doing here on the two version i think i remember right let's go and do this straight away no you can go back down i don't want you to get up just yet I'll come back for you in a minute. Don't worry, I've not forgot about you. Ag Agile, yes. I've n you know what? I've never done a um, knife only. A sort of, you know, the knife. There's a lot of knife builds that people do on this, and I've never actually, never actually done it. I've never done the knife build where you wait for mass. You mean we keep reloading until you get it from the boot orbs? I've never done that. Yeah, never done that. Right, give me my mines. What are you waiting for? Right, get you, then we'll get the Lycan when he appears. Well, 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 well. Teddy, you got on me quick. You're not normally that quick, are you? Teddy. Yeah, he's not normally that quick to get on me. He's obviously been training a lot in speed. He's done well, I'm quite proud of him, that one. He's normally always last, but um, I was telling him he needs to improve his speed, and um, he obviously listened. Not quite fast enough, but he was close, that little monk. Right, I need to use my pipe bomb here, and then the mine. I need to remember these number two strategies. Right, reload ready. Turn around, shoot the flower bag. Oh shit, pipe bomb's not even equipped. That's it, lob that down. Right, now I can go and get my blue orb in peace. Right, what are we going for? Um, execution, yes. Right, where's your mate? Oh, hello. Nice you to join the party, the P-A-R-T-Y. Hello. It's me, only me, Ethan Winters. No, I am not getting in the sight of that. Archer, until I'm ready to put a few bullets into him. Oh, poor guy. <laughs> you dead. Right, how much... I didn't even check how much S rank is, did I? Um, eight hundred fifty-one thousand. Wow, it's quite a bit on this one. Seeking something in particular. Um, I can't remember. Oh, I say, extra. I still I use some mine on um. That's it. I don't upgrade anything else because on Area Four, I normally buy the grenade launcher for that, and I save all my money for that. Um, I'm not going to get that far. I'll have enough before that. Well, we need 816,000. Right, let's do this. Handgun ammo, yep. Pouch of money. Pouch, handgun ammo. Timer. Handgun ammo. Piss off. Go on, that's it. You're going to sit down over there. Uh, oh, lightning speed. Come to daddy. Wow. Wow. No one can keep up with me now. Um, what we got? Uh, no brainer. I'll go for that. Close. The close combat attacks one. You do have to be quite close. And a bit too close for comfort on the two versions. So, yeah. I do not advise to go for that.
Alright, let's go and get these two punks quickly. Where are they? Wow. Uh-oh. Yeah, that's where I normally put my mind down. Oh, they finally spawned, did they? Well, they have met they've messed things up a little bit. These guys have messed things up. They've messed things up, these guys have. They normally spawn much quicker than that. I don't know what's taking them so long. And I need to get to Magic Corner. Well, no. Where are you going? You want to sit down? Just take a seat, mate. I'll get you a cup of coffee. Go on. Right, where are they? Come on, Lycans. Ah, uh, look, you fell asleep on the rug. Look at you. Right, where's the rest of them? Oh! I knew it! I knew you are going to come up behind me. Fucking bastard. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Fuck my combo up. This is why you need you need eyes on both of these entry points unless you're in that corridor. Because what they do for some reason, instead of taking a quick route and coming straight through here, sometimes they run all the way around. I don't know why, and they come up behind you. And that's what happens. It's my info, I'll let my guard down. I, I was thinking about that, and but I still took my eyes off it, so I didn't. I just didn't think it was going to happen. Fuck, and that fucked me up. Damn. Never mind. Oh well, I'm probably still going to have to do three areas anyway. You got some more money for me, thanks. Yeah, do not sell your first aid kits on this because you're probably going to need it. And I normally save that explosive barrel to damage this guy as well. Yeah, I normally save it to damage this guy as well. Look, that execution does quite a lot of damage. I like it. 1260, wow. Yeah, look, it does like five times as much damage or something. It's crazy. Execution. It's really a good skill. Wow. 700. Yeah, it's like... Um, what is it? It's like... It's five times as much damage, isn't it? Yeah, it's five times... Wow. So execution means when they blow 30% health, you do 50% 50 more damage. Uh, sorry, five times more damage. That's crazy. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not getting all born. I get gruesome gore. I, I don't normally get close enough for the um, close combat one. On definitely not on number two. I just don't like to risk it. Okay, so if I kept my combat going, wow. Oh yes. Stop biting your nails. So, yeah, I normally have enough to well by the um, grenade launcher at this point, so it looks like I may have missed some lay that somebody dropped. Right, that really messed things up, that did.
What we got? No, I do not want all born. You do not want anything that makes you take more damage, just in case you get in, end up getting instant killed, even at full health. I don't know if that's possible, but don't want to risk it. Where are you going? All right, spawn you bullies. Did he just move through the floor? Alright, where's your other buddy? No, don't you come that close. Two meter distance, remember. Right, and now let's spawn the sister. I won't last until oh my god, you're joking. No. Ah, don't matter. Yeah, it doesn't matter because I'm not going to be doing the last area anyway. Well, I normally save the Magnum round four. It's all good. That's because I didn't let it spawn. Didn't give it time to spawn. I always leave this guy here just to keep my combo going. Just helps. Oh, and I missed her. I missed have I missed another Magnum bullet then. If you watch my um, my actual guide on this, you'll know what I'm meant to do then. Yeah, you can't you can't chase me in here, can you? You are not allowed. You are banished from the dining room. Oh, what a shame. All right, come on. Oh, here come the birdies. Maybe a little. Whoa. Oh yeah, you haven't quite despawned, have you? Maybe little birdie had told Miranda about Rose. Was it you, birdie? Was it you? I'm gonna say, where's the other bird? I'm sure, there's one more, and there, there he is. He just flew in. Right, what we got? Break shot, yes. And uh, where is it? Right, how many magnum bullets? Wow. J I'm just going to have another, I think, anyway. Oh, yeah, you've already spawned, have you? Look, I've even smashed a window as well. Where are you going? Just want to have a little word. Say hello to my gun. They're alive. I bet that was comfy sleeping in the fucking floor. No, I'm not going to try and shoot you in your weak spots. I'm only going to hit your armor. Tried it so many times. It's overkill anyway when a leg shot will kill you. Oh yeah, about to come up behind me, were you? I'm wise to your little tricks. Trying to flank me. Alright, one more left, and he's on the stairs. But first, let's get the blue hole. Oh. What have we got, guys? Um, no brainer. Yeah? <laughs> you could say that choice was a no brainer. Fucking hell. That's a real bad joke. If you want to leave the building now, guys, I am um, fully understand. I'll, I'll meet you in the coat. In the coat room to give you a coat. That's it, kiss my feet. That's it, kiss the floor. That's it, good good job, guy. Whatever your name is, I'm just going to call you Guy. I don't quite know your name. That's it, you can kiss the floor as well. That's it, show of respect. Oh, wait, wait, wait for it, Miranda. Whatever your name is. Oh, you're dead already, what a shame. Well, this has got a full combo in this one, so that'll be my um, S rank. Yeah, them two Magnum rounds are wasted. I normally use them for... Um, oh, what's the face? Um, I've got a name now. Oh, Angie. I normally use them for Angie. Gets rid of her pretty quick. Right, she's got to die now, and we're good. Oh, I've got one million plenty that's it castle two done wow well, come on then Whee! 
My turn to kiss the floor. Wow. He was not messing about. Instant kill. S. Yeah. Quick game. Yeah, factory two. Two more left, and then we can crack on with the story, guys, one more time. This is not going to be six hours. I think it's going to be more like about seven, maybe. Depending on how long this well, takes me now. Ethan. Right, so we're on factory two. Yes, I need a magnum for this. You'll be first area. And I've only got to do the first area on this one. Um, so it's four, three, two, one. Four, three. And when I go Village of Shadows, I need to remember that goat. Right, let's go. Let's go, Ethan. We've got his brother. No, we're not using the shotgun. We're just using the pistol. Don't make it too easy for you. Alright, oh, there you go, Robocop. Robo Monk. There you go, you don't have no protection on your ass, so I'll just shoot it there straight into the flesh. flesh. Come on then, come through the doorway, don't be shy. Oh, I stumbled, did you? Oh my god. Never mind. I, I do save one magnum shot for um, area 2, but we're not going to be doing area 2 anyway, so it don't matter. Wow. I see you stay on the floor, mate. Don't even bother getting up. Don't even bother getting up. Uh, what we got? Um, let's go for out of reach. You are definitely not out of reach. Well, you was, and that's why I did more damage to you. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. And now. Fuck, I thought, I thought he was dead, that's what I reloaded. Oh uh, yeah, being too cocky there. Right, where's your mate? He's normally right behind you, there he is. You lucky thing. Bloody headphones coming out. Right, we've got this, yeah? Right, let's go. Ouch, that's got to hurt. some money there because that's when I killed the um sold out it killed one of the monks as well and I wasn't sure if I'd looted him or not I must have looted him when I looted the soldier there you go you can die inside each other where are you going I'm here right gotta go gotta get that blue orb quickly and then kill the monk uh lichen the like a monk. Uh, what we got? Agile, yes. I will take Agile. Oh yes, take that money through the wall, why not? Oh yeah, my accuracy's all over the shop there. 
Right, let's get my magnum out. Right, hopefully this will work this time. Yes, it doesn't always work. Well, most of the time it is like, like probably eight times out of ten I'll always land. Right, come on. Right, and you mate, around the corner, there he is. And what well, we've got, fickle shooter, of course, not getting the other two. I thought I missed him then. I thought he went through his legs. Wow. Um, no brainer. Yeah, definitely no brainer that one. Alright, come on, ladies. Oh, wow. Dumb women. Let's all run into the same line of fire. Wow, yeah. I guess they were had enough had blood for quite a while and they wasn't quite thinking straight. Yes. Clearly that's the reason. You just put your face in your friend's ass. And I hate to think what these guys get up to in their own time. You know what? I've got I've still got a spare Magnum round, so I'd be fine for area two anyway. Yeah, I've still got a spare Magnum round. Whoa! There they are. I didn't realise he was coming that quick. <laughs> oh uh, wait. Let me just make you kneel first. Thank you. Good timing, eh? Oh, lightning speed! I'm gonna be flying. I've already got, I've already got lightning speed, haven't I? Imagine if you stacked it like five times. Fucking hell, he would be like lightning. It's a shame there's not some that like makes your weapon or well, makes weapon automatic or something. You know, or just like gives you tons of ammo, like 500 ammo. There we go, still got the barrel intact. Did I miss some lay down there or something? I thought I saw. I don't know. Right, but we're done. I opened that door once to see what was behind it, but it just takes you back to where you started. Okay, so I think that's S rank. I didn't actually check, did I, what S rank was? Um, oh yeah, we're fine, you guys. Yeah, let's go and get killed. I only need a 645. Most of your points, most of your points come at the end. You know, when um, you get your time bonus and your combo bonus. That's it, come on. Oh, let me run into your blade, please. I mean, your drill bit. What size drill bit is that, mate? It's got to be like a 30 mil, 40 mil, isn't it? I don't think you need it that much. Right, there we go, factory two. I just gotta do um Mad Village two guys and we're all good. Right, so um I'm hoping I've just gotta do the first two areas. Because they're they're pretty quick anyway, the first two areas. So I'm hoping I just have to do them and nothing else. Cause I I really hate area three. Oh no 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 no. I really hate Area 3 on this. I don't mind Area 4 and Area 5, but Area 3, just, you got all the crossbow enemies, and there's fucking, I hate the crossbow enemies on um, uh, the number 2 versions, so pain in the ass. Pain in the backside. Right. Oh, it's wrong level. Why? Can't believe I clicked on Factory 2 again. Stand by. 
Right, let's do it. So Magnum. Um, what's Mad Village 1 again? I'm just trying to remember what happens on Mad Village 1. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. You're where the... Um, you're in a sort of garden area, aren't you? And then Mad Village 2 is... So area 2. You're um, in the altar area. Yeah, that's the one. I remember. I remember where we are. So... I normally save some Magnum rounds for area 3 and for area 4, but I don't need to because I only need to do the first two areas. Yeah, so I can just use my Magnum rounds whenever I want. Yeah, that lone crusader I am. Dirty Harry, that's going to be me in these two areas. If anything upsets me, you're getting a Magnum to the head. And one shot will blow your head clean off. You know why? So I said it will. I knew you were coming. I actually should have been watching that because um, I didn't think... I was just thinking then I'm not going to be quick enough. And then luckily I was. Right, first aid med might need it on this difficulty. The orb. What we got? Um, pistol. You die, pipe bomb. Right, where's that birdie? Blue birdie, the rarest bird in the world. I can't believe I've seen a blue bird. I should have got a picture before I shot it. What an idiot. Right, come on, where's your mate? I know he's right behind you. Nope, really. That's how I like to tango. You fucking little ants. Fucking hell, you're just like a little piece of shit on the bottom of my shoe. Which you just can't get off. No matter what you do, there's always a trace remaining. And then just when you're off, after all that time, after all that time on days that pass if you're just walking around to get that last bit that last trace off you go step in it again under your back in all your glory on the bottom of my fucking shoe no really fucking armor guy right fuck you i can spare it wasn't i blocking then why did it damage me full damage i'm sure i was blocking haha <laughs> I'm sure I was blocking. Right, are you dead? Who else we got? Right, well that's all armor. I know that's all the armor dudes. All the armor perps, perps are no more. Right, two more of you left, you little fucking ants. No. Yes, yeah, so these guys are very small, but they're very, very nimble. You gotta watch out for them. It's always a small guy you gotta watch out for. The quiet guy. I saw that. Playing dead where you like him. Playing dead. I saw right, right through you. Right, quick. Quick, they're going to get on me. Oh, what was the point of that? Probably a good job, actually. Just that extra fraction travel may have been a difference between getting hit and not getting hit. Let me get that blue orb. Just give me a second, guys. Fucking hell. What? Ethan! Wow. In fight. You dead? What about your mate? Oh look! Where you go where you come from? I see, you can go back in your grave. Go on, go back where you came from. Right, two more of you, where are they? Here's you. And where's the other you? Oh look, I'll get your twin. That's it. I killed your twin, mate. How do you feel? Your bloodline will not live on. It ended with me, Ethan Winters.
Right, so hopefully after this area, guys, that will be it. What do we need? Um, six five eight. So not really much more, actually. Feel free to peruse. Right, thank you. One moment, please. Right, so um, I don't. I'm just gonna lob it. I normally don't put in anything p capacity moment, on a normal, uh, no, uh, on number two versions because I like to save it up to get a grenade launcher later, so I could get more ammo. But I don't need to. This is it. Area 2. We're good. We're done after this. And that'd be the mercenaries trophy. Right. There's a giant. You know what? I've got just what you need. A magnum bullet. Right between the middle of your eyes. Yeah. Not in the middle of the eyes. Right between the middle. That's like the middle of the middle. If you're unsure. Yeah. I like to be extra precise. Right here they are, fucking annoying birds, the mouldy little birds that told Miranda about Rose. Which one was it? Was it you? I heard it's the one with two wings, so it must have been you. Fuck off. Fuck off. Fuck off. Fuck off. Right, we're good. Right, grab a bit of lay on the way out. Right, where's that pipe bomb that I need? Here we go. Right, you know what to do, pipe bomb. When you see the... Lycans, blow yourself up. That's it. Good on you, pal. Oh, fucking hell. We've got a crossbow enemies. Forgot about... Ooh, forgot about them. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Wait, 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 wait. I wasn't ready. I forgot about the crossbow enemies. Fuck, that was lucky. Wow. Oh, great. Oh, I lost my combo. Shit. You motherfucker. Oh, I forgot a blue orb. Shit. I don't even remember what we need for him. He has a blue orb over here. I forgot it. It doesn't matter. I mean, we've almost, probably almost done it anyway. I, you know, I should have just used Magnum then to finish the combo going. Um, yeah, I should just use some Magnum. Alright, come on. Oh my god, too far away, missed. Piss off. Right, come on then, Lycans. Let me waste my final Magnum bullets on you guys. Yeah, got one for you, and I got one for you. There you go. You're welcome. Right, we're good. Just got to die in this next area now. What was it? 856 or something? I think we needed for um, S rank. I think it's eight. I think that's what it was. Um. Oh no, six five eight. So plenty. And that's it. That's mercenaries done. So just back onto the. Village of Shadows now for the last playthrough. And, uh, come on, guys, you wouldn't shoot an unarmed man, would you? I'm unarmed. Come on, look, I've got no ammo. Okay, that tickled. I can do that. Look at me. Oh, I can't do that, though. I can die and come back to life. And there we go, legendary cowboy. Oh, I just fucking went and restarted, didn't I? All right, guys. So let's do it. Let's go into last playthrough, Village of Shadows. Yeah. So that's I did it a bit of a different way. I wanted to do that first. Yeah. Right. So um, I should have got loads, completely loads of challenges then as well. Wow. Yeah. Look at that. Right. So what did we need to buy? Um, we need a WCX. Dragoon infinite ammo. We needed infinite ammo on the Wolf's Bane and the and the um. Uh, GM79 and we need to actually buy oh yeah buy infinite ammo for that yeah we had to unlock it no I didn't even have to unlock it I just had to buy infinite ammo for it right that's it guys and we'll get all the figures and concept arts arts at the end in fact I'm going to do that now because I want to pop platinum at the end yeah so we're just going to do all the figures now guys quickly buy all them yeah so I've got to buy all this junk yeah Capcom did not let you bulk buy Surely you know that by now from uh, 
when you have to keep selling stuff on mercenaries. At least it's already on yes, that you don't have to keep, you can just keep spamming X, rather than have to keep spam X and select it. Ah, uh, don't take too long. Once you get going, Lobo, Tundra, BSAA Soldier. Wow. Yep. Oh no. Oh no, what a stupid thing just for a fucking trophy. Just make you spam on all these, not even look at them properly. They really think when we get these trophies that we're going to take time viewing every single one. No, we're just going to get the trophy and uh, just going to hover over it so it registers as um, viewed and then that's it. Wow, look how far down I have to go, yeah. My thumb is clear me. I thought there was going to be no more of spamming the button. Looks like I was wrong. Wow. Okay, my thumb's fucking literally gonna fall off. Why can we not bulk buy? What's that jump to content? Oh, it lets you jump to it to view it, does it? Wow. Awesome, I love doing this. I love buying 100 things. Just for a trophy, fucking hell. Come on Capcom, I've got an itch on my neck and I need to itch it. Is that it? Wow, finally. Shopping addict, really? <laughs> you mean trophy addict, should be. Right, got to view all this. Um, okay, once you've viewed all these, that'll be a trophy will pop. Look at this, I don't. you don't even get time for them to appear. And they force you to do this for a trophy. Uh, there we go, doll collector. Is that a picture of Chris on the um, trophy icon? I think it is. Um, concept art. Right, so yeah, this is basically what you're doing for this. 120 um, images to get through. Cool concept art though. I should use one of these for the thumbnail, shouldn't I? I have to have a look at these after actually. See if any look like a good thumbnail. There we go, art collector. Right, let's go. Right, um, load game. And I need that completed save. There we go, village shadows. Yes, let's do it. So all I need to worry about now is doing it in under three hours and completing every objective that I've not done yet. Uh, I've got to make sure I get that goat, very important. We've got to kill um, Urias at the start. We've got to kill the alpha werewolf. These are just a few things got to make sure I don't forget. Oh, and I've got to kick this football into the living room. Can't believe I almost forgot that. Almost forgot that. Right, come on, Rose. Let's go this day. Don't worry, I won't drop you. I promise. I'm, I promise. I know I dropped you last week. Can you hit every step on your way down? I won't do it again, Rose. I promise. You know? Your mum was dropped a few times. Almost there, honey. Yes, yeah, she was. But I won't drop you ever again, Rose, I promise. Don't tell mum about what I did last summer. Okay? Right, uh, let's kill this bull. Oh my god, he got stuck. Ethan's on the bull. He takes it past the inactive dinosaur and he scores. Yes, oh no, it's a turtle. Still. It's still a player. It was on the field, so it counts as a player. Yeah, that's it. And by that logic, that means the referee counts as a player. Yeah, sometimes I just have to agree with myself to keep sane. Right, so we've got the we've got that trophy. Oh hello. Is that is that Alpha? Oh Alpha, hello. Is that the Alpha Werewolf? Yeah, I'm coming for you. I've got my infinite wolf speed. Oh, Rose, so cute. 
Yeah, it's quite. It's pretty tricky killing. Oh, I've got to get. I've got to get um, five crows as well. It can be a little bit tricky killing um, Urias on first encounter. By the way, on a village of shadows. But as long as um, the the lichens, they about only about forty of them spawn in, and then they don't spawn no more. And you can normally kill about thirty six ish before he spawns in. If you're spawning them quick, normally depending on where you stand and stuff, it depend that sort of depends on how quick they spawn. Some of them don't spawn unless you sort of walk away from a certain area or walk into a certain area. There's one bit where I'll be standing here. When you're in the spawn area, no like a spawn in that spot, but some are supposed to. And then when you walk away and turn around, you'll see a lichen spawn in that spot where you're standing, and a few can spawn there. Is once you get away. So it's. It's a bit weird the ambush area with the spawns. Um, if you just stay in the room, if you just stay in the house all the time, it just seems they never the they're never ending. But if you're sort of outside, killing them as soon as possible. Um, you do you do find that it's about forty lichens that spawn, and then they don't seem to spawn anymore. And like I said, some will only spawn when you're sort of moving around the map. If you're just staying in one place, some of them weren't even spawning. So you think you're safe, and then you run around, and then one will get you from behind. Yes, yeah, so you have got to be quite careful with the ambush. But, but I've got my magnum with me. I've got my wolf spade. No, that's the same thing. I've got my magnum with me. I've got my GM79. And they have ammo that will not end. Endless supply of ammunition. I have a Rambo belt on. And I'm living it. Yeah, we've got infinite ammo. So, um... The only tricky bits are the Heinzenberg boss fight and the Chris section. They're the only tricky bits. Yeah. But with the Chris bit, we have we will have infinite ammo for the Dragoon. Um is that how you say it? Dragoon? Or is it Dragon? I don't know. Um but we've got that infinite ammo on that. And um Yeah, and yeah, the Heinzenberg fight's tricky because you're in a tank, you can't heal. You're not using your infinite ammo weapon. You basically, you basically got to try and kill him without being able to heal. And if you block, normally you die. You're dead in a few hits. You're dead in a few hits. And um, yeah, you're dead in a few hits. And you'll also find that on casual, we had to hit his weak points about. It's about, what, five weak points we had to destroy in total. But on Village Shadows, you have to destroy about 20 weak points, I think it is. Yeah, it's quite a lot. Uh, not that not that much. It's probably between 15 and 20. Probably closer to 15. But you have to destroy a lot of his weak points. You can damage him without that. But if you're just always going for his weak points, you're doing more damage and then... Um, as long as you're doing that, going for weak points all the time, yeah, it's about 15 to 20 you have to destroy in order to kill him. So it's quite a difference, and um, you die pretty quick. If you get hit a few times, you're dead. And Chris' section is really difficult because so many lichens spawn, and if you just run straight through it, um, you can get, obviously, over overwhelmed because you die in one or two hits. So you've got to be really careful. But good th good thing is we can heal. We can heal. So that's a good thing. That's why I like to get no heals out of the way before Village of Shadows so you can heal if you want to. Right, we've got this. Right, so infinite ammo. I'm going to switch my flashbangs. There's some um, crows up there. Just up there, there's a load of crows on that trash heap. Don't know if I killed them, I just lobbed it anyway. Um, but we do get we do get plenty of crows, so you don't have to worry too much. What happened? But I'm going to use my magnum first. The light, the enemies, by the way, they drop when they drop bags of lay. There's a lot more lay inside, a lot more lay inside. The treasures are the same. The treasure still sells for the same. But yeah, when they drop lay, they drop a lot more. It's like sort of, it's still sort of a random amount. Well, I think it's sort of like five times what they normally drop, except for the first um, Urias kill. For some reason, he always drops the thirty-five thousand. Yeah. Get that guy. Yeah, be very careful taking damage on this. 
your flashbangs with your grenade launcher. The grenade launcher is for flashbangs, by the way, not for the explosive. For damage, you want the, this magnum, and but to stun enemies, you want the flashbangs. And it's actually really good. It's actually really good for stunning enemies because, um, yeah, because you can just run past groups of enemies just lobbing flashbangs at them, and um, yeah, it lets you get by without having to kill anything and mess about. Thing is, it's just a slow reload rate. Unfortunately, it's a shame it's not like the um, village. Wow, he didn't die. It's a shame it's not like the Village of Shadows one. Uh, not Village Shadows, the mercenaries. No, where are you going? Yeah, shame it's not like the mercenaries one where um, you know you've got like six rounds in the chamber and it reloads like really quick. Right, so um, let's do this. Right, here they come. Yeah, I normally sort of camp here. Damn it. And if you get overrun, just come up these stairs slightly like this. Wow, that miss. Yeah, so you'll get quite a lot of lay as well. Wow. Yeah, you find on this there, sometimes they miss you quite a lot. And I like this because when they run to you as well, they always get, they sort of always run around the side like this. Yeah, so I should be counting these. Yeah, I should be counting these. There's no end to them. Well. Just be careful that you're reloading. And make sure you are reloaded. Block if you need to. I'm not going to heal. I'm only going to heal if I go into red, I think. Because we do get free heal in the castle in a minute. Yeah, that's why it's good on the stairs, because a lot of time they will miss you. If you're backing up at the same time, wow. Well, I need to be really careful now. As long as I can get out of danger, I won't have to waste a heal. Wow. Could have been me dead then. You know what, I'm not risking this. Fuck that. <laughs> I'm not risking it. Right, so um, yeah, eventually they'll the spawn, the spawn um, time will slow right down. Well, that was lucky. Yeah, it stuns you when he first spawns in. And what you find, yeah, when you move away, someone's going to spawn in there when you turn the camera around. There he is, I told you. So, this is what we're going to do now. We're just going to move out here. Um, because we want Yuri's to come in. And what you can do... Wow, that's quite lucky. You can keep... That's it. Well, reload. Make sure you always reload after. You yeah, make sure you always reload after, guys. So you're ready. So I just keep using this, and when he's about to attack you, I love another flashbang. Like this. That's it. I just keep doing this now, basically. If you get headshot, it'll do a lot more damage. No, where are you going? Come back. Just be careful, never like and doesn't spawn there. There he is, got him. Up yours. I oh, know, that's the other one in the stronghold. 
So look, there he is. Oh, but here comes the arrow. So you can just get him in time. It's quite tricky. But what, what you want to do, if you get to this cutscene before you've killed him, do not try and skip it because straight after there's a save point. What you can do is hold the PS button and quickly click to main menu. Or you can just come back and um, do that on a... I almost got 1.5 mil almost. Yeah, or you can just come back and do it on um, a casual if you find it too difficult. Right, so um, nothing to collect. So I'm just going to run ahead. Got a flashbang. So look, watch this. Awesome. And these guys have dropped, the crows drop quite a lot of money as well. They do, they drop quite a lot of lay. Oh yeah, right, we need the um, crest. There we go, maiden crest. Thank you. Right, so yeah, when I come up here, I'm just going to keep spamming this. But it's going to be an armoured lycan. You may, it won't, you can't actually stun him until you've took his helmet off. So, where is he? Is that him there? Yeah, it is. Oh my god, really? Bloody archer. Yeah, so... That's it, I'm just going to get rid of the armoured lycan. That's it, now I can just stun everything now. Oh shit, there's another one. <laughs> Probably should just run straight up, jumped over the fence. I forgot there's two. Yeah, just, just run straight up there. Once you get through here, that's it. The enemies will despawn, guys. Yeah, the enemies will despawn. Um, make sure, by the way, you've still got plenty of um, crafting items on you. Because we will need to craft things later for a trophy. Right, and I'm in red again. I'm in red again, but there's no enemies now. There's no enemies now, and... Um, yeah, no enemies, and we will be at, uh, at the castle soon, and we'll get a free heal. Right, so hopefully they're going to open this door for me. I've not actually gone through this with the wolf Spain yet, if I'm honest. I was killing I was killing Urias the other day, so that's the only bit I was worried about. But normally when I've done my village shadows run, I've always done the stake with the grenade launcher. I've always done the stake with it. But the wolf Spain does it does it doesn't look like it. Um, but the wolf Spain does actually do sort of um, as much damage as the stake, if not more. At times, I don't know why, because the stats don't seem to reflect that. If you look at the description, um, this seem it says it does more. It says it does a lot of damage towards like um, lichen type enemies, werewolves or something. So I'm not sure if that's a reason that it actually counts. For some reason, everything counts as that enemy type. I don't know. No, even the vampires. I don't know. But but yeah, but obviously the downside is it's not as quick. It's not as quick not as the stake the and the stake. That's a much bigger Thank magazine. You. But the thing is with the stake, it costs twice as much as this to upgrade. Yeah, the this costs like a million. And I don't think any other weapon costs more than a million except for the stake. But it costs like almost two million to fully upgrade it. It's a rip-off, complete rip. But I wouldn't say it's a rip-off. But just you're just basically paying for that um for fast you're basically paying for faster fire rate and a bigger magazine. That's basically all you're paying for. Because the Wolf's Bane does the same damage, it's just got a smaller magnum, like I say, it don't fire as quick. But the grenade launcher is great because um, it stuns everything almost. The only thing it doesn't stun is when Summit's got its face covered by a mask. That's when it doesn't stun something. When its face is covered by a mask. So, um, yeah, in, in instances like that, you have to destroy its mask. I probably should use an explosive on that first... Um, on that armoured lichen. Say explosives knock masks off quicker. Uh, Demon crest, yeah, goes there. And the maiden crest. There we go. You're welcome, maiden. Right, two more crows. I wait for them to fly away, and then I'll have a flash. Go on, fly away. Shoo, shoo. Oh, we've got a squawk shot. I've not actually killed him. Um, Five. I killed two to begin with, didn't I? And then two there. But you know when I shot all that trash, at that pile of trash, there's normally like four or five crows then. Well, and normally one of them begins to fly away before the flash reaches it, like one of the ones on the outer area of the flash radius. So, um, yeah. That squawk shot, guys. So, the only missed trophy which is left is... 
Well, obviously, we've got the ones for crafting and stuff. Um, but, I mean, the only sort of missed one which requires, like, a random uh, task is the one for killing the, um, the uh, Alpha... The Alpha... Romeo. No, the Alpha um, Werewolf. Yeah, so one for killing him, I think. And I'm probably going to kill him when we come out of the stronghold. Yeah, I'm going to kill him when we come out. He drops treasure that sells for 80,000. He drops a lot of money. Yeah, and um, I guess do, doing this in two playthroughs and trying to get a stake could be quite difficult because you just... I mean... If you do knife only like I did, you end up with a... If you do my route, we end up with about 1 million, as you saw. And you're, you're still... One million off the stake. So do it in two playthroughs. At the moment, you have to do it this way. You have to do it this way. You can get about 1.8 million in um, in the first playthrough, but it means you have to kill every enemy, and you also have to use your knife, which takes a fucking long time. Yeah, because from you selling all the ammo, again all the treasure. Yeah, it, it can all it does all eventually add up to about 1.8 mil. But um, if you're doing 100% killing every enemy with weapons, then you're looking at about 1.5, 1.6 mil, I think, at the end of the game. Right, it's going to be some more crows out there. The crows drop a lot of money, so you do want to try shoot. You do want to try shoot them quickly with a flashbang, just for the extra money you get. I'm still going to try and grab crafting materials, by the way, as we go along. So two crows there. Get them. I'll grab this herb here as well. It's a green herb here. Right, the Duke. So we've got to do some things to the Duke, but I'm going to wait until we meet him a little bit later. Yeah, I'm going to wait. But what we can do now is we can upgrade our. Um, as you wish. I have something special to do. We'll just upgrade that a little bit. I'm not going to upgrade it anymore. Um, just because we may get a bit tight. So I'm, I'm going to do all that in a minute, guys. Let's just get through here first. And then we're going to come and meet the Duke a little bit later when I can save the game next to him. And then I'll do what we've got to do. Right, so nothing to do here. All I need to do, I've got Misk related. Other, other than completing Village of Shadows, we've got to kill the Alpha Male. I've got to get that last goat that I missed. And I don't think I've got to do anything else. I mean, let wait, let me just see how many... We've got 39 out of 50 trophies, guys. Oh, yeah, and I've got all the... um. Not earned. we got to do the ones for um, crafting. Oh, yeah, 7877. Yeah, we'll do that. Yeah, so there you go. Oh, you've got to do a speed one. Oh, yeah, we've got to craft. We've got half um, 777 at once. So that I'll do that for Duke as well. Got... Make sure I don't forget to do that. What I'll do, I'll probably fully upgrade the Magnum because that'll bring my um, that'll bring my uh, money way down, way down, and then I'll just buy a few things. Then I think I think I'll do that. Yeah. Right. So there's there we go. Full health. Thank you, game. Thank you, gamey. Thank you for this. I owe you one. Yeah, it looks very sore, Ethan. Looks very, very sore. Yeah, I'm not collecting any treasure unless it's a boss crystal. Yes, yeah, so I'm just not going to bother. Unless it's a boss crystal, we're not getting it, guys. Right, so once we get out, we're going to go straight in and say hello to the Duke. Because he'll be straight opposite. That's it, you run away, little micey. Right, let's just grab, get it. Maroon Eye. Squeeze through this tight gap. I can do it. If anyone can do it, Ethan Winters can do it. He's not got to keep his head out of the way so you don't have one. So he's good. Right, the Duke. Hello, Dukey. <laughs> we meet again. Right, let's just make a save first. Village of Shadows. Welcome. Welcome. Ethan. Um, right, so inventory expanded. Right, so first of all, guys, we're just I'm just going to quickly... I've got to fully upgrade... Well, I've got to get all the attachments for certain weapons. 
So what was that? Um, was that a WXX? Yeah, WXX. I'm going to sell all this stuff. Yeah, I've, I've just saved the game, so I'm just going to reload that in a minute. Yeah, so I don't need to do them. Right, WCXX, do that first. WCX, where are you? There we go, got that one. And what else? This one. Yeah, you got to fully use every attachment on every weapon. Right, WCX done. I'll just, I'm just going to go in the order here. Um, Lemmy next. I hope this one right, where's the helpless. attachment for that? Alright, that's Lemmy done. Um, yeah, you need to do this. M19, let's do the M19 <laughs> next. Um, what we got? There we go. And what else? What's next? Um, V61. That's that one done. What's the next weapon? I'm doing one weapon at a time because in case I run out of money. Uh, so M9, M19. m So I run out of money, I know what I've done. Sort of. Uh, M18. Uh, tack next. What's he laughing for? Am I funny to you? Right, that's attack. Sig next. You'll be slaughtering things in droves. You have no oh wow well. yes okay let me sell a few things mate um that's done that's done that's done that's done that's done and i think the tack is done as well isn't it all right so sig was next weren't it all right so sig done um what's next um sniper rifle oh it's sniper rifle oh yeah on the stage bloody hell that one. Oh yeah, Wolfsbane, we'll do the Wolfsbane in a minute. So I don't think we're enough enough to do the stake as well. It just costs so much to do the stake. Well, but hopefully I will. Um, so where's the stake? Look how much. Am I gonna have enough to do the stake? Um, oh ho ho. No. Wow. Well, I this don't think. Oh, I have Very just. Just got enough to do the stake. Like. And veteran gunsmith. Yes. Um. Oh, yeah, because I've already done the uh, wolf's bane. I did it before to get infinite ammo, didn't I? I was just going to say, I haven't done the wolf's bane yet, but I have. Okay, so I now need to get to um, 777 lay. So I need to buy the rifle one there. An interesting selection. Um, uh -huh. Right, so let's see if I can get it, guys. Um, Good day then. In fact, I'm gonna yeah, I'm gonna do this as well. I'm going to sell that stake back. In fact, I need to buy a little crappy weapon before it let me do so. Let's buy this. Oh, excellent choice. Right, sell that back. I'm right, let's buy all the recipes. Then we'll do the and then what I'm going to do, I'll just buy these again later when I've got enough money. Right, and now I can actually craft all these. Please come again. Yes, yeah, one we can't craft yet. It's one that you have to complete with the shadows to unlock the weapon. And you have to buy that before you can craft it. Right, so I need to get seven... Oh, idiots. I just saw... <laughs> oh, my God. Aha. Thank you for your purchase. <laughs> right, I think... Can you do 777? I think you can. So, um, <laughs> right, okay, guys, let's see if I can get to 777. Um, so 
So, 77. Oh, wow. I can. I've just got to sell 11 now. Wow, 11 of these. And we're good. Wow. Awesome. Oh, that's quite that's quite simple that that time. That's quite simple. Um, okay, so I think we I think we're done here for now. Let me just um, check my challenge menu. Uh, right, where are we? Just want to make sure. Wow, I didn't even do that. Um, yeah, I know I've got to do that. Um, I'd sign. Yeah, ten out of eleven. Ten out of eleven. Yes, one one goat. Yes, it is that goat left. All right, cool. So, okay, guys. So we start spawn back at that safe point that I just made last safe. All my money back. Right, it's got to fully upgrade this magnum now. Welcome. We're going to keep the GM so it nice. Yes, we can I use it flashbangs, like I was saying. Let's get rid of this treasure. Them. Don't it's need that. Bombs. I'm going to keep the first aid meds. Right, so um, I'm just going to upgrade the magnum fully. See what I've got left. Then I start buying the inventory. And um, right, where is it? Uh, and you buy the attachment for it. There we go. Increased ammo. There we go. Now let's upgrade that baby. Wow. I think I'm just going to have enough because it costs 950,000 fully upgrade this, I think it is. I think it's about 950,000. So I'm only just going to have enough to fully upgrade this baby. Leave this to me. One moment. Oh, I've still, oh, I've still got quite, quite a bit. Okay, so um, let's buy that, and let's buy that. Well, get all these ready. Right, we're good to go, guys. Let's make another save here. Right, yeah, let's do it. Yeah, so um, open this. Uh, unlock this door. Cause you're gonna need to come in here later, if you remember. There we go. Unlock it. You need to come through there later. Yeah, so I'm literally not going to collect anything at all. Nothing. Not going to collect nothing. Natter. Oh, yeah, got to examine that. Inside the maroon eye ring is the eye. Eye of a tiger. Eye is just an anonymous object. I see you. I don't think so. Cassandra? I don't think I'm going to do that when I've got a wolf's bane in my hand. My duck. But um, I'll let you try. Right, let's go. Not got to collect any files. No loot. Wow. Much better. Much better. Oh, wow. Oh, what's that music? Oh, I know that song. That's um, the Chow Time by Radio Sixpence. I know that one. Right, look how look how far this goes with the magnum. Look at this. Almost bloody flies off the wall. Wow. Open. Yeah, you're not gonna shoot me with your bloody arrows. I've had enough of arrows. Arm and sold out. Oh he's not there. Right, this is where your flashbang comes in handy, guys. Saves always messing about killing the enemies. I see it, just come through here like this. Whoa! Careful, because sometimes if an enemy is behind a wall, it may not hit them. Yeah, so just be very, very careful. Oh, he fell over, bless him. Get over it, fucking hell, woman. Chem fluid. Right, yeah, I just lob a flashbang first. There we go. Easy, guys. Oh, let's reload. Sangua. Yeah, the Magnum's good enough. You don't need the stake. Who needs a stake? Who wants to save a million pounds? I do. Right, it's 10,000 it. Yeah, you'll find where all the attachments were. You'll... Um, yeah, where all the attachments were, you'll find a, a bag of cash now. And um, and the weapons, not just attachments of weapons, 
and normally the attachments is like a fixed 10,000 I think why am I looking at the file I've done that habit yeah the attachments I think they always have 10,000 there but the weapons depending on the weapon you'll get a little bit more I think like the first weapon you're supposed to find you'll get like 10,000 and then the next weapon will be like 15,000 and then you, you end up with a magnum and the magnum will give you 30,000 where the magnum used to be we're not going to run up there because there's no need to. Shall I give you the tour? Where am I going? Oh, yeah. No, you can get out. I don't want a tour, thanks. The sun is in my eyes. No, it's not. It's just a flashbang. Oh, I'll grab that herb. Yeah, so we've, we've just got one more thing to craft, guys. We've got all that crafting thing. Yeah, so if you do run out of healing items and you need to heal... Just use, just craft a, just craft a, uh, craft a herb, craft a herb. Right on her. Where's she gone? What have you done to how does she, how does she even know? Right, so that two women facing each other, and he's facing the horsey. I don't know if he's facing the horsey or the man. I'm just going to say he's facing the horse. Boom. Yes. My clockwork. What the, hell? what the hell? Right, flashbang. Thank you. Oh, that's a nasty surprise. Sorry, didn't mean to shoot you. You made me jump. I actually don't need to pull the trigger. Sorry, I accidentally pulled the trigger. It shouldn't surprise me like that. Oh, whoa. <laughs> yeah, this is why you should probably use a grenade launcher. At least if you miss, it still stuns them. But if you miss with this, then um, you can get caught. Yeah, quite, quite nastily. I can't believe Cassandra caused all this mess. She's grounded. Cassandra, you're grounded. Right, Dimitrescu key, thank you. Yes, leave it on the use it on the door and um a big lady will come through. Wow, a hat. Go ahead, do your worst. Do your worst. Ethan, do not tempt her, man. You seen what she turns into at the end? Right, let's pull that. Well, unfortunately, I don't think... Yeah, um, I don't think you can damage Dim Dimitres. I don't think you can stun her or anything like that. you got to avoid her. Best you can. Right, but if you come to the right first, she gets stuck on this door. I'm gonna... Oh, I've got no weapons, have I? So it doesn't even matter. Right, let's get my hand back first. Can't do much around my hand, can I? Wow. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait. Here we go. I can't heal because I have no hands. Wow. I'm going to die. Your right hand is unusable. No shit. Uh oh. Wow. Haha. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Alright, let's try that again. I don't normally die on that. It's because our bloody uh, monk caught me out. Right. You will learn. Hey, Demetrius, you seen the mess that Cassandra caused? Fucking disgusting. No! Why? Can't believe you'd attack an unarmed man. Where's your dignity? You'd really attack an unarmed man? Wow, 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 wow. Wow, wow, we are. Right, you want to let her come after you because if not, she's only going to burst through the cage. 
There you go. Follow me through. Uh oh. Wow. He was pretty quick to react. It's like he was plain dead. And he saw me coming. Come on, open. God damn it. Yeah, we got the Mask of Sorrow. Ooh. Don't worry, Ethan. You're safer now. I'm not running. I'm going to look for you. And I'm going to kill you. I'm going to kill your daughters first. And I'm going to let you watch and suffer. I'm going to kill them all one by one. I'm going to slice the jugglers. And I can't remember what else I'm going to do. But it's not going to be very nice. Yeah, mark my words, Lady Demetresque. Wow. Can't believe it. Just, wow. Really? Good. Like a jigsaw piece. Man, screw this castle. Alright, let's go. You know, I'm not messing about. Let's just get in and out, in and out, in and out. Nothing else to collect here. Wow, did I really just shoot it behind a pillar so I wasn't even going to go near him? What a numpty. Right. Uh, we bing, 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 bing. Oh, why? So close. I got made one mistake. That's the first mistake I've ever made. I'm playing piano. I'm an expert player. You know what I do when I've made this guide? I'm going to go and play the piano. Yeah, because I'm Ethan Winters and that's what I do. Piss off. That blinding light is a flashbang. Oh, hello. You Where's she gone? Don't waste my time. Nope, I'm sorry. Wow, that's close. She does get on you pretty fast. Outsider. Quick. She's coming, she's coming. That monster woman is huge. So you finally... Too late for that? You're dead. Just destroy already, will you? Right, let's go. Another mask, the mask of joy. Boom. Do I get it? Boom. Boom. Boom, and uh, I missed. Gotcha. Who are you? What's that? Is that Sangoa? I know I drink anywhere. Sniper. Oh, yeah, get a sniper off of there normally. There'd be another bag of cash in its place. So thank you, whoever left that there for me. Has been the Duke, though I really can't see him climbing this ladder. Bag of money, thank you. Right, have the flashbangs ready to get rid of these birdies. These are the birdies. They told Miranda about Rose, so watch their back. They will tell Chris. If you say anything bad about Chris, they will tell him, and then he will hunt you down. And he may bring Barry Burton with him, and you do not want Barry Burton on your tail, trust me. You know, Chuck Norris hides under the bed from the boogeyman. Um, the boogeyman is under the bed. When we look under the bed, we're scared of the boogeyman. When the boogeyman looks under the bed, he sees Chuck Norris. But Chuck Norris, when he looks under the bed, under the bed he sees the one and only Barry Burton. Alright, get down, ladder. He 
Yeah, a lot of people don't use this like, um, grenade launcher on um, Village Shadows. They just use a stake. But why would you not use this? Look at it. It's so easy to stun enemies and just run past them. Not having to waste time kill them. So much simpler. Right, I've got one more to kill. And then we'll kill the Lady Dimitrask. Uh oh. We'll see about that. We will see. You know, this is my second playthrough, Lady Dimitrescu, and in the first playthrough, you died. And the exact same is going to happen this playthrough, believe it or not. Yeah, it's a funny thing, that. Right, so um, I need to use an explosive here, guys. So instead of using pipe bomb, I'm just going to switch to explosives and shoot the wall. There we go. Right, where is she? You've got a magnum bullet on your face, lady. Right, let's grab that. Right, let's um, switch back to flashbangs already. And get my crystal torso. Thank you. Right, let's place the animal school back in its home. Where it belongs. Among these three women. There you go. Okay. Yeah, nice little that. orgy you got going on there. Right, she's going to be here. I'm just going to wait for her to pass along. Move along. Go on, lady. Move along. Right, let's quickly get past her. Wait. <laughs> Too slow. Yes, yeah, get over it. Right, so we've got sorrow, uh, mask of sorrow, uh, mask of pleasure, mask of joy, and mask of rage. Where is she? Wow, wow, wow. Whoa, okay, okay. Yes, I'm healing. Alright, Duke, please. Look after me. She's scared of you, mate. I don't blame her. I would be too. Go on. Piss off. What are you looking at? What the fuck is she looking at? Go on. Piss off. I guess you're going to stay here. Let's make a save, actually. I wonder what happens if you save your game and then um, reload it. Does that respawn or something? Right. Oh, shit. Or saw them was a full moon. I thought a Lycan was going to appear. Oh shit, shit, it's the last window. Oh no, I've got them all. Yeah, so all I'm going to do for this fight, I'm just going to spam her. Spam her to death now with Magnum. Magnum bullets. So first of all, just shoot a weak point quickly. Otherwise she's going to run at you. That's it, shoot a weak point a few times. Keep going. There we go, she'll fly away like normal, like a little coward she is. Alright, first aid med there I grabbed. Right, once she sweeps in. Now, do not attack her yet. Let her smash these, this tower here, this archway, and this archway here. Yeah, let her destroy these first, guys. And then once you destroy them, you just go to town on it. Remember, get out of the way when she's going to attack. No. That's it, just keep attacking her. Try and hit a weak point when she's up there and it'll stun her. Wow, wow, wow. That's it, yeah, already. You know, I think that's actually quicker than the stake. Honestly, when I'm using the stake, it takes ages. Well, not ages, but I'm like spamming so many bullets at her. But this, it does seem to do more damage. I don't know, it, it does. Oh, I've got to wait for it to sweep down now. 
I've tried shooting her, she's flying around, but it doesn't seem to do anything to her. I'm not shy. You're the one you're the one flying around, you two scared to come and fight. Yeah, really. Let's see about that. Yeah, I think this does actually do a lot more damage than the stake. But it's weird because it doesn't look like it does on paper. We're not even on paper, on statistics in the menu. It looks... The stake does more damage and if you look in the statistics, but... This... I don't know why. This just seems to do... I'm not sure if it's because of that little attribute if you... Yeah, if you go in the um, if you examine it here, it says effective against werewolves. So I don't know. I don't know why. Um, like if every enemy type is just classed as the same thing, sort of a werewolf. I don't know. Gross. But yeah, it, it's like it's got like a hidden damage modifier, which you can't actually see. If you catch my drift. Yeah, so um, I was just checking my time. I'm actually, I'm just, I've just gone over seven hours, haven't I? So, uh, yeah, it's taking quite a bit longer than what I thought it would. Quite a bit longer. I have actually, I have wasted a bit of time. Um, I reloaded looking for that uh, goat, didn't I? And um, look for that goat. I've had to, when I've recorded this, by the way, I've had to record it in parts. I, I can only record for like an hour and a half at a time. Then I have to sort of save it and it takes a minute to save it each time. So I've probably wasted wasted about 10 minutes doing that. 10, 20 minutes doing that. Um, I've died a few times, haven't I? And so that's probably another 10 minutes gone. Yeah, so... Um, yeah, you can... I think you can get it. You could get it done in about 6 to 7 hours. I think. Yeah, I reckon you could. Um, you got to make sure you don't make any mistakes, and you're pretty sort of flawless, flawless. Right, so it's going to quickly get through here because we'll, this will despawn all of these guys, these punks. That's it; they're all dead. Right, let's buy the remaining things from the Duke, and then we've got everything that we need. And uh, yeah, we've got everything that we need. What what have I got? What do I need left? Um, there you are. I had a feeling. There's nothing else to buy after I've bought all the recipes, I don't Seeking think. Something in particular. I am, mate, actually. Let me just buy a thing that I need from you. Oh, Lady Give it a that. Beautiful even in death. That waistline. Yes. Yeah, alright, stop it, you fucking little pervert. Uh -huh. Yeah, the rest, like, um... Good day, then. Yeah, so obviously you've got the rifle one if you buy a rifle. But the only one I need left is a rocket pistol ammo. Um, and I guess I can buy healing items if I need to. Right, so let's go and do it. So what I need to do, I need to go to a red chimney house. There's nothing I need to do here. I just need to make sure when we get to where... Uh, when we get to um, Moreau's section. I think there's nothing, there's nothing missed I need to do until we get to Moreau's section. Let me just have a look. Where are we at? Where are we at? Story, story, story. Alpha, goats, craft every type. Yeah, um, yeah, I've just got the only missed things I have to do. I've just got to kill the goats. And, um, not even going to bother getting the treasure. Yeah, uh, Kill that goat and kill the alpha, the alpha wolf. And I'm just thinking, I'm not gonna get the trophy at the end of the game, am I? Wow, how did I miss? He's <laughs> stationary target. Yeah, I'm not even gonna get the um, trophy at the end, am I? Because I have to reload to craft that last recipe. Idiot. Well, I guess it was nice getting mercenaries out of the way, though. It's nice getting that done. Um, okay, so on 07, 0408, wrong way. Yeah, it's nice doing those now. It's a nice little um, change of pace, I guess. Good big bag of money. So I see 1,500 in that one because it's another weapon. Right, so as long as you're quick here. Oh my gosh, wow. 
Yeah, quick release that jack handle. Did I use it? Yeah. Right, so I'm just going to use explosive here, guys, because there's going to be some armoured enemies here. And lake, yeah. Obviously, the flashbang won't work on these, so I'm just going to lob these down instead. And we need to be quick here. There we go. I'm going to die. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Yeah, wow. Alright, so this bit, you need to be safe. Yeah, just come down here, take time, that's it. No need to rush. Why did I Why did I run down there for? What an idiot. Yeah, just take your time coming down here. It's quite a lot of these. You can see them all. It's quite a lot of these. Gotta make sure none come behind me, which will probably happen. Oh my gosh. Can he not will he not die during that animation or something? Is that why? Wow. <laughs> oh wow. Oh, I might as well get this well wheel now then while I'm here. I don't think I need it for anything, but I'm going to grab it anyway. Yeah, so I guess that spot you need to play it safe there. Just because you need to get a door open. And um, the time it takes you to open it, you probably get killed like I just did. So yeah, play that bit safe. Oh shit. I'm on Village Shadow, so I nice. So I need to get rid of him. Yeah. I was going to leave him then, like I do in casual. Um, but then I realised I'm on Village Shadow, so I need to kill him. Otherwise, he'll get onto me too quick. Right, that's it. Let's get to Angie's. We've got a key that we need. The four-winged key. Let's go to Angie's place and play some dolls. Yeah, my favourite hobby. How was it? You want to come and play with the dolls with me, Juki? Juki boy? I bet you want me to bring a doll back for you to play with, eh? Yeah, I bet. Dirty thing. Right, four winged key. I unlocked it, wow. I'm pretty impressive. The amount of doors I've unlocked. Oh shit, birdie. Got. Oh, thank you. Loads of money. I just want to get that last goat quickly. You know, I just want to make sure it's there. You know, I just want to make sure it's there. I have got every. I have got every goat. I don't know. I'm just. I don't know. I just find it weird that I couldn't see it. I know sometimes it's it's easy to get worried about things because um, you think you should see it. But then, even though you know that, I mean, I know that when you get things get out of screen, they do sort of um, disappear. The thing is, I've actually shot that. I've shot a goat before um, when I've not been able to see it. So I'm so far away. I'm so far away. I couldn't see it. I was just sort of shooting in the area of it, and then, and then I got it, and I was like, okay. So you can shoot it. You just can't see it. So that's why I'm a bit worried about this one. Alright, 43 minutes. So we're like, I mean, we're like 15 minutes in front of, so, yeah, I'm probably going to do this in just over two hours, I think. Um, family photo. Yeah, just over two hours. As long as I don't die too much, we should be good. Just over two hours. I think. Oh, what's going on? Right, let's go up. Up on the elevator. Take me up to the penthouse, please. 
Uh, so right, I've got an invite. Look at this. Look, come with me, Ethan. I've been invited to Angie and Donna's party. Can't wait. Little doll party. Tea party. Can't wait to play in the doll's house. But I'm locked and loaded. I'm ready. I'm bringing the weaponry to this. The firepower. Yeah, this goat over here, um, that goat over there, I've shot it from here before and I couldn't actually see it, even though the sniper rifle zoomed in, I couldn't see it. But I shot where I thought it was and it, I hit it, even though I couldn't see it. So that's why it's a bit weird at times. But I guess it that's how it works. Right, so let's go down and see this baby. Right, let's go down. I wonder what we'll find in the basement of Horus. Oh, they have a lamp on. Wasting electricity, I see. Bloody how many lights? I guess that's why the lights turn out later. It's just saving, you know, elect trying to do the, the thing for the economy. Right, where's my flask? Wanna play a game, Ethan? Yeah, why not? Yeah, I've got nothing what? better to do. Right, let's play Where's a game. My gun? Right, it's going to take a leg off. Right, let's, um, let me take a leg off. Let me give you an inspection. Just where I left it. Right, so the code for this door is, uh, is it 5529? 052911. There we go. Oh, we're on forty six minutes. Why is this here? Because it's a puzzle, Ethan. Right, so you're gonna move one with number two, we're gonna move two with number four, three with number four, and then four with number five, and then play. Wow, and I might play this again and again. I love this tune. Wow, so romantic. Look at them two in love. Oh, tweezers, sorry, yeah. Good luck in your marriage. Yeah, tweezers, let's go. Tweezers always come in handy. They're always useful for something. Right, let's take these tweezers down your neck. Open wide. That's it, good girl. Just stay there for me. Ah, uh, that's it, stay there. Good girl. Right, I've got to go back into the bedroom now. Right, let's uh, make a movie. Yeah, so two with five and then one with three. There we go, let's play The Ring. This is a home movie that I made. Didn't quite get it finished. This is my bedroom. Down there's my bathroom. Yeah, I like it. I like to have like a you know, a sweet, on, uh, on sweet bath, if you like. Oh, right, that's a ladder, yeah. You can see it through the wall, just to make sure you always find where it is. And that's it, movie finished. Yeah, I've got quite, got quite a bit of work to do on that one. Right, where's the scissors? 
Thank you, Doris, for looking after them for me. Right, let's cut the bandage. Bloodied bandage. No, I'm not going to answer the phone. Oh, Mia, phone, Mia, the phone, it's for you. Mia, doctor's on the phone. Oh, okay, she's gone. Right, scissors. It's too difficult to turn it over and um, just take the pin out, so I'm just going to use scissors instead. Much easier than taking the pin out. Right, brass medallion in a chest. Right, I'm going to rotate that. Flying bird, flying to the right, and uh, three blind mice. There we go, and brass medallion. Yeah, not the scissors. Not the scissors, the brass medallion goes there, if you're unsure. You can, you can try and fit the scissors in there, but I don't think they'll fit. Right, let's um, go and see what's down in the well. Go and see what's on my down in my ensuite bathroom. Yeah, breaker box key. Keeps the water nice and warm. Nice, well, Chris. Chris is back again. Chris Redfield is sad because um, Sheva dumped him for Leon. Yeah, get over it, Chris. And umbilical cord. I'm going to follow it. Oh, there's a knot there. Oh, shit, Chris. He's angry. I've never seen him that angry before. I'm going to take the back. I think I'm going to take the back path. There's no way he's going to think I'd do that. Run away from him, come round round back. No way. Danger, play grill. What language is that danger in? Got the relief of a child. I know it needs a fuse. Right, where's Chris gone? I heard him around here somewhere. Chris, where are you? Oh, there he was. Right, so um yeah, this is Chris's bedroom. Welcome. Probably not quite what you'd expect it to be, but um he's feeling a bit he's a quite he's not what he used to be, basically. I don't want to go too much into it. Could do a new sheet of wallpaper. Just put perhaps just one sheet, I think is enough. I think that's all the place needs. She's saying daddy. Hello. Sheva's not in here. She's not in here. Look at all, look at all that dribble. Thinking of Sheva. Dirty thing, Chris. He's thinking of a Joe sandwich as well. With Sheva. Made him dribble like that. It helps him move around quicker as well. He like slides on his own dribble. Makes him more agile. He can just pivot on the spot rather than have it to move and cur uh, turn at the same time.
quick. Wow. Thought I didn't press a button then. I think what's going on? I did see a prompt appear. Wow. No wonder she ever left him. Look at that. But what he gets like when he's horny. That's how he looks. Right, let's go and find that mad doll Angie. Wanna play a game? <laughs> I'll find you, don't you worry, in your bedroom I bet. So predictable. <laughs> So predictable. Right, I wonder where she's hiding now. I think she's hiding downstairs. Let's have a look. Is she behind the door? No. There she is. Got you. Got you, Angie. Maybe. I dropped it once, um, but that's it. It's not something I'm proud of. Right, here she is. Boo. Got you, Angie. Your ass is grass. She's bleeding. She's got blood inside her veins. She's a doll. Oh, Angie. Out. She's got real bad fucking growth on her face. So that's who right, got a key. Is. Let's get a flask. That makes two. If you need a drink, just uh, drink the flask. Right, let's go to Dr. Moreau. Medicine man. And um, get that last goat. And then on the way back from Stronghold, we're going to get the werewolf. The alpha male. The ultimate badass. He will meet Ethan Winters. The ultimate dad. He will protect his daughter no matter the cost. Nothing will stand in its way. Not Ethan the Great Redfield. Nobody. Only Barry Burton could perhaps... But he's nowhere to be seen. His skill is required in other parts of the world at the moment. So we'll probably see him in Resident Evil 9, perhaps. We'll probably see him in a sandwich, I don't know. Living out his trying to live out his fantasy. So um what am I doing now? Uh we don't need to. I don't need to do anything, anything here. But there is some money in. There's a bigger bag of money here we'll grab. No shit, not a lockpick. There we go, where the shotgun is normally. I'm gonna kill him. I don't think can stun him until he's come out of the floor properly, so I'm just gonna stun him. I kill him. So up there it's got Luther's key. And a file and a save point, so don't really need to go up there. So I'm just sprinting back now. Oh yes, Archer's here, guys. Yeah, Archer's here. So just love flashbangs. Yeah, you see him, like an Archer's. Yeah, just love flashbangs to be on the safe side. Right, where? See, he's gonna come out of the floor somewhere. Well, okay, missed him somehow. There's going to be another one here. Hello, Pikaboo. Should I 
should have put some yellow snow in his mouth. Right, and uh, yeah, nothing else to do. Let's go. Let's head straight in. Let's not mess about. I guess we can kill this wolf now. In fact, yeah, there's two wolf. There's two of these wolves on um, Village of Shadows, so we need to kill them. Sort of, otherwise you may get in trouble. Right, they don't take much. I mean, what? He took three shots. Crystal beast. What a beast. Right, it's one more, and there's one more. Should be just around that corner where we have to go. Oh, I'm just going to date. I'm just going to knock him out first. There we go. Oh, what a shame he died. Just like your mate. Your mate, Peter, he died as well. Same In the same way as you. He's gone to doggy heaven. Because that's what you are, a little doggy. A little doggy that's grown a bit too large. And needs removing from this universe at once. Hey, come back, bacon. Walking piece of bacon. <laughs> <laughs> Pigs. Could have been worse. There could have been like zombie pigs. Wow. Zombie pigs. Uh, zombie dogs are quite scary, but I'm not sure about zombie pigs. I think I still want to eat them. Cook them. Make a bacon sandwich. Right. Um. Where are we going? So we're gonna get a flask now. At this point, this doesn't probably seem that much like a speedrun, but uh, yeah, but it's still going to be quite a fast time. I think it's going to end up about over eight hours, probably eight and a half. Wow. No, probably longer than that. Wow, it's going to be about nine hours, isn't it? Damn, I thought it'd be much quicker. I don't know why it's taking so long. I thought it'd be much quicker than this. How long did mercenaries take? I think mercenaries took longer than what I thought it would be. I was thinking if um, I know mercenaries takes it can take a few hours, but I think I was thinking that if I did mercenaries and um, just quit as soon as I got S rank, it wouldn't take that long. But I guess the thing is, you still on the first few levels, you still have to um, play literally almost right to the end of every area. So it doesn't really save much time. It doesn't really save much time. Probably only saves like 20 minutes or so, I guess. Because you're not doing the first... Um, you're not doing all the areas on probably the last few chapters, I guess. But I've had to retry a few things. We've had to get a few trophies here and there. Right, let's um, get my flashbang ready. Wow, well, where am I going? Boat key, yes. Wow, an armoured lichen just dropped down. Yeah, they get on you pretty fast, but not fast enough. If only they were as fast as that monk back in the mansion, in the castle, they'd have caught up with me. Oh, windmill, wow, I can't wait to go and play in the windmill. Yay. Right, let's go for a boat ride. You and me, let's go, Ethan. Me and you. Right, it's just dock. Um, leave the dock even. Wow, that's a big fish. It's a big old fish. Right, it's Doc. And uh, go and look in the tent. I wonder if we can see the goat from here. No, I still can't see it. You see, it's not like the... You see the area behind it then, it's just spawned in then. <laughs> yeah, wow. Action man. Why is all those planks flying around? What am I supposed to do? Flying planks? 
Yeah, that's what it looked like. What am I supposed to do? Don't worry, Ethan, I've got you covered, mate. I'll tell you exactly what you need to do. So you need to go in this windmill, you need to go down, you need to go across the um, building, well, the um, floating floor. And then you need to climb up another windmill. Did I just drop by where the drop down where the ladder is? I think I did. Wow, I was gonna say I'm a really bad shot, but I got it in the end. There's Moreau. I'm hoping he dies pretty quick. Wow, well, almost went straight into him. I never realised he was coming, so I didn't hear any noises. Right, let's go and get his last goat and get the heretic trophy. It's annoying that you can't see what goat it is you're missing. Oh, there it is. I can see it now. Wow. I can see it now. Yeah, it's on the t tallest one. I should not have left it. I should have got it just when we went through. Stinks. Fucking stinks there, man. Don't worry. It's on your right hand, Ethan. There it is. Last go. Wow, heretic. We got it. I wonder if this is going to kill Moreau quicker. Like it did um, uh, Dimitrescu. It seemed to kill Dimitrescu a bit quicker. I'm not sure about this Dortus. I'm not, I can't recall how long, how much they took to kill. Wow. Wow. Why did I fall in then? I press a lever, right? I must have missed a lever and not realised. I must have. Right, so that lever, that lever, that lever. I don't know what happened then. I don't know why that just went down too quick. It's normally the orange one that goes down a bit too fast and can kill me. Yeah, you can actually shoot me, but I'm not sure if it... I wonder if it'll... Oh, I can't even check now, so I've already, already done it. Yeah, I wonder if it does avoid the knife only. If you shoot him during this sequence. I mean, it shouldn't do, because technically you can't actually kill him. But he does actually, it does actually impact him, look. Hmm, interesting. Interesting indeed. Next time, Mama. Ugh. I did it. Yeah, come on. Just hope your hand don't snap off. Ah, I missed. Too slow, Moro. One hit kill on this green slime. Winner. Right, let's pull the lever. Come on. We got this. Oh my gosh, caught me a big one. Caught myself a big one. That's what I just said, even. Don't copy. Oh, I'll fucking chop your hand off again. I will. I'll just turn that rifle uh, magnum on yourself and blow your hand to bits. Right, what have we got here? Shoot the padlock. Yes, up the ladder. Almost there. Not too far away. This is. This is about halfway through the game, isn't it? Is it? It's just about halfway through. I don't know. It's Dr. Moreau's a bit halfway through. Well, I know. Got to examine this first. I know you get to Angie's at about two hours. Uh, sorry, about one hour. Uh, probably just under halfway, perhaps. I bet. There's definitely only an hour left. Yeah, I should be done within an hour. As long as I don't die too much. Right, where am I going? Oh yeah, up the ladder. And then I'll go and get rid of Moreau. Whee! 
Yeah. Cowabunga. Right, let's place the crank in the slot and turn. And that will drain the water. Because Ethan is an engineer now. He's a water engineer now. He knows all okay. this stuff. He knows how to operate a dam. It's Lois gate. He knows how to do this. It's Lois. Right, let's um, go and... Yeah, let's go and do this. So, what's a little puzzle? Oh, we got blue, white, and then we got blue. I mean, orange, blue. And then power was restored again. No giant frog's gonna jump out our lane and instantly kill me. Doesn't look like it. Right, Ethan, let go. It's been operated. You can let go. There he is. Let's kill him before he gets a chance to become a boss. Oh, we can't. Good if you could take some damage off him now. Make it a bit easier. Look at this tractor, beast. I could win him over. Right, it's a lay there where there was an attachment. He was still going on the roof, by the way, like he does normally. Um, if you quit, you can deal enough damage on time, but it's real difficult in Village of Shadows to do it. Yeah, okay. What the hell? He caught me with his tail when he's already on the roof. I know he can damage you when he's going up, but he'd already gone up. Alright, let's reload while I'm waiting. Yeah, so he might do this twice. Yeah, he might do this twice. Sometimes he does. Can't tell if he is or not. No, he's not. He's coming down. Come on, mate. Take what? Wow, that went too bad. It went too bad, just kept um, spamming him with bullets, sort of. I was trying to go for his weak point. It's a weak point. Um. Yeah, but I'm not even sure how quick it would kill him anyway, because... Um, yeah, so we've got a key here. Yeah, but you can see, you can use, you can use flashbangs to sort of stun him for a moment. It's just the reload time on that really lets you down. The reload time really lets you down on flashbangs. I hate it. It needs to be like the grenade launcher on um, uh, Mercenaries. It's awesome on that. Because that's similar to how it was on Resident Evil 3 Remake. That's how it should be on this. But I don't know why I've made it so bad. But it is what it is. And now we're going up in an elevator. And... I was going to say there's no elevators left, but we've got a big, the huge elevator in um, the factory. We've got quite a few in the factory, haven't we? Oh, I've got a Chris's section yet. Oh, yeah, can't wait for that. All we've really got is the infinite dragoon. Shame we can't get infinite grenades. That'd be pretty cool. I actually try and save my grenades for um, Uri um, Urias with Chris, his brother. His twin brother. I tried saving for him. Um, flashbangs don't really stun him for that long, so I don't really use them. But I like to use grenades and knock him down, and they can get to his weak point easier, do more damage. Right, so um, yeah, where the Magnum was, there will be thirty thousand lay. I'm just going to leave it. So I'm just going to head straight to the stronghold. Nothing else of importance to do here. When I pass by grenade launcher, we'll pop in and uh, grab a lay that's in there. Just in case you want it for anything. Yeah, just open this gate and uh, you'll find inside. 
Big bag of cash. There we go. 20,000 lei. Right, so let's go straight into Stronghold. Yeah, so all I do on my way up, I just spam flashbangs. I can't remember if you get any, like, you may get armoured enemies on the way up there. I can't quite remember. So, yeah, I'm just going to head, head up and spam flashbangs, I think. Yeah, and then on the way out, kill the alpha. Then all we've got to do is complete the game then, and then um, craft the mass rest piece on a uh, load the game back up, buy the um, rocket pistol, and then craft the recipe. And we're done. Alright, where are they? Where are the lichens? Nope, get out. I'm just going to spam these now. I'm not taking any chances. I'm just going to spam these. I probably should have um, crafted some healing items. Because I don't think I've got any. Wow. If I get hit, I could be in trouble. Wow. Now, I could be in trouble now if I get hit. So I can't heal. Oh, I can um, I can craft, can't I? Yeah, I can craft. But make sure you got, a, make sure your rocket launchers, your grenade launchers loaded, ready. Because normally, as soon as you pull that, you, a lot of time I get hit straight after. Right, last one. Right, and the gate should lower now. Wow. Right, let's lob an explosive there. They yeah, didn't like that, did they? Wow. 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 Quick. Whoa, whoa, wow, wow, wow. Wow. It missed him. Oh, because it's a bloody explosive round, wasn't it? Right, I'm out of here, guys. Excuse me. Oh, yeah, we've got to get through this bit now and bloody um, build shadows. Yeah, but we'll just run straight through it. I'm not going to mess about. Um, right, so we make a save. One hour fifteen. Let's go and do this. So we've got our flashbangs ready. This must be their den. It is. It is their den, Chris. You're right. I mean, Ethan. Wow. I forgot that he bloody drops down right in front of you. Cave, you don't hang around because you have crossbow enemies shooting you. Wow. I don't think that's fair. Before you even get a chance to recover, they bloody hit you like that. That's definitely not fair. Right, I've got to be careful up here because the armoured lichen's going to appear. And there's one right behind me as well. Okay, big guy. Okay, that did the trick. Yeah, so explosive round straight in there. Yeah, I've. Yeah, I am sort of speedrunning this, but it's, this is more like a. It's probably more like. It's. It's not like a opt. It's. Well, it's not like a, a practice speedrun where I make no mistakes. Nothing's absolutely perfect. There's a lot of room for error here. A lot of room for improvement. Well, a lot of room for error. Well, I make a lot of errors actually, but there's a lot of room for improvement. Um, so yeah, you can you can get a lot better time than this, but you know I'm satisfied with just doing this, um, getting it under sort of ten hours, I guess. Right, let's get our first aid spray. Right, let's do it. So he's got to kill Urias here, Uranus. 
as you drop down he'll sort of drop down there's another first aid med on the left here where is it no wrong side I think yeah what well, there is right and uh I feel I can take most of health down before he even jumps. Although he's already kill, uh, called the um, Lycans. Wow. Whoa, wow. Wow. What? Very tag team again. What an idiot. Wow. Should have blocked. That's not good. Maybe I should let him drop down first. If I just go mad on him. Well, I got one of them. Where's your there? No, put that down. What are you doing? Put that down, naughty. Don't be naughty, your ears. That's better. Right, give me that crystal hammer. I'll find use for that. Duke will give me a good amount of money for that. Right, let's go and get his last flask and then head into the factory. Yes, torso flask. What? Don't worry, Ethan. You've had a lack of sleep. It was an illusion. You're hallucinating. Right, let's go and kill this alpha uh, werewolf. And um, that'll be me. Yeah, that'll be us. We'll do factory and then we'll go into Chris's section. And then we'll kill Miranda. And uh, get the last few trophies. Killing Miranda ain't that much of a tr uh, problem. As long as you take a few healing items with you. She's not too bad, actually. Oh, no, Village of Shadows. Yeah, she's not too bad. Unlocked it. And um, six winged unborn key. Yeah, hell of a name for a key. No, wrong one, no wonder. It doesn't fit that lock, can't you tell? That key lock is not a size of an unborn key. Good night. Right, so um, I'm just going to stun this um, lichen, werewolf. And uh, keep attacking him with my... Um, where is he? There he is. Let me just get somewhere where I can get a good view on him. So he actually recovers really quick. Right. That's it. Shoot him in the ass. No. Well. Missed. Wow. He dies pretty quick, don't he? That's it, get in there. Get that tight, but lead of the pack. that's it. So what we've got to do now, guys, get the ending get the ending trophies and craft the remaining recipe, which is the rocket pistol ammo. And the rocket pistol is such a crap weapon. I don't even know why you unlock it on Village of Shadows. It's, it's so weird. Right, where am I going? Oh yeah, to um the factory. Yeah, I don't know why they've made that an unlockable weapon. It's on Village Shadows. Village Shadows should be the best weapon in the game. I don't know why they haven't put the rocket launcher in the game. You know, which light just destroys everything. Alright, so um, let's place all these flasks. And cutscene begin. What was that? That's a cutscene, mate. Alright, the mermaid. Was it a merman? Can't quite tell. Um, what's that? 
That's the moon, a crescent moon, with the sun behind it. And then we have Dimitrescu flask. Right. Now I've got my inventory upgraded, I can actually fit that in my pocket. Right, there'll be no liking here now, they're all dead. Well, they're all despawned. Wow, look at that, it just opened. Automatic doors, we've got automatic doors in this game. Awesome. What's going on? It's just an earthquake, Ethan, relax. What's going on? So dramatic. Right, Giant's Chalice. There we go. Like a glove. Right, skip that. Right, let's go into the factory. So, factory, Chrysis, Miranda, done. I'm hoping I do um, Heisenberg first time. I've spent quite a lot of time on Heisenberg, actually. So, I'm hoping I don't find it too bad. He dies really quick when you're Ethan. Uh, well, Ethan, I mean, when you're on foot with the, your weaponry and your magnum, he dies really quick. It's just when you're in that tank when he's a bit tricky. And Chris's section is annoying because you have to kill almost every enemy because otherwise you just get overrun. I guess it's a bit like it's actually a bit like mercenaries, but you just got worse firepower. You have to use that dragoon. You can't upgrade it or anything. It's just how it. It's just how it comes. I'm not worried. It'll be fine. Bryce will be fine. Just get your ass across the bridge. Oh yeah. So in the mountain, deep in the mountains. Ah. Ethan Winters. Welcome. Yeah, we were just talking, I mate. I think you'd make it past Donner Moreau. But I suppose you survived hey. worse back in America, hmm? Hmm? I like you. I'm married, mate. I've survived far worse. I'd like to speak to you about Rose. Miranda. Oh, come on I can take anything. Not, it's not a trap. Not a trap? Oh, okay. It's not a trap. Let's go in. Come on. It's not a trap. Let's go. Let's do this. Oh, you need to be careful now because there's some monks. There's going to be some monks in your way now. Almost forgot about this. There's one monk here. There we go. And you're going to have a few over here, I think. Just around this corner. Oh, it's just one. A dead end. Damn it. <gasps> yeah, you gotta watch it. Them chase sequences. There's gonna be some uh, monks there now walking about. The um, flashbanks stun the soldiers quite a long time, by the way. Um, obviously not the armored ones. If we've got a face mask on, you gotta get rid of the, the face mask first. Right, and um, these monks, you can't, I don't think you can stun them at first until you knock the face masks off. That's why I'm sort of using my magnum. Oh no, I think you can actually, let's wait. Oh yeah, you can see, you can see, they, it just, their face masks don't actually work. Uh, you know, when it comes to flashbangs. Doesn't really work that well. Right, it's got to be quick, so we'll get on you really fast. Right, that's it, in the production area. This place is messed up. Wow. I've got to get upstairs. I know, this factory is just in... You'd never think this factory is deep in the mountains, would you? It's a right hidden complex. Typical, definitely sort of umbrella sort of thing. I know it's not umbrella, but... Um, Seems like it should be. Well, I'm going to get rid of these guys. Okay. Death by toe. I shot that one in his weak... His toe was his weak point. Not his Achilles. It was a toe connected to his Achilles. That was his downfall. Right, what have we got through here? Oh, yeah. 
Wow, 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 wow. Whoa. Really? I. It's been a while since I played Village Shadows, actually, and I forgot this guy was here. Right, like, what am I doing? Oh, I'm just getting the, um... I'm just trying to get the, uh... Mold, aren't I? Relieve the horse relief. There we go, relief mold. Wow. Whoa. I don't know if these guys are going to follow me. Oh, I'll leave it. Right, I'm not going to keep shooting these all the time. Can't be asked. Oh, actually, I'll go and do it now. Where's your mate? Oh, he was sleeping. Bless him. He was sleeping and I woke him up. Oh, I'm so sorry. Right, relief of a horse. And yes, let's go. Right, yeah, I'm just going to run around flashbanging. I'm not going to bloody keep stopping to kill them all. Who's around there? Sounded like a soldat around the corner. Right, well, gotta be careful. Don't hit these things. Will probably kill me almost. Will they be? Wow! Wow! All right. Didn't go. Didn't go uh, down too bad. Just that first one. Yeah, well, the thing is, I'm gonna, I'm probably going to be similar time going through these areas and what I was, uh, to what I was with the knife. But the thing is, now I will, the bosses will be much quicker. Well, they should be, because um, I don't have to spend 20 minutes knifing them. Right, let's get his cog mold. And uh, right, unlock the door. Right, it's going to be one of these bad boys. Right, it's lob the cog mode. There we go. Right, yeah, let's use that first. Wow. Right, a lot of the cog in there. Right, and let's get them flashbangs ready. Right, yeah, I can't remember where all these come from now, so I'm just going to run around lobbing flashbangs. Oh, yeah. Not messing about with that. Yeah, we've turned the power. We've turned the power on, haven't we? So, um. Uh oh, quick! He's coming for me. On the, he's on the war path. 
Oh yes, dumb. Wow. Yeah, I forgot. I forgot about them guys for a second there. Wow, that's lucky. He's right behind me, isn't he? I see all the sparks flying. Very, very long way. Oh, is that merry-go-round? I mean, a uh, uh, wheel thing. Oh, wow, look, a ride. Wow. Millen men millennium wheel. Miranda thinks we're nothing but children. Just the Resident Evil version. Oh, she doesn't care for us. You have to no. be strapped to a dead body instead she of going around in a little carriage. Still fun. Still fun. I don't give a shit about your family drama. Ethan, do not even entertain him. Right, so, um... Before we get up there, I'm gonna shoot these. Otherwise we'll get into trouble. Wow. So that one, you can get it for the explosives. Is it this one? Yes, got that. That's it, got them all. Let's go. Got my flashbang shred in case I need to stun anything. Another one? I stun them in a minute. I just wait a bit close to the top. And then I'll lob a flash in their eyes. I don't want to recover too quickly, I want it to last until I get to the ladder. And it has. Not too bad. Not too shabby that one. Right, explosive rounds are ready to shoot this fan that's going to suck me in in a second. Come on, let's get through, get, let's get, let's get through this. Let's be done in 30 minutes. Wow. Ethan, you should have seen that it's not a good idea to go out there. Lob a grenade. Lobbing a grenade would have been a good idea. Or just lob a explosive around. I'm sure that'll detonate it when it hits. Right, don't got that goat, don't need to go up there. Shit, that was close. Even on, on my not 200,000, even on Village of Shadows, I know I've got quite a lot of treasure to sell. Even on Village of Shadows, if you don't really do much looting, you don't end up with much money, do you? Yeah. Right, I made it. I just can't believe how much um, damn, how much health the um, armored lichen seem to have. I mean, the alpha werewolf went down much quicker. I, it's probably when you're hitting the helmets, it's just not doing any damage. I don't know. The armored lichen just seems to take so much health. There's so much damage to kill them. Right, so let's get the key mold. There we go. Go and mold the key. Go and see um, Storm. Go see Chris, get a tank that he's built for me. Kill Heisenberg, then do Chris's bit, and then kill Miranda. Yeah, 30 minutes. We've got this. That's going to be like over 8 hours. Wow. Much, much longer than what I thought it would be. I thought it would be so much quicker than this. 1 hour 35. They say, they say this is longest Res Resident Evil, don't they? I know Resident Evil 3 is pretty fast. You get through there in like an hour and 10 minutes, can't you? Resident Evil 3. Um, Resident Evil 2 can take quite a while, though, can't it? I mean, Resident Evil 2 takes about 1 hour 50. I guess this is only a little bit longer, isn't it, than Resident Evil 2 Remake? 
Right, when I get to them armoured guys, I'm not going to kill them. I'm just going to try and stun them quickly and then run past. The thing is that last one is going to be in the way. She's going to be in this corridor. It's dark. So I may just have to kill him quickly. I may not have a choice. Right, so just got to craft that key mold. Um, craft the key. But yeah, I know there's going to be some of these guys on the way there. And there's going to be another one down the bottom here. Did he recover quite quick? Or was that another one? Oh, he did. Wow. Yeah, there's another one through here. Managed to get stuck somehow. Wow. Wow, he got stuck. Okay, let's do this. Okay, he died pretty quick. I guess the other one will be down. There he is. Alright, so I might need explosive rounds to knock the armour off the... Um, I've got a key here. Yeah, we're good to go. Yeah, flashbangs might stun them. I'm, I'm not quite... I can't remember if flashbangs stun these. I mean, they have got helmets on. I just can't believe our flashbang stunned them. I mean, they've got helmets on. These guys are dumb. But I might be in trouble with this guy because I can't get past him otherwise. It's good though because um, the Magnum does blast the armor off. Like, if you do do enough damage, it does seem to knock their armor off. Right, so Stum's going to go down pretty easy. He's just got a lot of flashbangs and he'll run into the wall because flashbang disorientates him. And then we'll shoot him in the back with a flat, uh, with a magnum and he should go down within a few shots. Not too many. Is that garlic? No wonder why it stinks in here. Is that garlic? I don't know. Looks like it. Oh yeah. Try using the key first. Oh, let's go. Oh, I'm going to get his first aid med first. His first aid med just through this door. There it is. Thank you. Right, let's go and do this. Time to die. Yeah. Talking to yourself again. Yeah, he gets all confused. I don't know why. Wow. He's dead. Now stay down. He only had one more shot left. Damn, that's a shame. Damn, I didn't finish him off. Right, where's the door? Over here, yeah? Right, I'm not getting a cigar or anything. Let's go and kill Einsenberg. So hopefully I'll get rid of him first time. Don't have to spend too much time uh, retrying. I'm hoping. I'm more worried about Chris's bit, if I'm honest. Just for all them enemies we have to kill. Miranda's not too difficult. As long as you've got some healing items with Miranda. It's not really that bad. The thing is with Chris, you... Where am I going? You have to use an automatic weapon. And it's not like a one-hit kill. You almost got to put a full mag into enemies to get rid of them. That's the thing that's troublesome with Chris. You know, just you have to got to have good accuracy, otherwise you may get yourself into trouble. You can't turn back now. Right, so um, let's get his first aid med and go for it. Well, we've got three. I thought I'd have more than that. Right, hold, hold it, hold it. He left it. Does she know he left it running? I'm coming, Rose. Right, I'm coming, Chris. I mean, Rose. Yeah, can I shoot this soldier at Stan?
No, it doesn't look like it. Okay, you can't shoot down the soldats. This cave is massive. This later will become a umbrella lab. Mark my words. This will be converted into a lab for umbrella. All right, so um wow. Yeah, so I'm going to save my rocket for when he starts charging me. Yeah, just got to keep it in his weak points. Well, one more and I can't even see it. Wow. Get out of my way. Yeah, when he gets too close, use that rocket to make some distance between you. Uh oh. Oh, I thought... I thought I might just get him, get him in time, his weak point. But obviously I didn't. On quick, yes, just in time. Nothing. Move your head out of the way, you Heinzenberg. Well, well, well. Uh oh, here he comes, here he comes. Just. Yeah, every time you've got all three weak points, they'll all like recover in time. They'll like come back. Right, yes. I finally, oh, I was going to say one didn't fall down right in front of me and then a bit of debris fell on me. Come on, mate, just die while you're ready. Let's see, where's his weak point? Oh my god. He's so close to being dead then. Wow. As I mean, it's quite, it's quite difficult this. And I don't think you can outrun him. No, you, you can't outrun him, you see, but he, but he, you have to, when he charges at you, you're just like in trouble. That's why you just got to keep hitting his weak points. Don't give him a chance to um, recover. I'm sure I almost had him then anyway. And really, I, I should be leaving this bottom weak point for last because it's the easiest one to hit. Well, 
Getting too close to me now. So I'm probably almost dead now. I'm sure, yeah, I'm going to be dead soon. If he hits me one more time, that's it, game over. Save that rocket for any charges you. You try and get his debris between you, but he puts down it. Yeah, it was sort of, well. Uh oh, here we go. Keep him at a distance. Don't charge me. Wow. I've got my rocket back. That's it, you get back. Oh yeah, nice. Nice he's done that. Get something to hide behind for a moment. Not yet. I won't be long. No, 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 no. Come on, man. Just die, Heisenberg. He's getting very close, though. I'm going to be ready with that rocket. There we go. Did I get him? Wow, finally. Well, it only took it only took one retry. Not too bad. Yeah, so now it's the easy part. So we've just got Chris now, and that's the last hard section done. Yeah, it's it's Heinzenberg and the Chris section. They're the difficult parts. So all we've got to do now is fire a rocket at him when we're above in the air. Eat this, mate. Open wide. Dental check. Do not push that blade any further, please. Do not push it forward, I beg you. Right, so, um, yeah, you can actually stun him as well. I think, I'm sure you can stun him. Yeah, he's so easy. I mean, look at him, he's so easy. Once you, once you get him out of that um, tank, it's so easy. So that's it, just Chris, Chris section, then Miranda, and we're all done. And then craft the rocket pistol ammo. We've got to buy it first. I think you have to buy the rocket launch, uh, rocket pistol, you know, to unlock it. Right, let's go and um, finish off this uh, Autobot. No, this Decepticon. Wannabe Decepticon. That's it, Ethan. Come on, you got it, man. Well, that's the transformer done. We've done the um, we've done the evil Lycan King. We've done the Vampire Queen. We've done the um, mutant fish. Now we've just done the transformer. Is that my phone? Oh, it's Alpha. Hello, Alpha. Yeah, so you got you got to take your time with this. You got to take your time. You see, Dra uh, Dragoon. And uh, I just I just kill each enemy as I come across them, just to be safe. I get all the loot. I grab all the loot we pass, just in case I need to heal or anything like that, to be on the safe side. 
Share your screen, and I'll go over the situation. Been a while since we fought together, Captain. When was the last? The desert? Doing nothing but recon's gotten me out of shape. But thanks to your recon, we know more. Yeah, we'll grab some healing items. 21, 1 hour 47. Right, so should I have infinite ammo for this? Yes, we have. Everyone watch for hostile bombs. Wonder what challenges I've completed. Wow. Yeah, if you need to unlock any infinite ammo or anything, just go into your um you just, group of The game just save when you play as Chris. Right, oh whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, don't just run forward. Move forward slowly as Chris and pick it and then the enemy shouldn't spawn too fast. And you can pick them all off well. Hopefully one at a time. Here he comes. Wow, 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 wow. There we go. So you got, what was that? Five? You got five there. I think it was. Oh, and there's another one. A few more. Only two. There we go. So you got five sort of, you got two spawn first and three in the middle. And then two at the bottom. As long as you don't move too fast, they shouldn't all spawn at once. Right, flashbangs if we need them. Ammo, uh, healing packs. Oh yeah, we've got one of the big werewolves here, by the way. So you may want to save a flashbang for this bit. Right, yeah, one of the big werewolves are going to jump in. So I'm just going to keep this handy. Let's go. You can outrun him if you're just really quick. I'm going to have a flashbang. Play safe. Don't even know that hit him or not. I don't know. But um, I didn't get hit, so uh, I take that as a win. Right, some items. Yeah, healing pack. Right, next bunch of enemies. We're going to be two through here. So two will spawn to begin with. Uh oh, I still had ammo. Wow, that's lucky. I still had ammo left. I should have finished them off. Right, when you come out here, normally another one. There he is. That guy spawns. Yeah, wait a minute. It's another another guy comes on the right there. You dropped your match, mate. Right, normally when you, when you get here, a few more will spawn. Right, a load will spawn in the distance now, you'll see. There they all are. Just wait a minute because a few will run up to you. Should do. Well, that's one of them. Can't remember if there's another one or not. It does not like it. Right, so I'm going to get these guys on the roof first. And um, sometimes, if you, you can kill them, but they may just jump down and come straight for you. Should be ready. I'm trying to stay behind because there's a lot of archers wow just like that there's him up there he's just jumped down you see him he's gonna come to me there he is well he tried bless him Right, and uh, well, they're just running for me, ain't they? Just right, I'm gonna get my flashbangs ready. Uh, right, just in case the armored guys can drop down here. Right, let's love that flash. Wow. I need you know what I need here? I need a bloody grenade. Wow, where did he caught up quick? Right, let's lob a grenade. Let's do it. Fire in the hole! That's it. 
A trail of death. Yeah, you can. I mean, once you get to the end here, they all despawn. So it's up to you if you just want to try and push past them. But if you get caught, that could be it. Game over. Right, and you'll find long you take, there'll be two that will just keep spawning. By the way, so you don't want to take too long. Yeah, two just keep spawning. Yeah, that's what I find. Where did he come from? Dropped out of sky. Right. That's it, just gotta get to then. Wow. Right, that's it, and they'll despawn. Yeah, two two sort of just keep spawning by the way. So you just gotta quickly push through as fast as you can. Like I say you can just lobby try and lob a flash and get there quickly, but it's a little bit safer if you just try and pick them all off like that. Probably not faster. <laughs> but I don't want to have to keep retrying. Right, so here they come. Right, so we've got plenty of grenades, sort of. Plenty of crossbow guys. There's more ammo over here. We got an explosive barrel there. Some items. I'm going to use that to my advantage, actually. Wow. Really. Right, one more time. Yeah, each time you do this, it should kill all the enemies that are currently spawned in. Right, so one more time. Got any flashbangs? I've got one there. Wow. Loads. Alright. Oh, I'm not taking any chances here. Wow, another one. Okay. All right, come on, come on, do this. Oh, are you joking? Oh, I was going to keep moving here. Yeah, because, um, yes. Sorted. Yeah, I did want to save him hand grenades for um, the boss, but never mind. The boss is actually not too bad because um, obviously you've just got him to focus on. And I've got all these healing items to use. Uh, and obviously, you know when, you've, you'll know when you've got a window because uh, the boss, he'll stop, he'll attack you and then you've got a window to heal. The thing is when you've got so many enemies, you may not even get a chance to heal. And if you can, you want to try and hit him in his back, this guy. Because that's his weak point. Yeah, try and hit him in his back. Have I got any grenades left? Oh, I've got four grenades left. Wow. Okay, that's a waste of time. Well, if I can knock him down, oh, it's when you. Can I use my laser yet? Yeah, Unable to use. Yeah, every time you use this, it'll knock him down, by the way. Um, I can't use it just yet. Right, I'm going to heal now. Just to be on the safe side. Okay, we're good. Quick, before he attacks. 
There we go. Right into his weak point. If he gets weak point, he probably takes like double damage. Most enemies, when you hit the weak point, take like double damage like that. The head. Headshot is normally like 50% more, and the weak points like 200% more. Okay, reloaded. Oh. Right, it's doing this mad, mad combo. Finished. There we go, right, weak point again. Oh, I'm going to reload, uh, heal, I mean. Yeah, shoot him in his leg. You know, if you remember where we where I was knifing him. Yeah, shoot him in his leg. Oh, he's reloaded. Alright, let's just let um, him have his fit. Right, I don't think I'm going to get a chance to cast this in time. Well, did I just knock him down in time? Where is he? No, okay, that's a waste of time. Right, hopefully this is going to be the one. Is he dead? Ah, I got him. I think. Oh, I thought he was about to hit me then. The next target is home, mate. I'm off. I'm off to find the Mega My Seat. Just got to kill Miranda and we're done. Figure that out later. Focus on the plan. I found it. It's the Megamycete. Captain, I have eyes on Miranda at the ceremony site. Keep your distance. Do not move until I give you. Right. So just got run, run ahead now. Kill uh, Miranda, and uh, shouldn't, that shouldn't take too long. Only a few minutes. We didn't expect Miranda to act so soon. But I didn't really die, as Chris. It's quite. This is perhaps quite a difficult platinum, I guess. It's it's more difficult than Resident Evil 3, I think. Well, I don't, I don't know. Resident Evil 3, it's um, it's the last boss is very hard on Inferno, but it's a. This just have it does have some tricky moments. Resident Evil 3 only really has one, and that's the last boss. And yes, it's very difficult, but this has quite a few moments like that. Right, so just got to wait for um. Ethan to realise how cold it is. Oh, any fish? Can I see with my reflection? No, I don't think so. Wow, I feel like I'm playing Death Stranding. Where's some BB? BB, okay. Ah, BB, could, Rose could fill in for BB, right? Let's get a little orange container for her. Right, it's going to kill Miranda. Right, here we are, awake in the juke. Right, so, um, go. where's that? That's the first aid kit I'll take. Right, and I'm going to heal right now. Right, my juke. Yeah, let me just sell some stuff, mate, and then I'm going to go and kill the boss.
Wow, got a lot of stuff to sell. Wow, we're good. Well, I've got half a million. It's not too bad, is it? Why am I looking at its belly? Why is that in the middle of my camera? Right, let's make a save here. Two hour oh one. Right, let's do it. Last boss. Locked and loaded, ready to rock and roll. It's got so kill him, pop the trophies, quickly reload that safe point, and craft the magnum ammo. Uh, the rocket pistol ammo, I mean. Yeah, see, so you don't really need the stake. The Magnum, the Wolf's Bane is fine. You don't need the stake. Right, so I'm just going to never stop. Wow. I'm trying to go for headshots, but I probably shouldn't. Because I'm... Not very good. You understand the level of Not How can you deny me? Right, where's she going? Why the hell can't you realize Rose is my goddamn kid, not yours? Save me from the pits of despair. It granted me this splendid power. Yeah, right. All it's done is drive me nuts. Nice try, Miranda. Hold still. No, you stay still. Great mega mice. Hear my <laughs> right, by flashbanger, it should knock her out of this face. Now, Mr. Winters, I think it's time you left things in my hands. Right, and then she always summons yellow orb when she comes out of it. Right, so let's reload while we're waiting. Manifest at last. Where's she going? Psycho. Your time is up. Now die. <gasps> Curse this round shadow edge. <laughs> well. That was quick. None shall interfere in my grand designs. <gasps> Right, it's taking quite a lot to kill her. Ah, there we go. There we go. It's probably a similar time it takes for the stake. Right, now three hits. Wait till she gets really close. That's one. Two, and... Uh, You're dead. Right, so that's going to be all the endings. Rocket pistol unlocked. Alright, so all we've got to do now is just reload that safe and uh, pop that last one. So, 2 hours 04, dash and dad. Hand cannon, PZ, rocket pistol. Wow, 20,000. Going to have so much CP now. I'm going to make a save for that. What's the bonuses? Um, extra content shop. What do we need to buy? Um, where is it? Yeah, rocket pistol. We need to buy this. That's it. We just need to buy that. And um, load that game back up. And it should be there to buy. Get Rose back from, from Miranda. 
yeah I'm just gonna buy the rocket pistol now and then the recipe will be available to buy and then we'll buy it and craft it and we're all good done wow yeah I thought I'd be doing that so much so much quicker it took way too long It's done now, I guess it's done. So um I gotta go. Alright, so um yeah, uh where is it? The rocket pistol. So that one, yeah. So buy that, then the recipe becomes there we go, rocket pistol ammo. Right, now uh there we go, Art Sun, and they just craft this. There we go, Tinkerer and the Platinum Trophy. Yeah, I want the Duke. Nice image to have the Duke in my Platinum Trophy screenshot. Right, that's it, guys. Ethan Winters. Yeah, so that's probably taken just an, about 8 hours 50, I think. Wow, I thought it would be done so much quicker. Um, let's just look at my trophies. Yeah, so look at my order. So, obviously... This is the order I earned them in. Oh no, it's about um, oh seven hours fifty or something, I think. Oh yeah, it's not going to be too bad. Seven hours fifty or something. Yeah, so that's the order. Got them all in. Right, yeah, so I think I should have done most notes last, I don't know, but um, yeah, so that's it guys, yeah, Platinum Trophy, I know Resident Evil. Yeah, so um, yeah, so that's it guys, Platinum Speedrun, hope you liked it, hope it helped if you've been trying to follow along, like I say, I've got loads of other guides for this, like beginner guides, if, so if you want a bit more in-depth explanations for things and then check that out but yeah it's platinum speed one guys thanks for watching and i'll see you on the next video